get that all done. Okay, I do not see. In my list of players to give out hero points to, I'm not seeing Zach. He don't need one. No hero point. Bards don't get hero points. <laughs> well, let me just hit all the yeah. players. You know what I read on the internet today? What? That a, that a first level bard could kill a townsperson with a yo mama joke. <laughs> <laughs> Using vicious mockery. <laughs> um, Pies of Con uh, games go on Thursday. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's in my calendar. Today, this weekend is Gary Con, virtual Gary Con. What is it? Mm hmm. But uh, I am not participating this week. I have too much shit to do. We're doing all the heavy lifting. It's, it's only fair. Ah. <laughs> That's true. So we locked up the spider ship, right? Yes. Um, we find someone else in a. Uh, Sell or <laughs> in a compromising Are position, or is someone else showing up? <laughs> you guys want to do the fast forward version of, of introducing that yep. character? Yep. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, Poof. There. <laughs> uh, How's that? Come on, Joe. You've been here all along. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. How long have you been there? Um, <laughs> Uh, did you guys read the backstory I threw out there? Was that one okay? Or he liked it. Okay. Uh, so let's go with that. We can retcon with you. Decide to change it later. No. Um, was that supposed to read something? No. No. He said it didn't. Yeah. Um, while you guys are are in the, in this uh, obvious dungeon room, the uh, the door up north uh, opens up. This door opens up. Um, and a um, a figure walks in. Um, Picture Tim Curry from the Clue movie. Hello. <laughs> 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 I traveled the Elon Musk alone. alone. <laughs> I'm a very striking figure. Almost. Um, I strike him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, literally, almost, it? almost not quite, but almost seeming to have a glow about it. Um, must be our present thing going in. Uh, yeah. well, it looks like plate on yeah. that. <laughs> Very hard leather armor. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's going to be leather because it's got very yeah, hard leather armor. armor. <laughs> yeah. 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 That. An impressive looking longbow on his back. That's um, big. So that's what they're calling it these days. <laughs> um, um, his back is pretty impressive. He identifies himself as Cast Castiel. 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 Um, and he uh, he he he's been looking for you guys. Um, we get that a lot. <laughs> we get that a lot. <laughs> his voice when he, when he talks to you, it just you know projects perfectly. He he, he is in. And listening to him, you can tell he is a trained storyteller. You you kind of he he, he in, in a few minutes he he tells Bullshit you, artist. <laughs> he, he tells you his story and you guys just you know you, you don't realize you're saying you're listening for that long. It's been four hours we've been listening. Um, to you can do field medicine again. <laughs> <laughs> The spider, the spider is like just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Sure, the surrender thing sounded good. <laughs> I could have watched the new Justice movie this much time. <laughs> um, uh, he, he tells you he's from um, what what once was Last Wall. Uh, his parents were paladins. Um, Being the rebel that he is, he couldn't be a paladin. Good. <laughs> well, they're they're uh, they're. they're their holy avengers had some influence on him before um but but not enough to, to make him a, a um one such as they uh a couple of years ago 
the Whispering Tyrant broke out of his prison in Gallows Fire and laid waste to Last Wall, wiping out his family, everyone he knew. Um, most recently, he is he joined a um, a band of the Knights of Ozum, who were coming to Sagarak to barter for dwarvish weapons in an attempt to retake Last Wall. Okay. Um, but after a while, hanging out with Knights of Ozum, they're well, kind of stuffy. Well, while well, great guys are lawful, are lawful boring. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, Jason Bowman, it's actually pronounced Knights of Ozum. Mm -hmm. And um, well, that's wrong. Evidently, um, Jason Bowman, I, he's talking to one of the other developers, and he, and he asked, Do you know why they're called the Knights of Ozum? You know why? Because they're so awesome. <laughs> <laughs> why? You should have seen that coming. Um, Okay, so uh, growing bored with them, he heard rumors of a group of surface dwellers in the city. That were more excited. That, that <laughs> certainly was more exciting. Metal. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the uh, got one column with not a whole group of mm -hmm. columns. The Council of Regents, what is learning of another adventure, um, you know, possibly even looking to help them, like. That's awesome. They uh, went that way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they, they got some weird ideas, but they're doing good things. <laughs> <laughs> they talk about slavers and undead dragons and stuff. But, but, they talk about um, the headbags. Yeah. <laughs> so they gave him an even smaller rowboat. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which was safe now because the preacher was dead on the way there. Did, uh, did you guys keep the uh, consult the spirits filthy? I don't think so. That's a religious based thing. You have to be a certain level of, of knowledge, know. religion, nature, or occultism or something. He doesn't know. Okay. Didn't know. Uh, blind luck then. He found the island. <laughs> <laughs> um, he followed our wake. <laughs> we were all good. <laughs> well, he probably would have. Spotted the massive sea, sea monster floating dead in the water. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> that was us, yeah. Who else would it be? <laughs> um, so now he, um, he he would like to join you guys in hopes of of finding further stories to tell. What can you do? Stuff. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're in. <laughs> well, you can just pass, pass the test. That's what more than most of us can do. Yep. So what we're looking for is stuff. We started not just doing things. Can you, stuff. can you climb a wall for about an hour and a half? <laughs> oh, we wait inside. <laughs> oh, now he gets it. <laughs> I just recently blocked that. <laughs> I just finally moved that out of my Nobody's got some other stuff. To do yeah. <laughs> he, he does have a feat that lets him do stuff anytime you do anything. <laughs> no, to do stuff. We, we are going to go through this door up here. Okay, so you're basically. You fight with your bow most often, correct? Less? Yeah. yeah. We believe that the bad guys mm -hmm. are somewhere in this direction. Okay. Bad boy, bad boy. And there was a door down here. Mike was saying we want to go take care of them before we do anything else. In this room that we're close to right now? Uh, okay. I guess that, that makes sense. That. Yeah. So I remember while we were in here, there was a door. There's a door down there. Hold on. So there's there's that door. And I remember when we first came in, there was a door heading that you, direction. You guys, you guys probably came back into this room to put her in jail uh, via, yeah. via, via this door here. Right, yeah. right. Yeah, we came through that because we it was it was one of these down here. It was this one. This right here is down here is where if you guys probably can see that. Um, yeah, this is where she was. Yeah, this this room down here is where she was, right? So, 
So we know south is where they haven't been or where they don't go, right? Right. Um, okay, wait. Uh, are, okay, are you in? You're. you're are you down? I'm in that hallway right now. Yeah. Um, okay. She said, from the you from the room you guys were in over here. Yep. Um, mm -hmm. She said, to the southeast is a room that these creatures don't go don't so go in. this way here. Okay. Uh, yeah, that way. She. And basically, she does not want her around this place much, but she knows the to the to the southwest. She thinks that's where their leader. He, oh, in the southwest he, he's, area. He's doing something down there. Okay. Um, so we do have to go south. Yeah. To get to the. So should we go in this door? Um. <clears throat> okay. Come join us over here. I would love to. Okay. Go down there and then go through that. Let me that doorway. Let me get a couple of files open. All right, if you got it. Um, let us know when you're ready. Ignore it, but we've been through the main one. Actually, oh uh who's alive? How's how, how Brady doing? Yeah. He's, he's still around. Yeah. He, uh, doing better than I thought, than I thought he was going to be. Good. So, you know, he, uh, I did find out he does have, he does have lymph, uh, lymphoma in small, small intestine. So that's not good. Pretty much. So, you, you know, is that, is that, <clears throat> Something treatable, it's it could be, it's not cool. So oh. they can manage it. Um, well, the way the oncologists talk, it's not something that's going to, it's not a long term solution. He's not going to, I mean, it's pretty much, you know, basically comfortable, but six eight months, yeah. But, but you know, I could spend you know six grand for chemo, but I'm like, well, give him seven or eight months. The, the, the vet didn't give me any, any, yeah, it's not much more during a couple of weeks, right? So, and it's something that could add several years, yeah, that, yeah, there's nothing that's going to add several years, right? I did do the one, the one, um, injection that they gave him was, um, allospirinase or something that was spoken, like, kill, so kill, try to kill the cells. So, now it's just a matter of, I mean, he's eating, he's getting around, he's you know, okay, so he's on pred prednisone. You know, she's like, well, you could do this, you could do the, the half, and it's like, it's just, I mean, you see, you know, he, he's in good spirits, he's eating, he's eating, he went for a walk, so. You know, it's... So, in this room, let me check the traps, open the door. Yep. I'll bust in and then two murderers behind me. Yep. Yes, I will murder. Okay. So, this door, um, typically, how we do things, I'm kind of a tank. But these two murder things, and he's actually our biggest murderer. So it's never been proven. It's never, yeah. <laughs> court of law, it's never been proven. Um, unless he's a mage. But he's also, <laughs> he's got a utility mage. He does healing for us. He does all kinds of stuff. Is this what's army mage? Yeah, he's what's army go. mage. Um, yep. Got to be with you guys. So as far as tactics, with you being an archer, I would probably hang close to Les's character and then just shoot the crap out of. And shoot, and shoot less if he does anything. <laughs> shoot less if he does anything. <laughs> if he does anything crazy, just shoot less. That will never happen. Um, it's legit. It's legit. <laughs> we've also got some healing. <clears throat> so if one of us gets hurt pretty bad, that's typically what I do is I stop and start trying to heal people. But you can help me as well. Les also helps some, and he gives us notions every morning. Yeah, the, the, I was going to tell him, learn the first three words of color spray. And if they come out of his mouth, hit him. <laughs> <laughs> Quickly. <laughs> Yeah, the, the, the soothe spell for a bard is, is pretty the what? Pretty, the soothe spell mm -hmm. is pretty big time healing. Oh, is it? Yeah, oh, okay. yeah I have that. Okay. Soothe, making sure. Yeah, we, we used your, we used 100% of your spell list. That's what he's using. Um, let me just so, um, but yeah, I would say in the back, shoot things. Heal people. Oh, wow. Heal uh, people and then pretty much until you learn the system better, 
just spend one action around. It's actually one action every what three rounds. I'm sorry, what? If he's got the thing that allows you to the performance to keep going, is it is it every three rounds you have to renew it, or is it every four? Um. Okay. Uh, it is, so you, you have fire to courage doesn't take anything, but only gives you a plus one for plus for one round. Uh -huh. that, that's the that's the big that's the base. Of, of it. It's fire heroics. Uh, you use a cost focus, of focus point. point. Um, and you make a roll. And you make a performance check, get above 30, and they get plus two or plus three or plus three. for one round. Layer the lingering composition on two. Okay. I'll take another focus point. Um, okay. So you take two focus points to do that. And if 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 you uh, if you if you succeed you get three rounds it, 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 it plays for three rounds okay it could be the cool combat Chris yeah. is four rounds okay they got dangerously close to the so basically <laughs> i would just do the regular scene one action every couple of rounds yeah, Chris, I, guess I, would do, I would do the one action every round unless we tell you we think it's a boss fight and then do your extra stuff to give us the extra bonus and i will i will tell you guys the the main bad guy is a it's it's a severe boss. It's a boss break. It, it, this is this, this dude's several levels above you guys. So, so, him were, so ask everybody say, are you a boss? Are you a boss? Are you the boss? <laughs> and when he says, well, yes. you'll find out right away. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a big name. He tag. yells out, "I'm the boss." <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a purple worm. <laughs> <laughs> so when you do that, then we'll get with Steve and you can do everything to try and help us out big time. But until then, just your standard. Use one of your actions every round and just do your regular inspire courage and get us all plus one. And then we get three actions every round. You can either shoot two arrows at one guy, um, or you can you no, know, or you can use your double shot. Be, shoot two arrows at two different guys, but at your highest bonus. Nope. Minus two. Okay. Minus two. And yeah. I think and I think that two different guys is. If if, if you if you, have, if you have all three actions left. There's a little bit of them. So you got busted. Okay. All right, that nice girl. For for three actions, you can use triple shot. We don't have that. Oh, you didn't take that one? No. Okay. Not yet. In no. double shot, you have to you have to hit two different targets, but triple shot gives all three arrows one target, and um, two for one target, and then you can do all three actions as well. Look, I have after the penalty. Actually, the penalty goes down because you're a higher level. I'll have to, I'll have to reread it. it but if, if you penalty. boosted yourself, you're it, yeah. <laughs> you're you're not a penalty. Because you boosted. So if you're attacking one guy, you're just going to want to do regular attacks. If there's multiple guys there, your double shot is going to be better for you. Okay, open that door. Okay. I'm checking check for, check for traps. Check for traps. Yeah. See if it's locked. Yada yada yada. Disable trap. Open the lock. So one two perception. No, yeah. I'm sure there's no traps on there. You do not think it's locked. What's that? Are you not being trapped? Okay, is it locked? No. Okay. I am going to open it and step inside. And you guys be ready to go. I'm going to push the light in there. Excuse you. I'm ready in color spray. <laughs> Shoot him. Shoot him. Remember? Shoot, Shoot him. him. <laughs> that, was a, that, was, that was a test. <laughs> That's kind of like the uh, storm slap. You know, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Say color storm, you immediately stop. Yeah. <laughs> Steve, you can open the door. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we can't really open the door. What, what, what are they doing? Yeah, Steve, if you just give me DM rights, I'll go ahead and take it out. <laughs> yeah. So I step in here and ready to attack stuff. One, one thing I really do like about 
little funny is it, it, it shows that when you open a door like that, mm -hmm. no matter how high the scope, you know, when, when you say, oh, I'm going to roll scope and sneak in there, you've just flooded the light. Yeah. The light. Yeah. <laughs> if stealth is not invisible. Uh -huh. um, oh, yes, it is. Uh, you walk into, you see anything in there? Yeah, uh, I mean, there's your character scenes. <laughs> uh, the room you walk into is obviously a small laboratory <coughs> with a small closet. Yeah, you you walk in with the shield, but um, on the on the tables, come on in, Kevin. Okay, are um, you know, are various um, there's a very acrid smell in this room of the various chemicals on these workbenches, um, on the wall. Uh, right, right by Ty, or uh, right by Damien, is another one of those kind of a metal scoop coming out of a wall where like a trough or like a, it's like a trough. You, you think you could dump something in there and it would it would go to the other in, room oh, inside okay. that wall. Okay. So this is in the other room they were using that with that midnight milk or whatever stuff. Mm -hmm. So I think I piss in it. <laughs> like a giant urinal. Should I be one in the game? Yep. Come on in. One in this door next. Yeah. After you urinate. <laughs> After. <laughs> That's what I think of the midnight midnight milk. Wait for the shake. <laughs> Not with rocks though. Yes, definitely. You got more than you once. got uh, plate mail. Yeah. Yeah. So it takes us 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> it's got a fly. <laughs> you just got to take it off. You got to take it off. It's a zipper. It's another it's a zipper. It's a zipper. It's a zipper and a fly. Okay. Don't you sell Never get the button fly. <laughs> Plate mail. <laughs> I've okay. got the magnetic closures. <laughs> okay. Checking for traps on this door. 30. Yeah. Nope. You are fairly certain it's not trapped. <laughs> Well, I put a trap on. <laughs> that, that now, yeah. now I get to find it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, open the door. It depends if you better putting trap or finding <laughs> yeah. them. Well, if you put it there, you should know where it's at. I've got a bad memory. Oh, okay. <laughs> we open the door. Yeah. We open the door. Wow. Oh. I'm up. It, it, it's <laughs> almost like we're going to do this at every door. <laughs> it's almost like Not every door. Only the ones we're near we want to go through. Um, I don't open the door in. to reveal a. Uh, a small closet? The bathroom. That's like, do <laughs> like, do like, do like, <laughs> Sorry. I'll be out in a minute. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> no, I did that on purpose. So I'm still okay. It's actually full of the urinal cakes. And they put them <laughs> yeah. It's the urinal cake room. Uh, opens up to a small closet. Uh, so you I see some bedrolls stuffed in here, some kind of tattered and tattered cloaks that look like mice have been nesting in them. Okay. Okay. Storage, but not been used for room. Yeah. Right. Um, this room with the benches, can I see anything of value in here? The room you guys are oh the, the outer room, yeah. Um, the barge stuff, yeah. We got a few valuable things. <laughs> Maybe later. Roll the twenty. <laughs> I'm sorry. Really. Yeah, I know. It uh, most of, you know, there there is bottles um, and Allen bits and things with, with <laughs> residue in them, but it doesn't. Yeah, you know, unless maybe the glassware itself might be worth something. Uh, yeah, and, and it, it may well to a, uh, an alchemist. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a crafting check because I have alchemy. We think it's probably all it could be used to make the midnight milk. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Anyway, you suck. <laughs> yes. Man, that is some double sucking right there. Hey. Look at that thing. Oh, hey, hey, oh, I'm sucking. refreshing my browser. Hey, is there another fighter? He's got a plaster. <laughs> Is there another fighter one room we can join us? Can we turn it? It's like the better. We want a better let one. Let me find a 
did you bring a fighter friend with you? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Okay, test one. Let's see. Yeah. Oh, that was right in there. Loop the shotgun again. Let's go. All right. Maybe I'll tune it. Could be. Yeah, the bleed has been. Oh, no. I didn't bleed. I have seen it there since you were. Uh, yeah. I'm refreshing again. What's the bleeping, bleeping problem? <laughs> What's wrong? He has a bleeping problem. No. <laughs> Someone does. Uh, uh, kind of sure. me. Let, let me know if anybody rolled a nat 20, and I'll pull it. We'll crit card for him. Put my blood mask for him. If it goes, if it, if it's a crime against, if it's a crime against God and nature, then ah. we'll <laughs> all right, we'll keep you right. right. As <laughs> <laughs> long as you're consistent, as long as you, as long as you've got every time. Right. right. The inconsistencies we can't stand. Just way too okay. inconsistent. Uh, where are we going next? Um, back out. Um, we know that's the door to the north here is a fake door. Yes. When the door's real, there's just, it's too nothing. Right. It goes nowhere. There wasn't any other south door in this room, right? No. I'm sorry. Sure. From this room here, there was no other south door, right? So we can go on this door over yeah, here. I'm going to go check real quick. Yeah, there's nothing to do south over there. No. So yeah, we're going to go to this door. That door? Okay. I'm going to check the traps on that door. Have we found traps on the door yet? Um, not really. If it's on this door, I'm going to find it. Are you, uh, you're going to the east door here? Yep. Yes. Uh, you do not think it's traps. Okay. <laughs> like a lock? Is there anything behind it with that 38? Uh, you take off your helmet? <laughs> well, no. <laughs> um, take it off. ask you to take off your helmet, you always say no. Um, oh, wait, that's if you have a helmet on. Right. You, 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 you press your ear up against that door and you, you hear absolutely nothing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to open it. Step in. Oh, I guess. Steve. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> We're missing. He's oh. right in the Oh, okay. How could you have a new thing? You got to do it. We don't talk. We don't talk about that. <laughs> I was there first. Mike, go in. So I take a step in and I'm looking around the shield up. You, uh, the ring you step into a very, a very large open area with. Um, That's a huge room. Step in farther. Okay, I'll go in. Very large open area uh, with very high vaulted ceilings choked with with old cobwebs. Um, the urinal here. There's a stream. <laughs> sorry again. My bad again. Um, Still not sorry. Hey, Zach, uh, come on in this room and grin. Oh, you're in there. Yes, Sammy. Pay attention. To that. <laughs> where, where are the architectural elements of cathedrals where it's like a, a half pillar that goes up the wall and then uh, to the top. That, is that a flying buttress? I don't know. Um, he said no, a flying he buttress said into the side wall that just kind of has an arc and goes up against the wall and holds up. What's the, like, it's, like a, it's like a half pillar that goes up. Our then, chapel has them. Oh, well, our church up um, here, I don't know what they're called. Okay, so those. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yes, we don't um, about. There's, there's those, um, and and you know, you, you guys walk in. The the light from Damien's dancing lights are just making the shadows kind of you know. Just like so. Um, I see here. You can see tatters of, of cobweb hanging from these high 
um, vaults of the ceiling. Um, you can see chains hanging down, you know, like like possibly, you know, big lanterns or candelabras once hung there, but but had fallen down long long ago. Okay. Um, As you, okay. as you guys step, and, oh, and then like to the south, you see numerous barrels. Dibs. Um, and the, 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 the thing dripping urine right now. <laughs> um, it's up, yeah, it's probably about this high. For tall urine. Wow. <laughs> to tell people. Like, this one's facing down, though. Okay, it's a bidet. <laughs> so, like maybe a barrel. There's someone upstairs. Oh, he puts it up here. <laughs> barrel under it. Put barrel up. under it and fill the urine. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you've been doing it for a while, haven't you? <laughs> <laughs> I feel very strongly about this. You should always go before you enter the lunch. <laughs> um, <laughs> you should yell that. Not again. As <laughs> as you guys <laughs> enter the room, though, and and are there looking around. Mm -hmm. um, Some, and I probably have to do it again too. Um, <laughs> no, we can do it. Just let us know. We'll take care. Right, of it. we'll take care of it. Right. For the record, it's not dancing light. It's just the light spell of nature. I thought, I thought it was dancing light. No, the, the uh, reason I told I told Mike about it is because dancing lights a cantrip you have to cast every round in combat. I'm not spending time doing that. With the light spell of mage hand. As soon as there's combat, I just stop mage hand, which falls to the ground there. Um, okay, not cool. Like, uh, as you guys can, what? what the heck? Kind, kind, of, kind uh, of nebulous forms start rising up from some of the barrels. Um, hey, babe. <laughs> <laughs> you can have it. <laughs> dude, re relax. We'll be back to town soon enough, dude. <laughs> hey, baby, you working? They're, they're it's the of, first. <laughs> It's the first bipedal female here. Dibs! <laughs> <laughs> uh, they, they kind of seem to coalesce above above these barrels. They're well, the snake-like tendrils and they're ooh, that are kind of like hair are kind of whipping around like in a wind that you can't feel. Maybe not dibs. Can I undibs? <laughs> no. And they're their hands and tendrils that are also just kind of like like twitching and uh, and um and, and almost like they're undulating you know in a wind you can't feel as well um they're, they're real for an issue. <laughs> how, how you know oh, great we got to fight some pea dryads we're going to put up the uh, block when okay. i'm ready so <laughs> well, let, let, let me get my character sheet to, up real quick wait and took off your guy well for a niche huh a niche one wants I hate it. I may have made this character shoot a lot of that, so I need this. that. Okay, hold on. Click such as one to just select it. There we go. Okay. You can click off of it. Uh, yeah, he hasn't and put the thing on. Wait, wait, wait for him to put that up. Hang on. Because once he does, that's initiative. Hold on, I'll be right back. Is whatever. Oh, it's already up there. there. It is there. Okay. So that's okay, so now you can click that. Okay. Uh, what? We won. Hold up. Oh, that's for. Oh, yeah. All right. Good. 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 Okay. We'll take the first one, and it's not putting it up there, so I did something wrong with the uh, with the tracker. You know what? I probably just pulled it off mine and changed the name or something like that. Oh, that might be it. Yeah. Is there everybody up there? Not Did yet. he have his icon highlighted? Yeah. Look at that roll, buddy. Um, put that there. The three things. Yours didn't show up either on the board. Mine? No. Uh, uh, Mike. Damn, son. Yours is on. Okay, so go into the empty. Okay, there's nothing on there that says the character name other than what I text I put in there. Okay, here's it. Space, or is that something funky up to the beginning of it or something? Uh, 
may not be a space between Are you the about number and drag. Uh, uh, no, hold on. Yeah, literally, I, I cut and pasted mine to his. I just changed the, the name. But mine's not working either. Same. Uh, ampersand, bracket, tracker, pose bracket. Uh, Break, loser. We didn't have the thing done right, left, right. We had the what? I didn't have anything clicked right. So once I click, so it's got all this stuff showing up. Right. Then it shows up. Yeah. So I thought once you just clicked it, you were fine. But yeah. So he did the same thing I did. So um, tell you what, cancel that. We'll use your role you've got. Um, so click on your guy. So when we start a fight, click on your guy. With that stuff still up there, hit this. Excuse me. Okay. Now you're in there. Scroll down this list, grab that, and drag it down. So there you are. Number. So oh, then we'll go back to chat and go whatever the first thing was that you rolled. Because I, got, I think it was like a 41 point something. Do I need to name his token too? Did that help? Uh, it doesn't. It, it helps us, but it doesn't really change that or anything. But I'll put your macro. Just throw it on there. And after in it, in it. What's that too? Let me find it. So the same changes. Take it off of the bar here, so it's not down here. Take it off the bar. It's off. Okay. Now you won't see it unless you click on your guy, and it's right That's there. Exactly. So you can't hit it without being your token selected. <coughs> That's smart. That's how I do it. <laughs> Why do you do it that way? Because that smart. Because that's smart. <laughs> um, okay, I'm going to do the same thing. So click over here. The three, the Is three everybody on the initial thing now? Uh, everyone's on there. Um, I think Zach yeah. might need to be edited with a number. Yeah, you need to change yours to click that. Can change it to go ahead and change the exact number for him. No, he's, he's changing right now. Oh, you, you guys can do it? Yeah. No, you can change your own number. Okay, it's good. Go ahead and sort it okay. now. Put three okay. Uh, there. Okay. Wow. You are no. the nope. uh, start. Click on this and then Sorry. scroll down there. Show us what the actual. Save, save, and then, and then get rid of that check. And you can never hit it again without oh, like your token. <laughs> Sounds like a challenge. I'll mark, write a macro to select my icon. <laughs> so then, so now it's not there, but then when you select your guy, like click on your guy, but then it shows up right here. Okay. So then you can click the button there. Okay. So. Okay. Um, Zach's up. You're up first, man. You're fast. Um, we did sneak up on him, you guys. He did sneak. <laughs> so um, I'll probably start each round somewhat out by doing the one action. action to start your singing. So we all get a plus one. Hey, there's four of these women in the uh, initiative. I only see two. I see four. You see four? Yeah. Okay. Well, that, that they're, they're, they're the final one. I see four because I control his character too in case there's an issue. Okay. And his character is Dr. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, <laughs> my my will here shortly. <laughs> so I can support you. <laughs> so and all these guys, all these guys, and all these guys. And then you can either attack. You can't you can't open the door. So it's, it's, it's a great divider of people. Attack, <laughs> you double strike and send an arrow at each one of these, whichever you want. The penalty, or no, it, like it's the double, like the last one you were saying. Like the, the double strike is that like one action, or is that two? It's two. So two that's action. final two actions. 
Okay. Either one, you do two attacks or you do the double strike. Each one is going to be your final two actions. Okay. There's not a big difference. It's either you get a minus two at each one or you get a zero at one and a minus five at the other. So uh, okay. just choose one. So then you go to attack. Mix and match. Well, you could, you, you could shoot full attack at one and then minus five at, at that same one. Yeah, yeah, that, that is the difference. If you do the zero and negative five, you can shoot both arrows at the same one. If you're going to do the negative two at each arrow, then they have to go to the different people. Unless you just whine. You have 40 cues from? Unless you whine and, <laughs> and tell Steve that you want to serve the same person. I'll probably just I didn't think you were. It didn't sound like you were. No. I didn't say anything that's in your voice, so you take it too long. I was just making sure that the second one, the double attack. Okay. Okay. So okay. quick attack. And then use the drop down. Did you do a performance? Longo double. Yes. First, okay. You a single performance, okay. and then he's doing a double shot. So you're at a, you're at plus one. So all of us are at plus one from what mm -hmm. the macros are going to say. So your your double shot arrows are at minus one, minus one. Right. Mm -hmm. And who are you shooting at? The closest uh, the, two. Yeah. He's doing a double shot, so it has to be different. So it's the closest two. My macros will be correct so, because uh, Tom sneaks away. This, this one and this one. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So that's trying to rub it in. Right? <laughs> it's just so unlike you, John. <laughs> you know, you um. It's a lot of character. Your song just fills the air, inspiring your comrades. Just pull back to your ear for a second, shoot, and you know, a perfect later, you send another arrow. Okay. Was it twenty nine or twenty six hit? Uh, I believe. That will hit uh, both of them. Wow. So first one gets 12 damage, second one gets 15 damage. You drop an arrow on each one. This has gotten so high school now. <laughs> you tie. You were out. Go back out to the original conversation. Okay. Okay, hold it down. Um you the conversation. Not to be outdone, you're going to sing. Oh, <laughs> take that. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, I'll show you how to sing. I am going to move to right there. Yeah. Well, that's one action. Second action, I'm going to intimidate the chick next to me. Good. Don can see, Don can see three now. He's almost full. <laughs> so it's a 35 feet it. Oh, I can see. Oh, I can see. <clears throat> what would you get, Mike? 35. 35. Uh, crit success. So she's at negative two. I'm sorry, right. which which one did you? The one next to me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I didn't get the other so, so then my last attack effectively is going to be a plus three. If I'm doing this in an hour, I'm just going to take it anyway. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm going to do a single swing at her. So a 33 to hit. Uh, not quite a crit. Okay, so 11 points of damage. And oh, wait I'm a minute. And I'm done. Is a crit because of, because you frightened her. No, no, no. The 33 was, I only got a 30 to hit. Oh, you, that, you, you added, added it. All I, I added all that in the mind. Okay, I'm sorry. How much was the damage? 11? The one wouldn't, or is it different with the damage too? The damage, you don't affect the damage. Okay. You just affect the attack. Uh, no, he does. Oh, does, does this, uh, does this plus seem... one, his inspired courage is plus one to attack, damage, and saves versus fear. Okay, so 12 damage and 11 fear. Right here. And I'll just yeah. <laughs> um, you gotta ask him soon. That, that would have been <laughs> one more each on his arrows, too, right? Yes. Yeah, about that. I didn't. <clears throat> <laughs> I didn't put that in there because I used this. Okay, uh, Bill here. Okay, I'm gonna rage. Oh sure, get upset. He's got dark vision. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling unheard right now. <laughs> so I want to go up here and get this one and go down and get the other. Yeah. Under there. I must. When I throw it, actually, I'm gonna swing it. 
purpose. Sometimes I have trouble communicating. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you guess rang this. Um, that will crit. I think maybe you just hit the yeah, I hit great the, sword button instead of the first yeah, attack button. Yeah. You hit that one for the damage. Yeah, I, I did that. Yeah. Okay, which okay, six to fit <laughs> plus, plus thirteen. 66 plus 13. Yeah. Yep. Uh, plus one. 79. 80. Yeah. I think you got her attention. I think I did. She's not going to thank you for that. Or she will. So she will. And, and, and she's, she, she's kind of floating over the air. Oh, yeah. You know, off the You just see her whole body just, you know, like <laughs> almost convulse as you, as you hit, hit her. Is that all three interactions? Yep, that was it. There you go. Oh, man. Okay. Now let's see what this one does. One second to figure out my range on you. Thank you. Um, so those tender like fingers kind of um, start making a pattern in the air. Which okay, one is this? The one. Well, Don doesn't know about her yet. <laughs> oh, yeah, I <laughs> <laughs> The secret's out. Um, uh, you see those tender like fingers begin to kind of interweave as she casts a spell on Bale Fear. Which one's casting the spell? The one way down south. One of the two, one of the two way down south. Um, she casts confusion, so he needs to make a will save. Okay, good save. He kind of does. He's like that at the end. Ooh. Oh wow, you grit the key. Um she and does you told her where she could stick it. Right. I will next time. <laughs> and she's gonna kind of drift over to here. That'll be her turn. She's a drifter. Mm -hmm. Oops. Oops, there, there was one further south. I'm sorry. Poor Don couldn't see. I see you. There he is. I see you guys. Come on. Wow. Okay, she's going to. That one is going to cast. Something, something horrifying begins to materialize alongside the field here. Damien, go away. <laughs> <laughs> another, another will say from the field here. Oh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is almost like pretty late night. It's Sunday night. Yeah. 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 Something horrifying just starts to take shape. Something out of your worst dreams. Then then you you just kind of snarl at it and it it, it decides. You. <laughs> I, I don't know how that goes. Right. Uh, Damien, approach this uh, woman and the one you can see. <laughs> one you can see. see clearly. <laughs> the easy one that everyone can see. Using my plus two greater striking uh, cookery with fire on it. And she's easy to hit now. She's, uh, she's scared. Scared one. No, oh, she's scared two. Scared two. I've really scared her. Yeah, scared, scared okay, her so well. 28 hit her? Yes. Really? Okay. Uh, so 15 points of damage with the first one. The second one, 41 would be critical, right? Yep. I rolled uh, max damage. <laughs> yeah. Uh, 26 doubled is. Uh, Let's see, 52. So I'm doing Bale Fear type damage. 
She's also uh, persistent bleeding and persistently on fire. Let me see if she. Uh, doesn't say she's a moving unit bleed. Seem, does not seem like something that should bleed, but she can. <laughs> Even if it's icker or whatever. It's icky. Icky. <laughs> or is that precision? Icky or damage? It is uh, persistent. It persists. Okay, but it's not for precision. Damage um, might be persistent better. Is that all three of your actions? Actually, persistent um, precision. Damage. Well, it's not precision. That's not a rogue. So that is all three of my actions. I move in double slice. Okay. Le less from a pal, and you're on the air. All right. Uh, first time. Uh, long time listener. <laughs> long time listener. First time caller. Uh, I'm first going to do a nature check. I want to determine are these fey? I'm doing a knowledge nature to determine if these are fey creatures. Um, ooh, cold iron cookeries. If they're fey. They're not fey. Uh, no cold iron cookeries. <laughs> All right. Now, this thing that I'm standing next to right here, this is a cage, right? These are bars. This isn't a solid wall that I'm standing next to. Yeah. Yes, they're bars. It, 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 it's 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 a low bar like they probably group barrels in there oh okay so it's like a uh, a, 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 a gathering area okay okay so but it's but i can do what i want to do which is i want to let's hold on what with your, with your nature check yeah you can identify them are i can't they, identify them what are they they are animate dreams um they are Ooh. they are literally creatures from the the, 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 rel the realm of dreams the conscious mind goes when you sleep um sometimes when people wake they bring something back with them and um, you, <laughs> that happened to me a lot in junior high <laughs> you think the concentration of of the mid midnight milk filled with dream spider venom maybe they're kind of been conjured by it so do uh as part of that do are they real or are they dream stuff they are real in this plane she's waiting okay. <laughs> so. all right then i am going to use one action to run up to this little cart area as uh, far as i can go anyway and i am going to shoot a cone of cold in such a way as to avoid uh this guy right here and get these two that i've just driven a line through here Okay, so here comes my corner call. Time to pay the piper. Yeah. Eric, I'm shooting that in the All right, I need a uh, basic reef from these fellows. Uh, okay, um, top one first. Ooh, just barely made it. Success, you take half. Okay, and the second one? Uh, he takes full. So half of 41 is 20. So the first one takes 20. The second one takes uh, 41. I did not heighten this, so. I was going to. Well, you I did. 41. I decided against it. 41, yeah, on the second one. Okay, uh, are you... Uh, do, do they look like they were affected by the cold or are they yeah, immune to it or okay you, you you get a good look at them you realize what they are um you you, you gather arcane energies around you shoot a, a blistering cone of cold at them mm -hmm. um yeah they're they're bluish semi-incorporeal skin it's just close. crusted in in frost crystals nice they, um they kind of let out a a disturbing wailing noise as you do that through them. Okay. That's my three. <laughs> okay, this one is going to reach out, touch someone, uh huh, with its weird tendril. It's nudely appendage. Which one are we talking about? Well, that right one next to the tie. 
or Damien, well, anti. Um, he'll try Damien first since he did Belkerish damage. <laughs> so there are drawbacks to being like seven like this. Yeah, that yep. Sense. Um, he'll try for a second attack. Who that on? Miss, miss horribly. Um, uh, critical miss. Does that trigger a reaction? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. But good to know. We just want to make fun of him. We're going to make fun of him. And actually, this probably should have been my first action. It, Too late. It's it's face just kind of peeled back into a, into a screen. Undibs, undibs. <laughs> so undibs. So undibs. <laughs> it was on a night like this 10 years ago. <laughs> it screams in your face and tries to intimidate you, but you are made of critical failure there too. You are made of stronger stuff. It is it is uh, intimidated itself. Yeah. <laughs> it, you laugh at it and makes it, you make it feel bad. Hold on. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I, that's its three actions, right? Yep. It takes 16 points of damage, eight lead and Holy eight fire. Damn, good. son. 16 points of damage? 16 points of more damage. Eight lead, eight fire, and it can roll a, a check to see if it stops bleeding. But we're not going to let it. No. No, it does not. <laughs> Yeah, what do you do? 10 higher or 15 uh, higher? 15 or higher to stop. Moving. Unless it, it can spend an action trying to do something, doing something to put it on uh, to give it a better roll. And it does stop after one minute, regardless. Mm -hmm. so. <laughs> one minute? One minute. Well, be, oh, because second edition has plotting. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you keep this up, that's 160 points. <laughs> no. no. Oh. <laughs> Of salamander just bleeding out. <laughs> what are the odds of him keeping this up? <laughs> okay, the one next to the like Oh, it's bleeding. <laughs> <laughs> so kind of... no, no. How many hit points have you been down for? <laughs> the, the, one, the one that just <laughs> spurted out blood, you can tell she is she almost. Okay. <laughs> she was burdened. She's seen better days. Don't. Don't do anything that requires more than one action. <laughs> um, okay, it's going to try and cast fear on Bill here because she likes the poetry of it. Um, can I get a will save? Will save. Uh, sure, you, you can. You do have plus one for this from the entire turn. Yep. Let's see. Let's see. If you oh, if you use well, his well, plus one, one, do I get? No, if you use his plus one and you use your tattoo, then you're exactly what you need. No, oh. yes, <clears throat> but I'll do. Okay, thank so you, Savior. So you, it, a chill goes up your spine for a second, but you you fight it down. Um, <laughs> he, he's singing "I Have a Tiger," so that kind of. <laughs> <laughs> it's like I got this. Uh, Okay, it's gonna claw at you with its nightmare timbers. Twenty six missiles. Misses. Okay, that will be it. Yeah, it will be. Two more. Castiel is up again. Yeah, okay. Um. Sorry. Dang. Okay, so you got two more actions. I'm gonna shoot at this. Yes. Shoot that one twice, or you're gonna do the double shot and shoot one and one. I guess I'll do the double and one and one. one. Okay. I said, uh, this one, this one up here is very obviously on its last tender. <laughs> so yeah, one and one. So one, 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 one. Yeah, I, I, I would not waste a two action activity on her. <laughs> so now we're actually that first one I miss. 23 hitter, that first one will miss. Even though she's uh frightened oh, or whatever. Wait, 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 wait. She's, she's still frightened one that just hits her. Okay. And then plus don't I have a plus you one? Get a plus one that you're adding yourself, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. You definitely hit, and you get so, damage in there. Uh, 16, 16, 16 plus one. Is your 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 arrow sinks almost to the fletching in her chest, and she just kind of yeah. discorporates, and the arrow clatters to the ground. Nice job, dude. 
Way to just go. And the other one was at 36. Ooh, day. wait. Was that a berm? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, two people did damage to her. Oh, okay, okay. You, you hit her once. Right? Yes, hit her okay, once. yeah. <laughs> And then, yeah, 36. 36 to hit. Plus one. For the bottom one, is that a crit? 37 to hit? Oh, there'll be a crit. Which right? one of the bottom? The bottom, uh, bottom one? The one it's next to the hill here. One, one next to the hill here? Yeah. Okay, so yeah. Does the, the, the oh. additional damage to the crit doesn't get doubled, right? Uh, additional damage does not. So it's 43. That's 43. That was a solid arrow, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That one, the arrow actually <laughs> goes completely through. Okay, <laughs> there, there's a berm. That's, that's actually yeah. a berm. So 21. That was a berm, yeah. Is that a legit berm? One was. plus three for the critical. Who, who got it? Yeah. Oh, so the, wait, wait. Yeah, Don, yeah. did you get that? Doubled 42 plus three, 25 points. You know what? What less? Who got that berm? Uh, Zach, it, Zach. Uh, Zach got the berm. On his one vector bail. First night. Yeah. yeah nice. You're, you're pulled back for a swing, and all of a sudden, the arrow just comes to the side. <laughs> literally, seems to go right through her. Yeah. And I'm all about helping new guys out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Don't let it happen again. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let it happen. Yeah. Nice job, dude. Yeah. Is that some room? Oh, you're actually. Man, that barely grazed yeah, was high sweet. and bailed for to get to her from that angle. <laughs> <laughs> So was that only one? Was three. Was that was three actions. You sang and then, and then double and, shot. Yeah. Excellent job. Yeah. Yes. Two kills, one round. My turn? Uh, uh, tie. Yes. Yeah, tie. Oh, it's tie. Okay. Sorry. <clears throat> I'm getting right here. You guys, I'm getting attention. You guys can even kill them. <laughs> I tried to do that once. Okay, so that's one action to get there. I'm going to take my second action to intimidate the chick to the left of me. And then I'm going to swing at her once. What? 41 on intimidation. Oh, great. So the beating ends. Okay. You said this is like a short gate type thing? These, these bars here? You mean hop over them? Um, yeah, you, 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 yeah, I, I wouldn't even make you roll an acrobatic check, but you know, people like you guys, you, you can hop over them, no problem. So, I critted her. Yeah, I critted her. Oh, you, you crit, you, you crit, hit her as well? Yeah. So that's 26 plus 3, 29 points. If I scared her, I didn't stab her, then poked her. Oh, I'm sorry. 30 points of damage. Thank you. Now you sent a bard singing Eye of the Tiger. <laughs> no, <I know>. <laughs> <laughs> you just have to get used to it. Is that all your action? Yep, I'm done. Built here. All right. I'm going to move to here. I'm going to swing at this lady and do my full power attack. That's no lady. Techno moon. <laughs> and she's quite. Damn. Uh, plus one for the inspire and uh, short for the armor class. Too. Yeah, that's a crit. Yep. <laughs> a so 58 plus nine. Your, your sword literally just slices. Ooh, is that a burn for me? Yeah. <laughs> too much damage. <laughs> Oh, I yeah, got one too much damage. <laughs> too much damage. You did more than half of the damage. <laughs> I just had that one round. Yeah. That's all for me. Did like 100 points of damage, but it's not only one other person touched me. Okay. Uh, give me a minute here to get some other character sheets up. We'll give you two minutes. Less might not, but the rest of us yeah. will. Yeah, I've had it with that. <laughs> you and your this character sheet. All right, Zach, you're logged in the big book of Erms. Basically, if you kill her, you get 
spill something when one other person has done most of the work. It's called a burn because we used to have a guy that played with us and he specialized <laughs> in doing that. Like he wakes up. Some edge user that just hung back and then when he was almost dead, edge was just doing that. So anytime someone does something like that, when they get a burn and sack for it, I'd like, oh, let's get on the game. Of all the games we played. I forgot to put the whole round game. thing yep. in there. Um, so where are we at in the, in the turn order? Uh, this is. Uh, Okay. Well, she's in the middle of this uh, round. round. Three. Um, it's round because well, it's round two right now. It will be round three. Okay, so ink, ink is the okay. bottom of the round. Right. Okay. Um, ink I, is at the bottom of right. the round. I don't want to do anything that's going to uh, mess up the tracker. So right. I'm going to wait until after. Right. Ink. Okay. Uh, so did, you, did you go yet, Kevin? Yes, I'm done. Kevin destroyed that one. Yeah. Way. So the last surviving one right now is up. Okay. Uh, she jumped any of her spells are gonna do anything. Um, All right. I'm going to attack Ty. Not knowing, how, not knowing how useful that's going to be. It has actually helped. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow, I have to use my shield block to make that one. Miss. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that almost hurt me. <laughs> <laughs> that almost hit. Let me know more of she that. She's satisfied that Ty looks kind of confused when she almost got him. And then she's going to like drift over to these barrels. She's going, she's for, reinforce she's going for reinforcement. Damien. Well, I wasn't at the wind with her, but uh, I guess I'm here to oh, go do something with her. <laughs> we'll get some ideas. Go do something with her. her. Yeah, we'll get some <laughs> remember, remember, you called dibs. So. You did call dibs, yes. Yeah. We haven't allowed you to undo mm, it. Nope. So. Mm -hmm. so if you're so adamant about calling dibs, yeah, be careful calling dibs next time. Mm -hmm. So I'll cover that way. Right. Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> no, no, I got to do it. Those red boxes don't help much. Those red boxes do not. I missed it. I uh, ran over there, cast Ray of Frost, and missed it. And no, that no, was three actually. Now we got a frosty barrel. Frosty cold. <laughs> that, that, that is how you serve me that milk. Yeah, but aren't they full of pee? What do we need frosty cold oh, pee yeah, for? Just, just the last These one. aren't. <laughs> oh, oh, these barrels are different. They probably have whiskey and, and tulips in them. <laughs> no, the ones being filled up right now, that one has pee in it. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing says refreshing like a glass of frosty cold pee. <laughs> That's the special blend. That's the special Thank you, up. Yep. All right, uh, I am going to do uh, exactly what uh, Vermithrell would have wanted and shoot a magic missile at the creature. Just one? Uh, no, a uh, bunch. So I'm going to, so the, yeah, so I'm going to shoot uh, six. I'm not heightening this. So it's, it's six uh, things. So I need to shoot five more D4s. Oh, no momento. So it's five points plus. 20, so 25 points of magic missile damage as six missiles come flying out of my hand into her. Does the bard add to that? <coughs> um, or is it just weapon? It, well, no, hold on, hold on. This is an attack action? This is not. This is not. No, no, no. Okay. So I'm, I'm sorry, Wes. How, how much total? 25. Uh, 25. Okay, though. This dark chamber lights up briefly as five bolts of bluish white light kind of intertwine and shoot on, through the room. And, it's, and, and they all, all the gleams slam into, in, into this thing. This is the top of round three. Okay. Um, okay, give me one minute. Because that would be 10 rounds. A couple of, <laughs> <laughs> a couple of things are going to happen. Um, <laughs> We're fine, but less is one of the problems. Right. Oh, 
Pusti vaari. Ja nahku o. Remember, these guys have 158 points. It's two ounces. <laughs> one if you've got. No, yeah, I, yeah, I know. If you got a bail here, next, so <laughs> takes one. Right. It takes three for me. It's, it's more efficient that way. I don't get touched while I'm tapping, but it just takes me four rounds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That last hey, you almost hit me. <laughs> he was shocked. Son of a. What the? Yeah. Hey, you almost got me. Ding! What, what was that? <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> okay uh, Cassio, behind you, the uh, door uh -oh. suddenly flies open. Didn't they stop and check the traps first? <laughs> That's the smart thing to do. Like, Damn, we got one of those fake doors. <laughs> Didn't we put out the clothes for cleaning sign? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> You've got some that looks like horse body. <laughs> You've got some trouble up there, dude. That's a much better host looking body than what you were fighting. And you also hear something thundering down the hallway here uh, off to your right. Nah. Um, There's still a comb dibs on that. <laughs> so we can hear stuff up north. The, the, uh, the door behind you just just flew open, and you can... see what looks <laughs> but, like the door. <laughs> what looks like an, an elf woman, but with kind of gray, light grayish purple skin tone. That's not, that's um, it's kind of dead. No, drought. Oh, um, these are nice elves. You should kill them on sight. Oh yeah. Yeah, and you, you know, you know, it's here behind you, and you can hear looking down, looking through that open doorway that you guys just came through. Something big is coming down that hallway. Something wicked this way coming from the door we came in. Yeah. Okay. So I'll go cover this door. You go cover those doors, and then let him finish off the. Chick you down finish off the chick down here. Okay. Here we go. You're up, uh, you don't want to stay there. Yeah, I was gonna say something's huge coming through here, and there's yeah, you want to get away. What you can see us, you heard us all yell, and you know some of us are coming your direction. So, so like if you stood right there, yeah, if you just picked a safe spot down here, you could see out of both directions and shoot both directions, but. Yeah, you've so got it is diagonal like one step. The first diagonal is one step, and then if you do another diagonal, it costs, it costs two points to move. But that yes. one diagonal. But it's an action either way. If you just yeah. move there, it's an action. <clears throat> so, like, would down here be advisable? Just like right below the dancing light or whatever? One of the guys at Paizo. If you go right there, right here, he said, then you can still game, see out both doors. They so just start shooting the machine. Machine. Either direction. So, <laughs> I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna come up. I'm gonna come up and get in their way. So here, or here, right there, be good. You keep them in the doorway without letting them get in the. So move. You need to sing for us. Sing. So you got one more action. So I fire a single arrow at someone you can see. Actually, that's the only two you can see. I just fire so a single the, arrow. The purplish, grayish. Yeah, the drow. The drow. Yeah, drow. Shoot, shoot her. All right. So it's attack, uh, and then it's just longbow. Old oh, drow stuck. Step one. No, all of them. <laughs> <laughs> I said it right. Do you know all of them? <laughs> what? Do you know all of them? Yeah. yeah. 36 okay. plus one, 37. So 37 to hit the drown. Oh. Uh, uh, crit. Crit. Of course. So, so 26 plus nine plus one. 26 plus 10. Yeah, 36. 36. So 36 with that arrow. 
total points of damage. Okay, yeah, she, you know, she flings the door open, like a few steps back, <laughs> and, and he, 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 he's kind of like, what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> so, yell out, message for you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, shake your head and close. <laughs> 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 There's not the day for that method. <laughs> she noped out of that one. That's it. Just not, not, not received or acknowledged. Is that all the three, three interactions back? Uh, yeah, I moved. Yeah, and moved, saying, and uh, oh, shot back. Shot. 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 Hey, Les? Yeah. Yeah, so I get I, it. I get it. I mean, are you unwilling then? I, I think so. <laughs> Okay, so I get here, I can easily see. All right, calls. your call, bud. Okay, where, where are you at? Yeah. So when Ty gets here, he's running towards the north door. You hear some expletives come out of his mouth. Oh, shit! And he's like, get up here now. And he changes and moves hey, over really. <laughs> to this door. Oh, you're going to go to that door. Okay. So I'm coming to this door here then. Les, if you get to here and cast it, you can get both uh, Ty and me. Uh, no, I can only do one person. I thought it was a range. Oh. Uh, one creature. <laughs> I thought it was a range. Okay. So so I get to there, so that's two move actions. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try and scare that big old honking scary thing. Okay. <laughs> Like a giant, or what is that? I don't know what it is, but it looks really nasty. And but it's not going to be there long. <laughs> yeah, well. But yeah, Don, I don't, I don't want to follow you into battle. Okay. Because I'll be too close to whatever the freak's coming up behind us. Um, <laughs> um, we'll succeed, but not, not correct. Okay. So it's kind of scary. I will cut your kneecaps off if you come down here. You big poopy face. Yes. You big Mr. Poopy Face. Or Mrs. Poopy Face in this case. No, so you're Christmas Eve. I didn't kill it, so oh, it was just poopy face. It's a poopy face. Okay. Gotcha. Or that. Okay, is that all your action? That's all mine. Don't hear. Why do I can't see that lady anymore? She's still down there. I bet they took your light away. Have you got my dark vision set? Oh, ha ha! <laughs> <laughs> He's raging. <laughs> uh, He's using the other room. <laughs> he sees through walls. I can see up a little urinal thing. <laughs> They're still making fun. Dude, 60 foot, but only him. Actually, it's no longer 60 foot. It's, it's forever. Yep. I, I put it in 100. Yeah. I can see the model. It takes less time like this. <laughs> Yep. <laughs> zero, 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 zero. <laughs> okay, okay, there we go. So I'm going to hold this one right. until you guys do everything else. Yeah. And then you're going to come help with this big thing. I'm going to move here. Okay. This thing was scary. <laughs> I don't know what it is yet. <laughs> Ooh, that's not great. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Something in Galaxy Quest. Oh, please. <laughs> Did I just hear That's not a very good swing. It turns out you that out. And that is not very good. Thumbaloney. You get a hero point? I, yes, I want a hero point. If you, if you do, everybody starts off with one hero point and, and you cash that in to re roll. A bad roll. If you do, can you make? Can you use that to make someone who used an attack roll on you re-roll theirs? No. Okay, so it's only it's only roll you, you right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. If if you roll less than ten, you can add ten to that result. Your okay. your new your new roll. Yeah. So so, so your, your, your hero roll to ten. Your your hero hero roll roll will never be less than eleven. Yeah. It's always more. Uh, okay. Do that the same thing twice. And you well. By using the hero point and what he just said, that becomes a 33. Okay. Yes. Right. Okay, that will hit. Not quite correct, though. Uh, 29. Oh, wait a minute. Plus... You got barred stuff going? Yeah. Yep. Oh, he does. So it's total 34. 34. Yeah, it is a great. Okay. 
Uh, 80, 80 plus 13 80. points of damage. <laughs> yeah. You go, you go, your gray sword actually wedges in the barrel uh, behind her. Yeah. And this, he wants to this gets white block starts, no way you know, gushing out onto the floor. But she's and done. So that she, and she dissipates. <laughs> That's the case. What am I first for? No, because I used to hear say no way. Never mind. Um, you moved and it was yeah. one action. Yeah, but that's why I always I got the plus this time because I used the hero one. Right. Okay. So you still have uh, another action. Get your butt back up here. Oh. You can go thirty feet. No, the power the, the, the power attack is two 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 actions. Oh, you're done. I'm done. You moved and did the uh, power, power attack. attack. I'm still trying to get your butt back up here. Get up there. <laughs> so I'll work my way back up there. Okay, I am not waiting for. Uh, Gudo, uh, you know. him or him. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> What's wrong? I ran by that door. I saw those. <laughs> you got some reaction hiding. <laughs> I don't see anything, guys. <laughs> oh man! Um, you see, both of us were out there. Both had the exact same reaction when we looked to the left. That's you. I, I had my back to you, so I couldn't see. You heard the reaction. <laughs> You heard the same reaction from both of us. Oh, I'm trying to get out of this. I'm screen. blocking that doorway more and casting shield. Um, and uh, what the hell? I've got one action left. I'm going to do an intimidation check against her. Okay. To uh, demoralize her or whatever. Or her mother was a circus lover. Yeah. <laughs> her mother was a hamster. No. 30. Wow. Thirty. Add one. Add one to there. Huh? It's a thirty-one. I don't get the plus one from no, no, not for no, skills. No. It's a thirty. <laughs> it's a thirty. She's been doing it for one round. Yep. That is it for me. As if the arrow sticking out of her chest wasn't. It, wasn't that <laughs> then you make fun. Okay. Um, Ty. Okay, you see the big lumbering. Obese mass just thumping down the ball at you. Okay. Yeah, um, but I need to call it names. I mean, it's <laughs> it's big and it just rolls of fat hanging off this thing. But you also see a third arm, like right about here, coming off the side. It's it's, it's thinner, it's kind of clawed. Mm -hmm. um, but behind this thing, on the wall, you see scampering. What looks like a, a brain the size of a small dog on so like legs. Like small legs. Yeah. Um, it is, it, it, you can, like, it runs up behind this giantish thing, mm -hmm. skips up the wall, and it's coming at you and disappears. Uh, I hate that. I'm going to be in the brain. I'm going yeah, to yell. This reaction yell, not even on my, my turn, right? Uh, because if I can, I'm gonna yell. One of those. That's a free action you can you can yell. One of those brain things just turned invisible is coming down this hall. Okay. Uh, okay. So you turn invisible. Or what's you your a sight? Yeah. What's yeah. your perception, uh, <coughs> Ty? My perception is. What's your perception bonus? Is 19. Are you a master? I'm an expert, I think. Expert. Okay. Um, well, you're, oh, I'm sorry, you're, you're plus 19. Mm -hmm. So your perception DC is 29. 29. Um, I'm going to make a secret roll here. Go ahead and make a secret roll, I dare you. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> That's the worst secret ever. Um, <laughs> Okay. Yeah, you, you, you see this thing, like I said, it scampers up in the wall like a spider kind of big brain shaped spider, and it just kind of fades out of your sight as it runs towards you. And that's the last you see of it. Pretty much, yeah. OK, 
Okay, uh, Damien, you've got a drow woman in front of you. Who's frightened and has an arrow in her. Uh-huh. Like over her shoulder, you see a male elf. A normal. Not a dark elf. elf. Okay. Um, you know, he's kind of <laughs> catching what's going on. You see him disappear. Stop that. Okay. Um, My perception was also 19, so it's a 29 DC. And I am in that doorway. Okay, that's all, that's all you see. Okay. Ink. All right, first thing, I'm going to use 15 of my movement to move to here. Then I'm going to use two actions to cast haste on Zach, or cast deal, I'm sorry. And then I'm going to use my remaining three squares to move south to here. So uh, Zach Castiel has haste on him, which you may gain the quicken condition, and you can use an extra action each round for a strike or stride. Hey, Les? Yeah. You now have four actions? You're, you're playing 5e e rules. You're still behind him, yeah. What? I'm going to play 5e rules, so all y'all <laughs> all y'all can right. suck it. Ace gives you an extra action. Extra he action. He on himself, he casts it on Zach. Yeah, it basically, uh, and he gets the quicken condition. Yeah. Zach does. Zach does. Castiel yeah. does, yeah. He moved, cast, and moved. He oh, moved, he cast a two-action spell, and moved again. Okay, I, I he thought, thought he was breaking his move up in his two separate times. I, I thought you, I thought you thought no. his definition of haste was nope. wrong. Nope, nope, that's nope. that was right on. In five e, you can move do that. Button. You can do half of it and then half of it later, kind of like spring attack mm -hmm. without the feet. Yeah, so you have four actions now every round, so you can sing one round and do your triple shot in the same shot round. Shot another shot or, mm -hmm. yeah. or two double shots or. Yeah. You, you have four actions actual actual now. Huh? Something that adds up to three actions. Four? Yeah. Well, it moves. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, that's it for me. Since Don ruined my uh, moving. Okay. Don's a, <laughs> Don's a buzz kill, isn't he? I'm just he thinking. is. <laughs> Fun wrecker. <laughs> He's been called worse. Yeah. <laughs> He's been called worse today. And deserved it. <laughs> Okay, this thing's gonna come. Oh, by the way, I'll cast the buzz out for the for the for the sister crack. The poker lap we can. Oh man! <laughs> like wow, where did that come from? Oh, man. <laughs> I, I, when you see this thing come come running up, <laughs> my God, family went, whoa, whoa where did that come from? <laughs> I was gonna say, she's like, not, like it's pretty much every muscle in his body flexes. He's like, oh, no. has the shield. <laughs> um, it tries to shove you out of the way. Um, shove is against his Hypothetics. fourth oh, uh, yeah. Who are we shoving? Uh, there's a big ugly thing right uh, here that you can't see. Oh, it probably didn't make it. Uh, unless your unless your fourth save is a twenty less than twenty. No. Okay. Yeah, you. It, it, it comes. I tense up and put a shield up. <laughs> you you get thumped back, but it does not get through the door. Um, I yell, you shall not pass. <laughs> no, only well, like because it's stuck in the door. Yes. <laughs> She's actually okay. wedged in there. Nobody <laughs> else could come in that way. <laughs> in, my, in, in my best Gandalf voice. <laughs> you you shall not pass. You shall not pass. Okay. Huh. And then you turn back and go, fly, fools. Yeah, <laughs> friendly fools. Yeah. <laughs> and they go, no, they're not wise. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so for his uh, is shove an attack? Yes. Not, not, not nice. That's not, <laughs> I consider it an attack. So, like yeah. skill action. It has the attack. Okay, so. Um, so move and attack. Not yeah. attack again. It will. That that creepy. Um, other arm. Other arm, arm is going to lash out at you. Hey, this is a. This is a no creepy arm zone. Okay, and. Um, it missed. It missed. That will be this little bit. Your reaction? <laughs> no. I just like to, I just like to make fun of people. <laughs> yeah, you find talent. Okay, okay. good work. You're making fun of me. I didn't do anything. Well, do something then. 
Okay, the drow in front of you, John, mm -hmm. she turns invisible. Okay. Bunch of wusses. They're all gone. Um, Clear this way. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay, tumble through your space in acrobatics check. Yeah. I don't know if she's going to tumble through. I can actually action. Do I get an attack of opportunity if I notice them? Um, that Okay, that would be against your perception, DC. You see. Yeah. You have to steer. Um, okay. You can move through the space of, of one enemy, attempt to act against, uh, against your reflex DC. So this probably is not going to go well at all. Um, failure. Sometimes you don't know. 32. Your movement ends. So um, I'm sorry. 32. 32, I got to be. <laughs> oh, I forgot to tumble. <laughs> the just falls. She turns the visible and she keeps Okay, she. Uh, if I perceive her, can I get an attack of opportunity? Let me. Let me. See, let me. Well, see what her. You up. I know. <laughs> I know where she is. <laughs> There's a chance to miss her. Uh, you're like, hey, personal space. Hey, hey. What's your, what's your uh, perception? Nineteen. Nineteen. <laughs> I don't know. What you're <laughs> <laughs> so I was. She's literally standing, standing here going like this. Excuse me. Excuse me. <laughs> hey, you're my wife. You're pretty sure you know where she's at. Um, <laughs> because she's broken. One I'm, of her I'm only going to give her, even though she's invisible. I'm going to give her the concealed condition because you know what she has. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if, if you can roll a five or above on a d20, you're the, the strike hits. Okay, let me roll the 20 first later. <laughs> There's a slight chance you might miss her, but not. Oh, 19. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, it's only the first attack. Uh, 36 to hit. Tell me that's a crit. I'm sure it is, but she's on the genome layer, so I can, I can check. Uh, oh, yeah, that's yeah. a crit. Okay, so uh, 26 doubled is uh, 32 points of damage. 30, no, no, 40. 26 to 52. 52 points of damage. And that include all barred stuff? And everything. Yep. So minus 52? Minus 52. She is uh, bleeding and on fire. <laughs> she's invisible, but she's still on fire. You still see fire. Why is that invisible fire on her? <laughs> and behind her, you hear the invisible male up there. Did you get through? I can't see. But you've got just a flaming nothingness. But nothing <laughs> doesn't run. Okay. There's just fire uh, in the air. Uh, I'm sorry, she's 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 bleeding and on no, fire. fire. What's that? So you see, you so see blood there. everywhere, and you see a flame just the <laughs> air. You, you, don't, you don't see the flame, you just feel the heat coming up. <laughs> you see the flame and you see blood dripping from it. You see, you see blood on the floor. You see some smoke in the air. Okay. It's all smoke and mirrors. So that was that was just your reaction to her. That was my reaction um, to her trying to steal the spell past me. Okay, that was her first action. <laughs> yes, that was her first action. Oops. <laughs> uh, Coming through. Uh, she had to take a five foot step forward, so it was her second action. No, she she was right there. And she sure. okay. failed, so she never left her spot. Okay. Uh, um, okay. Um, so second action was the invisibility. Um, did that cost anything? She was invisible. Wasn't she already? Invisible? She was invisible before her turn started. Was she, was she or did she turn invisible right now? No, she did. She turned invisible. Yeah, because we could see her. He shot an arrow at her. Yeah. Okay, so that was so that would be her third action. Turn invisible. Uh, the, the try to move and then try to move in. Okay. 
Uh, the other guy turned invisible and tried to move. No, he, he turned invisible and asked her if she got through. <laughs> yeah. are, are you through? Are you through yet? Okay, well, well when, when she turned invisible behind her, you saw you could see an orc. Um, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Room, uh, glowing runes kind of circle his hands as he begins to cast a spell. What? Um, gave him permission to cast a spell. Yeah. I didn't. He's going to cast this on Damien. No, we disbelieve. Yeah. So Damien needs like a will save. Let's see what she casts. Okay, that's the beauty of this one. You can't see what it is. Oh! Um, what happens with that before I use my uh, hero point? Okay, that's a crit fail here. You are confused for a minute. Yeah, I'm using the hero point. <laughs> <clears throat> Ah, 37 is a great of success. <laughs> uh, so we'll say for me, so even if it's just a success, it is treated as a critical okay. success. Okay, so you were unaffected by it. But for a second there, your mind seemed like you were kind of losing control of it. And then you snap out of it. Um, yeah, you can move that token away. So. Yeah. <clears throat> Um, that was him casting that spell? Yeah. He's going to move off to the side, man. Hey, cast, wait. Can't do that. Cast the old. Oh. Um, right here. You can kind of see him. You can definitely see this big guy. Yeah. Then you got an extra action, so seeing. Same. Yeah, remember your haste. <laughs> Sing out proud. <laughs> um, so, what you could do, you guys were going to intimidate too. What you could do is with that extra action, you can intimidate, try to scare someone because that'll take their AC down and then do your double shot at full bonus because you didn't take another attack action. So you can oh. either try to draw that mark. The orc has not Look been intimidated. Max draw that mark. Yeah, the orc has not been intimidated. <laughs> this guy's intimidated one. You're pretty good with intimidation. You might be able to upgrade that to scared two. So it's an easier target to go after the orc because again, so you're not going to all that that shadow again. Okay, so so do your skills. Click skills and click intimidate. Steve, what's the door I'm in front of? Uh, Did it open into the other room or into this room? Yes. I want to know if I can block or wow. close it and block the door. Yeah, I don't know. Anytime you see red, <laughs> roll the wand. I'm asking the GM. <laughs> so does a 25 intimidation scare the uh probably? <clears throat> huh? Okay. <laughs> well, do you see would be 23? So what do you get? 25. <laughs> Good enough. You frightened somebody. Who would you frighten? The orc. Himself for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> um, so the orc scared one. And then you got two arrows. And that would be very interesting. I'll, I'll, I'll roll a dice for you in a second. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Door mm -hmm. out. Um, right. And actually, to find the same guy, you can't do the double shot. You do the bow first. Bow well, second. You can just close and block that door. I'm just going to do that for a while. So yeah. Attack. Attack ball one, attack ball two. Uh, long ball first. So do that. Okay, high. Holy crap. Or, and then roll. Do attack. 12 to 20, 10, 1 to 11, ball two, ball two, ball two, ball two, ball two, second. Ball two, ball two, okay. Okay, how about a 41 and a 35 against the. No, I'm sorry, he scared one. So how about. A 42 and a 36 against the big creature. Well, uh, doing what? Attacking with the longbow. Um, okay. Arm, uh, 
what, what were the rolls again? 42 and 36. 42 crit, 36 hit. So the crit, was the 40 whatever a 20? No. Okay. I don't think so. No. <clears throat> um, so, so the crit is 32 and 5. So the crit is 37, 38. Minus 38. And then the regular hit is the 16. Okay. That's the one. Well, Who do you guy is for the guy to go in this hallway here? Yeah. Okay. I'm going to use this to beat one of the guys. Is that all the reactions you get? Yeah. Toss me. Yeah. I can't. I can talk to play a demonstration. Oh, shit. That's a trigger of reaction. You end up on your feet. Right. Once you get on the ball, and you're within melee reach of your at least one enemy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so since I'm up, this guy is no longer frightened because he was only frightened one last round, okay. and I was the one that did it. So are we still doing the long way and letting me keep doing yeah. intimidating? Okay. But I'm going to use my first action to intimidate. Intimidate is wrong. I don't want to be right. <laughs> I'm sorry, who are you intimidating? No one. Nobody. <laughs> so 25. That was old. Actually, 25 might, might work. Yeah, no. Okay. okay. So then take a five foot step in. So that's my second action. And then a single swing. Thirty four to hit. Help him out. 34 hit the giant? Mm -hmm. Yep. So 15 or 16 points of damage. Oh, and remember, you have an angel inside of you. Yeah. 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 The her flaming sword gives you an additional 1d6 fire. I forgot that. Let me roll a d6. So I have two points of fire to that. If you're gonna run past me, I'm gonna tell you there's something invisible in me. No, because I'm. I don't plan on running past you. Okay, it's gonna take two movements to get where I want to go. Okay. But I should be able to. All your actions, Mike. That's all. See the guy hiding in the corner. All right. I'm gonna move to here. It's gonna be two movements. And I can see this guy here. Right. I can see what the rest of us are swearing about. Right. Now I'm gonna try to intimidate the guy in the corner, hiding in the corner, up there in that room. The uh, or yeah. You can see him? Yeah, I can see him. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I, yeah, I, I saw intimidating. I thought that was still left over from last round. No, that I think be. that works. Okay. Let me let me make sure it's not. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, you're close, but it's not. Do I get pluses? That hurts, no. I give it a shot. Yeah, never, never hurts. All right, those are my three actions. Oops. Demon, you're up. Um, do I see someone right here? <laughs> you stay right next to him, you better. <laughs> I, don't I don't know. Check Where'd that stealth roll. Right. Where'd you go? Um, right here. Oh. <laughs> oh. It's not. It's not like something on my GM layer. Um. Uh. You you step in and and you you bump into something. Why bump into something? Um. Give me. Give me an athletics check. Uh, I'll do a double slice on her actually right now. Yeah, but uh, athletics check. All right, all right. Well, you you know that because not enough. To, oh, not enough time to pass. Yeah, you know she is still there. So if you want to attack her, you can. Yeah. Or if you always want to shove past her, you can do that too. No, no, I'm just going to double slice her. Actually. Yeah, yeah. She can't get past her. Uh, yeah. Okay. She is hidden from you now, though. Um, 
you you know the square she know the square she's in. So you have to roll uh, a flat check of, uh, of eleven or better. Twelve. Yep. So combat action. Double slice. Uh, okay, I need to. Um, I rolled a twenty six to hit, but it's a one, so that's a miss, right? A one one knocks it down one, so it wasn't a crit hit. Yeah, so it's just a miss. Does that include the plus one? Um, yes, it does and for your inspired courage. Yeah. So that swing missed. But the second swing was a 42 to hit. Crit for that? Oh, yeah. Okay. So uh, that one does uh, 19 plus 3, which is uh, uh, 22, 44 points of damage. And then more negative. And, and it doesn't stack the bleeding or anything like that, but when she does move, she does take up persistent damage. Okay. Um, uh, so it's like a visible check? Yeah. Yeah. And she hasn't taken that yet because I gave it to her at attack of opportunity. <laughs> that sounds good. Phrasing. <laughs> 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 Actually, she should have taken it once already because at the end of her action, she was <laughs> eating. We're going, Don. We're, we're loving this. Right? How, many, how many times should she take it, Don? <laughs> Do you keep giving it to her? Is that what you're doing? Nine. I'm glad she keeps taking it. Six, three, fire. If she keeps uh, taking it, he's going to keep gonna giving it. it. <laughs> Okay, so that was a double slice, and, and this is why we get so many views on YouTube. Um, <laughs> that, that was that was a double slice. Uh -huh. My third action, I'm gonna cast shield again. Okay. Um, yeah, you. you uh, your cookers like scissor into thin air in front of you, and you know they bit in hard. I see blood coming out. <laughs> uh, She's still on fire. Is <laughs> <laughs> invisible? Is your blood invisible too? Uh, once it leaves her body, no. Not after it leaves her, it's not. Okay. That's why I always try to keep all the blood inside me. Right. Yeah. Especially when I'm invisible. It's hard to fight you that way. Put so few bleeding when you're invisible. I haven't really been any good. I have a script. Somebody has her turn and she's almost dead. Because she will take policy. Room. She's almost dead, but it's not her turn. Um, ah, come on. Let her blood try to just die. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. We had a good Yeah, so yeah, yeah, no. so yeah. Uh, what are the odds of Bob uh, actually doing first and third Friday next month? Actually, really good. Ask him tonight because he said he's on for uh, next week. Why do you ask? Mindy wants me to, Mindy wants us to play at our house on the third Friday of next month because she's gone and doesn't want me to have the kids by themselves for that one. I'll tell Bob. He won't come to my house. Oh, yeah, so he can't. Yeah. Um, because of the kids. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe. To make trade some trade week or something with him or something. We'll see. We'll check. Okay, question question for the collective. I think the kids will be fine with it. The occupation yeah. is Casting confusion. Is that an offensive act? <laughs> yeah, it would be, I think. Casting a spell like that would be an offensive act. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, if it's a summoning. You're just creating something no. Yeah, if you cast it on yourself with a couple of shots, then yes. it's okay. Yes, you're trying, you're trying, you're trying to affect me yeah, in a negative way. That would, mm -hmm. that would be an offensive action. Yep. So is it the big guy? Yep. Uh, right behind Ty, they 
brain, brain-like creature suddenly pops into view. He uh, doesn't know Belfair very well. It's a bad well, from the no, he doesn't, because he's going to try to cast his confusion on Belfair. Sorry. Can't be, can't be done. Oh, it's not me? I thought it was not me. Right now. Honestly, Belfair doesn't look like the Will Savy type. <laughs> he does. So that's, that's why they that's why they throw it thrown at him. Um but while he's raging, currently they don't have attacks of opportunity. These two don't. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay, so I need a will save from Bill here. <sighs> Ooh, 25. That will not. That does not succeed. Uh -oh. you, um, Frank and one. Confused. Confused. For one minute. Um, that means you might attack us, you might attack yourself. You, you can make another will save at the end of every turn. Okay. Um, you have a confused condition. Um, you don't have your wits about you. You attack wildly. You are flat footed. You don't treat anyone as your ally. Right now, you don't know who anyone is. You don't trust anybody. Um, you use all your you. actions to strike or, ca or cast offensive cantrips. Um, yeah, get away from them. Your targets <laughs> are determined randomly. So you will attack anybody around you right now. Get away from them. <laughs> anybody I can see or anybody that I know that you're around. Uh, so well, just, anyone you see that's around you. Okay. Yeah. You you would be willing to take a five foot step to this attack. One, two, three. You you can reach one, two, three, put four mm. potential targets right now. So we can roll a D4 and figure out who you who you attack. At the end of your turn, you get to make another will save though. Okay. Um uh, okay, that, that was all three of his actions. Um does the the four targets that do include the intellect go out, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, he, he, he has no issue with right. you know less, uh, running over and attacking. Can we yeah, you, um, I told you like the one in front of me, but that's not going to be the case, obviously. We ran them. Things up. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Uh, I am going to not do what I was going to do and do something else. So I am going to heighten a quick magic missile uh, and blast this fella right here. 26 points of missile damage. So I'm heightening at just one level though. But I'm taking I'm taking all three actions. So that's it for me. All three actions of magic missile. So I'm gleaming away. Gleaming away. You have successfully gleamed. Um it was a magnificent gleam. The giant guy is going to try and shove through Kai again. Oh, wait a minute. You gotta shut through both of us. Why can't we back together? So yeah. Uh, I don't think shoving through the, the brain thing would be too hard, though. Um, right. Athletics against your fourth DC. Hey, I have a root totem. Mm -hmm. That's not a one time thing, is it? That's. It is a one time thing. Is it? Okay. Yeah, hold on. Let me give you the details on that. It's plus two to saves versus spell. I believe the, the kids call it the deets. <laughs> so oh, what was your roll? Oh. My roll was a 29. Was 41 is what they made. Also did not make it. I spent a hero point. Um, I spent a hero point. They don't have hero points. They're not heroes. I spent a villain point. <laughs> oh, right. point. <laughs> <laughs> I spend as many villain points as I want. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, he's in charge of the villains. Uh, uh, actually, it is. Uh, it is. It's for the day, so uh, it grants you. Um, oh no! It's what? Uh, it's so it's plus two to uh, the first uh, save versus spell <laughs> or haunt. Okay. He'll, okay. I, I do have my AC updated for this level, so he'll. Um, he'll then. Slash with creepy claw. Is that once a day or just is, what? Yeah. One time a day, yeah. Uh, once a day zone. So, that, have, didn't you tell him that? This is no, a, a no creepy arm. There's just no reasoning with him. Um,
came from in front of you, Don. Oops, I guess I guess she would then re reappear. Um, she suddenly pops into view. You are flat footed to her, which is when she struck at me, I didn't see her. Yeah. Um, I'm sure it's not the uh, okay. Um, Ooh. 35 does it. Oh, gee. She just suddenly appears um, and clocks you with a, a club. Uh, but, so, right, I'll do you for that. Yeah. No, oh, actually, she gets um, a couple or um is she attempting a knockdown or what nope um if she has improved knockdown i'm automatically prone that's a two action maneuver okay she um I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, what you said, Don? If she has improved knockdown, I'm at automatically prone. Yeah. Okay. Uh, she's going to three again, but you, what, seeing, seeing the fact that she hit you, you see like a crazed look in her eyes? You know, did, you, these things live for any kind of sensation, and hitting an enemy is just overwhelming. You're her sensation. Impressive. I am no longer flat footed because she is visible now. Yeah. I think it's the first attack you're right. You're, um, but she gets pluses. Um, well, I'm at 33 now. That's a miss. Okay. And yeah, third, so, so three. Miss. Okay. Tiny is up. My tiny, not your tiny. <laughs> I was going to say. <laughs> He's going to move behind her. Check him. Yeah. The names people like that. Is that provoke? <laughs> yes. Well, he, uh, he was in a space. He was in a threatened square. Yeah. He doesn't know you have a tactical opportunity. No, he does. He will. <laughs> Just the first one, 43. I think that's a crit. <laughs> that's right. Wow. 50 points of damage. And bleeding and on fire. <laughs> okay. Well, they're both uh, bleeding in on fire. Yep. Yeah. So far, he's taking a five foot step. And paid dearly for it. Yeah. <laughs> That'll teach him. Son of a bitch. And pays <laughs> on uh, Damien. I was. Damien. And what's the save? Uh, we'll say, okay, you take eight points of damage uh, and you have to I take eight points automatically? Yeah. But then you make a roll save to see if you're stunned. Okay, um, I am using the plus two on this, which won't be reflected here. <laughs> yeah, 35. <laughs> success is counted as a critical success. Castile. All right, so I'm going to have to move some. Well, what I would do is do all your stuff you want to, so your last action, and use your last action to get out of dodge. Why? Um, um, so I guess all property I'll... values of dodge are going to be They're kind of dodgy right now. Um, right now, for you, the biggest threat is that the brain creature behind you. That's um, kind of, yeah, oh, that's no, kind of all of that. Yeah. No, his biggest threat is Bill here. <laughs> Actually, he doesn't know it yet either. Oh, that's true. Nobody knows it. 
Actually, yeah, we wouldn't know you're confused, would you? Yeah, you wouldn't know. So yeah, you really can't act like you know you need to move. Well, you just you hit that screaming. I'm confused about my relationship. <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very insecure right now. <laughs> I can go off on a tangent. Activating a wand does not provoke, right? So I'll keep saying you're casting a spell, and then I guess I'll take a double on. I don't know if it's the, the same brain creature, though. and then I'll. So if you're doing two shots, and then well, it is an activation. You do the long so, yeah. first one, or second. Right. I don't know if she has a tax of opportunity or not. So I'm not sure. Longbow one. How bad does she look? Oh, horrible. <laughs> <laughs> you can do the other one too. Okay. I'm sorry, who are you guys shooting at? Mm. He is shooting at the brain. And those are both supposed to be 38. Uh, plus one. 38 will crit. Uh, 30, 30, 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 38 to hit. Uh, no, 28 will hit if yeah. 38 crits. So, yeah, 39. Okay. So, so first arrow, 47, the first arrow. 48 for the first arrow. No. Oh, 40. Seen, can be seen, so you get one. Okay. Uh, well, that part actually doubles. So, it's 21 oh. plus you know, 21 40. doubled is 42 plus 7, so 49. So, it's 49 for the first arrow. Okay. And, and the second one was 20, uh, 20, 30, 24 plus 6. That was soon crit. He doesn't get that because that the second one didn't crit. The second one was a hit, mm -hmm. so it doesn't double, but he still gets the damage. Well, he the damage oh, he doesn't get the crit damage. You're right, just 24. So 24 for the second arrow. Minus 24. And then you got one action left. Well, he has to keep saying. Well, he's already. He's, he's got four, yeah. so he's. Oh, okay, okay. Saying, saying, shot, 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 one left. Yeah, one action left. Well, like I said, can can you make like a perception to see if he looks? If I look crazy, <laughs> crazy or anything? I mean, is we know that. I would say you could do it. You, you would spend since that's not where your attention would normally be. It would be an action to make a perception okay. check. So but he has an action. Mm -hmm. Oh, but, but then he, he would just know what was going but on. Then he like, think, yeah. Actually, I want to be like an arcana check, I think, to see that there's. So I was going to say, I was going to suggest having him roll to see who his target is. And if you turn to him, he would get a perception check to say, oh shit, what's going on? So, okay. Uh, so if he targets someone else, he wouldn't. Want... Okay. We started Damien one, Intellect of Hour two. Castile three, ink four. Okay. Did you want to roll the cap? I just will. Yeah. Oh, he's jumping past uh, Castile to go after ink. So, <laughs> so he's not focused on you, so he wouldn't know that he wouldn't would know to get out of the way or out of the way. So you got one action left. I probably. <laughs> you hear me all. I feel threatened by your beard. <laughs> <laughs> That's the idea. <laughs> I feel threatened by your breathing. Um, maybe try to intimidate. The there can be only one good beard in this party. <laughs> try scare him. Maybe easier to hit. Oh, so try. Get the Highlander beard. There can be only one beard of this magnitude. Crap. No. So does a twenty-five or does yeah, does twenty-five intimidate who? The brain thing. No, it won't. All right, the fairly willful brain thing. Mm -hmm. You do you do sink two arrows into that brain, mm -hmm. but they're both on the right side, so it's not as good at math right now. <laughs> 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 so, <laughs> so, 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 it may have lost some language skills. <laughs> I forgot math. It's not a wedding itself, is it? <laughs> You hit my creativity center. Um, Ty, you are up. Okay. I'm going to try and intimidate the brain creature. I'm using different insults than what he used, because apparently those didn't work. He's got his math skill. Yeah. I'm making <laughs> fun of his math okay. skills. You turn it slowly and go, what do you want to do tonight, brain? <laughs> <laughs> Same thing we do every day. <laughs> 
So 42, no, 41. Uh, would you mean that would be so a grip success, in the brain. I believe. So he's scared too. Scared also. <laughs> no, scared too. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm going to swing at him twice. The brain that is. Because if he doesn't have enough money. Ooh, I really don't care. Oh, crap, those are horrible rolls. Okay. Uh, so 25 and 23. Um, 25 will hit. So 12 points of damage. 13 points of damage. Did the 23 have every, every bonus? Yes. Uh, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't have the. Uh, I, I didn't take into account that he was scared too. Oh, I, I'm that, assuming that you were doing that. That was a stupid thing to assume. <laughs> <laughs> that was a stupid thing to assume. <laughs> I'm I'm assume my confidence. Um, so the, that will hit. Okay. So so then one, two, two total points of damage. You, you're like, you're like, I keep your shield between you and the giant's oh, like, yeah. and it just <laughs> drive your right here. Right, right in its brain. <laughs> yeah. Is that all your turns? Yeah, I'm done. All, all your actions? Yeah. Go up here. I can probably cry. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Me? I guess I'm going to go towards Ink because, you know. Right? Yep. That's the way we do. What all the cool kids are doing. So, I'm here. so if I'm going to swing at him, what would I swing at him with? I would say you're in your right sword. Sword. Okay, bye -bye. Uh, That's a crit. Did you just do 56 friggin' points of damage to me? <laughs> yes, actually, actually, no, he didn't. I'm using my, uh, so, is a 37 a crit on you? No, my AC is 29. Okay. I'm using my, as long as both were through 15 feet, which they are barely. Mm -hmm. um, somehow I managed to get my shield <laughs> between <laughs> me and him. What did you do, throw it? Uh, apparently, I Captain America did. Or you angle it, light gets in his eyes. Yeah, I do something with my shield. He, the, the, the blow doesn't land through. So it's two, your, your armor class goes up by two, and my shield takes the first 15 points of damage. Wow, okay. And then, so, so it's 35 damage, so my shield takes the first 15. Does it break the shield? Damage. So you take 20 points of damage from this hit. Okay. My shield takes damage. But it's not crit. That's the important thing. Yeah. Yeah, that, that uh, is, uh, well, good. Yeah. Certainly. Yeah. But I can only get once around, so. Okay. Thank you. We're going to give Ty a hero point for that, but you've already got two. So you have two. Yeah, I'm good. I will give a hero point to uh, Damien, though, for the whole invisible <laughs> drow <Robin. laughs> past him. <laughs> oh, then you get to make an understanding throw, Kev. Yes. Got a little thing here. Oh. We didn't do it. Hey, the uh, orc. Uh-huh. I didn't give him his persistent damage at the end of his turn. Maybe he didn't want it. If you're going to ask him if he wanted it. I didn't miss it. 16. <laughs> Let me see. That's awesome. 25 with the with Kevin's I will say we'll say it works here. It does not. You are still confused. 26 doesn't work. Sorry, Ink. <laughs> uh, well, again, well, you change you change targets yeah. next time, right? <laughs> yeah, and actually, or maybe you change targets. You never know. Right. 
In fact, the, the orc that uh, the spellcaster uh -huh. uh, takes 18 points of uh, damage. Okay. Eight bleed, eight fire, six bleed. Now, is Drowsha taking it yet? Um, no, we forgot to do his at the end of his turn. So okay. at the end of her turn, she'll take hers. Damien, you are up. Um, she looks wounded. You heard her feelings. Um, <laughs> So the wand I want to use is a three action casting from the wand because it's a two action spell. I have to draw it. I don't have that many actions this round. I'm going to double slice it. Yeah. You, you can tell she is barely on her feet. If, if you don't want to use a two action thing to kill her. If you have a better use for actions after she goes down, You could hack her down, move past her, and, ha and get one swinging at the. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll strike her once. So you're only counting the first attack here. Uh, 29 hit. She's uh, got, oh yeah, frightened one. Uh, 16 points of damage. She, she, Blood kind of spurls out of her mouth and then she she like slides off the victory slowly. I cast field and step up. So I am right there now. Okay. Didn't do the hour change? No, I didn't. That is my three actions. It is the devourer's turn. Okay. It attempts to claw at time. It is used up. Actually, okay. It's going to claw one time. So you can only roll one. And then it fades out of sight again. Stupid. Hey, you're up. Yeah, can I? So, do I have to I do guess. a constant? Oh, never mind. Some, somebody just suddenly popped in the view alongside uh, Damien. <coughs> and we'll take a swing at him. And then probably miss. Okay. Oh, that was in. Okay. Uh, now you're up, Inc. Okay, so do I have to make some sort of concentration check uh, since I got hit? Nope. <laughs> All right. I'm going to do, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try to acknowledge Arcana to see if I know what's wrong with uh, with Balfour, mm -hmm. since he and I are oh. usually usually homies. Oh, yeah. usually not attacking yeah, like like this. He's a crap on you. <laughs> he just remembers all the things you said behind his back. Yeah. Uh, Forty. Do I think that he is uh, affected? Yeah, you know <laughs> I'm compromised. You can definitely see the effects of the confusion spell. Okay, then uh, I am going to try and cast. Uh, well, I'm not going to try. I'm actually going to cast it. I'm going to cast <laughs> a spell. Uh, I'm going to cast a spell. Dispel magic on him. Okay. To get rid of it. Yay. Uh, disrupts and unravels the magic. So I can never remember what this. You make is. a spell attack roll. Um, Spell attack roll, you say? Yeah. Here it comes, buddy boy. Why is it not? What? Yeah. Yeah. Why won't? What the? Why won't it let me do a spell attack? That's not good. You gotta be able to cast spells first. Oh yeah, that's right. Idiots. Uh, all right, hold on. I'm just do it by hand. 
35. That, that will do it. Yeah. <laughs> Boom. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. <laughs> no, actually, you would. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I was going to be bad. <laughs> All right, I just spell that. Okay, so you made a knowledge check and a direction spell. Yep. Okay. Um, Thank you. And then I, that should only be knowledge checks are generally free, right? Or uh, uh, recall knowledge check is one action. Oh, okay. So then I'm done because it's two actions for dispel magic. Yep. Um, but you no longer have a crazy barbarian next to you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Cool. Huge bonus. Yep, good for me too. Because mine doesn't reach that far. That pushes it. Yeah, and you're fighting that big fat thing. Yeah, yeah he's gonna try to push past you again. This time you're gonna succeed. That succeeds. Uh, are you using my life though? Okay, oh, there you go. But I would say you get like shoved back in front, and this thing just kind of makes a horrible squelching sound as it. <laughs> Get through the door. <laughs> I think you should get a bigger one. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, of course, this guy's not very smart, too, because he's put himself right next to it. That's not part of it. Exactly. It was confused a minute ago, though. Um, not anymore. Now he's just clarity now. Us. Okay, so uh, wait, let me look up shove. I think I think you have an option to just like follow as a free action. Are we get attack of opportunity. You don't have attack of opportunity. Right. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that. That beat my you stride after it, but you must move the same direction in, in the same distance and in the same direction. It doesn't say it wouldn't if, if, if you had to take an action to do it, it wouldn't. It would, it would so, did it just push past me? No, it, so, it, it shoved you back. Okay, so it forced it picked me up and moved me back 10. Right. Yeah, I, you. you you were like this, and you just like slid backwards um, behind this thing. Um, it's going to bite with a jaw. That's a second attack. Excuse me, I'm just looking over that. What does that you do? I'm not taking all. <laughs> no, I'm taking all these back here. <laughs> The hell is that? <laughs> you slide back and then, like this thing, misshapen mouth ran from the top of the shield, and the, the arm comes around the side, but nothing hits you. Okay. Just <laughs> effective. This dude is going to. Okay, he's gonna try to intimidate Damien. Oh, failed miserably. Uh, he actually made you feel better. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, you're not that bad, and you're injuring and killing my friends. <laughs> you're actually quite Please nice. <laughs> I mean, I mean, Re- read the room, people. No. Nope. Okay. So. He- he makes a feeble attempt at, at, at snarling at you, and then two, two, two rather weak slams with a club. Did Got you say you. a fetal attempt or a feeble attempt? Was it this feeble guy? attempt. Who's doing it? So you're uh, the orc guy was doing that. I'm playing with the big Yeah, you've got a big nasty right next to you. Big nasty kind of again. I would. I'd probably use your first move to just get away from him. So just kind of like in here. He's probably got, he's, I know he's got 10 foot reach. Actually, you have to flank me. Uh, so I can go diagonal once and then step back. Yeah, you can You can move up to five squares with one move action. Wait a minute, we need to step back. So one, two, three. 
guess. So I'm going to move there. Back at the corner. Okay, no, look, he's look, when, he's, when he starts moving back, mm -hmm. the creepy claw lashes out. He has an exact opportunity with it. Ooh. The 34 hit. That is my AC. So mm -hmm. he does 17 points of damage as it's now she right now form a claw rakes across your back as you're trying to step away. It's not his turn yet, so I still don't have my all right. My ability. Your reaction again. Uh, actually, it'd be my turn. So it's not my turn. So I just change this to minus 17. So one just. 121. Yeah. The other way you can do it is when you first click that, you can actually just up in there, make the change. So, so that's one action is to move away. Keep singing. Keep singing. That's two. So you got two actions. And I'm going to shoot at him twice. Okay. So since it's the same person, you have to be the longbow first, longbow second. Okay. Longbow first. Submit. Yeah. Oh, that 42. Well, yeah. On um, the, the big guy. The giant. The giant. 42 will be a crit. And then a, huh? a, a 29. 39 points the first one. Is that what um, No, uh, 41 points the first one. 41 for the crit? Yep. And then the second one's a 28. It's a 29. It's doing, 20, does 29 hit him? No, twenty nine doesn't. Okay. Well, okay, he's frightened one still, and then <clears throat> is there you, you guys factoring in the bard stuff? The twenty nine it contains the, the twenty nine uh, contains bard stuff, but it didn't it didn't contain the scared stuff. Okay, no, it it still mentions them. Okay, so one of the two arrows. Up. You need to put a tattoo on him. <laughs> <laughs> Old still. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, let me do it. <laughs> Everybody shows up next to this with pointy objects. Is that everything to use? Let me use my great sword uh, to do the tattoo. Ty, so. <laughs> okay. nah, you are up. Okay. I am going to move you right there. Yep, good job. Thank you. His intimidation goes away okay. because I was the one that gave it to him. Yeah, it does. So I'm going to try and put it back on there. No, you're not. <laughs> what? Sorry, I was just talking to myself. <laughs> <laughs> He's still shaking up with the beard. Throw <laughs> me um, my beard. So 41 for intimidation. <laughs> I'm frightened. <laughs> Be afraid. Be very afraid. I'm in the other room facing the other way. I'm frightened. <laughs> <laughs> that will be that will be a, uh, uh, on a Okay, so we scared two. That was my second action. Also. No. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sure. And then I will swing, but I'm flanking and he's scared too. And he's singing. I got all kinds of bonuses going on. Oh, I can't tell if the two showed up or not. So we'll have to remember that. Uh, the two did, two did show up. I did. So effectively, does a thirty-one hit him under normal circumstances? That's with all the thirty-one hits him on the, under normal circumstances. Okay, so that's, that's, that's all the penalties yeah. and bonuses added. In. Okay. Mm, that's eighteen. Plus so eighteen. 19. nineteen. So nineteen points of damage. Okay. Oh, I forgot to tell you, Don. When um, and we'll just wreck on. When you killed the drow chick, back of her head, and when those brain things popped out, you just stomped on it as you walked through them. Okay. But just, just so you go know what you guys are facing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And if, if there was any question. <laughs> nope. Okay, is that everything from Ty? Yes. Yep. Bill here. I have to this guy. You are unconfused. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Ink was a pretty easy target. I, mean. <laughs> I don't think Ink could take any more damage from me. I say to him, that hurt. It's going to leave a mark. Okay. But 38. No, it's higher than that. 38. Because you're flanking, which gives okay. you two. 30, He's scared two, which gives you two. 
42. Which gives you one. 43. That old crit. <laughs> two well, 102 points there plus I'm 10 more. <laughs> breaking two points of damage. Told you I was mad. <laughs> He's really mad. Okay, now, now that you have been refocused, <laughs> you are furious that these things have, have done I mean, this to you. Mm -hmm. You plunge your gray sword into the flabby roll or the fat, like right between two rolls with his back. Blood spurts out, it topples backwards and back his head. One of those things pops out. I, I, I tell the people in my room, you better give up now before he comes in here. <laughs> <laughs> so, where does the brain thing go? Uh, he's right below, right where that guy He's was. right in front of you right now. Okay, I got one more action. Yeah, just so would that be a it, when it pops it's out, he's just kind of yeah. there, kind of quivering. It's stunned for it's, around. It's, yeah. So, so it's your third attack. It, it just, it just attached attack. itself with a bunch of nerves and experience death. Ooh, which, it always, which it always wanted to. Yeah, you, 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 you chop it in half right through the brain crack. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Vindication is mine, <laughs> says Val Fear. I'm coming for the rest of you guys. I told you. <laughs> Angel never eats how far you. I'm done. <laughs> okay, this is that elf from before, isn't it? Yeah. Um, I'm going to double slice this guy. Okay. He's waiting, so you know he's going to be dead soon. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, damn you, Pathfinder 2 library. Uh, 27 hit. That will hit. Um, for 24 points of damage. Watch this. 33 hit. Yeah. Is it a crit? Mm -hmm. Is that everything factored in? That's with everything factored okay, in. No. Not great. What if I throw in my tattoo? No. Uh, okay. What if it wasn't my tattoo? <laughs> <laughs> Um, do, 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 do I need to help some way? No. <laughs> I can. Uh, 13 points of damage. Okay. Um, okay, so that was two actions. Mm -hmm. How bad does he look? He's still got some fight in him. Okay. <laughs> he needed another crit. Um, I'm going to swing in one more time. Uh, when I do this, we're just taking the third attack here on this. Third attack is a 23 to hit. Didn't that move from here? That's it, that's with everything. Yeah. Okay. I am done. Um, yeah, Elf is up. <laughs> okay, Builder, all of a sudden, the, this thing pops into view in front of you as it starts clawing at you. Uh, it's like right in one by now. Um, where did he come from? He was over he by was the door. He was the one that was invisible. Okay. I was stabbing that. Right. right. And then someone else, and then he turned invisible again. Right. So he's back. In. Okay. You are flat footed against him. This first attack, because he was invisible when he hit you. Right. So there's a 32 hit you. Yeah. We'll do 22 points of damage. Okay. Ain't he mad? Uh, oh, he'll attack again. Ooh. He is not minus two again. He's not flat footed now. He crit, but he didn't do damage there. Okay. okay. <laughs> uh, so just 22 points? We're uh, not seeing him. Yeah, so no. I don't see him. I don't see him. That's I think he's I'm... on the DM oh. or, uh, shield or uh, layer. I um I may have him. You're on the GM layer. So if we can't see it, the damage didn't occur. He's, uh, can't brain, see it, can't feel it. Right? The, brain, the brain thing is on, on the filter layer. I may have the. On uh, secret GM? Yeah, the he, sheet, he was, the very front sheet, upper left hand area, kind of. Yeah, it's your AC. Oh, there we got. 
Okay. Me, that's not accurate, is it? It's 20. Okay, so he did 22 points of damage. Well, was. The yeah. second attack was a crit, but it did not roll damage. So let me put it on the sheet. He's a barbarian. Okay, 16 no points of damage in the second Fire flash. Arm. Okay, if that's all, I am going to interrupt that, and then my shield will take all of that. Okay. So that never even touched you. Okay, good. Because you're both within 15 feet of him. Then I comp the thing in the back of the head. Is I know, I know. Yeah. <laughs> Brain crack looking to be sliced in half. <laughs> the elf alongside of you, Damien, is going to swing. Uh, 27 misses. And then you get a half opportunity because he, he's casting a spell. <laughs> the fool. Disrupt that spell. Hell yes, motherfuckers. <laughs> okay. 40 hit. <laughs> that will probably crit as well. Yeah. I'll see if you can cast spell. Exactly. <laughs> we will be doing that crap again. You start to fade from existence again, but you jab your poopery in before. before you it was a crit, so it disrupted it. Yep. Okay. Um, <laughs> Ooh, kukri jab. 46 points of damage. And he's bleeding. <laughs> I think he's dead <laughs> Is that it for him? He's not on fire, though? He is on fire, too. Oh. Is that it for him? We, we, uh, yeah, yeah, we need to his two actions. Okay, well, only 15 points of damage. It's a pack of bleeding and fire. This, this is the end of his round. Mm -hmm. He now takes the persistent damage. 15 points, seven bleed, eight fire. And you can roll the uh, check to see if he stops. You have to make a separate check for the fire. And no, we just didn't. counted as one. We've always just made one check to, to quit both. Okay, eight, four up. <clears throat> All right, so first thing I'm doing is I'm using a wand to cast Dimension Door. Uh, I can Dimension Door to a place I can see, so I'm going to Dimension Door to here. That's one action. Then I'm going to take two actions and cast Disintegrate on this person right here. Oh, wow. <laughs> Basic save on that, I think. Uh, oh, no, I have to make a spell attack. So my spell attack is, I don't know why it does that. Uh, hold on, let me do this. You told it to? No. Spell attack, 28. That will hit? Yes! Uh, so that would be, if we go back, it's... Uh, uh, 47 points of damage unless you let me re-roll it. Unless you let me re-roll it. I don't even... The center create is 47 points of damage and they have a 42 DC of 31. Yeah. I didn't ha even have her in the initiative tracker. I'm going to say she grit fails and... <laughs> 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 It just dies. Yeah. <laughs> I, I must not have clicked on her ruling initiative. I didn't know she was up there. <laughs> nice job. You completely disintegrated. Yeah. I guess I did. All right. Well, that's well, that's, that's my memory. Of course, she had all the cool stuff. <laughs> <laughs> hey. hey. <laughs> she had the plus five Holy Avenger. But... <laughs> hey, uh, uh, well, that's my three. I don't, I can't do anything else. So. Okay. He's going to, you've done enough. Here. I've done enough. Yeah. She was the prisoner. Yeah, <laughs> use a hook for the next. Uh, you move here to flank. I use my attack of opportunity. Mm -hmm. And um, oh no, I am being flanked. <laughs> uh, what, what, what whatever can I you do? do about help, that? help. Oh, no. <laughs> help me, Spock. Help, help, help me. I'm being your friend. <laughs> There's a way he has such a reversal. <laughs> 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 and we're all the other one. <laughs> I just might get in your ear. I, I told you right now. Um, I told him that was a good idea. So my AC is now 30 against him. He crit fails. 
Again, no reaction. We just want to make one. Fail. Okay, that would be it. Okay. Yes, Neil. Well, look, it's my turn before this. <laughs> so I'm going to. Oh, wait, wait. He just finished his turn. 12 points of damage from persistent uh, bleed and fire for uh, uh, the oak orc or whatever. And he gets to roll to see if it congeals. It's going to do something here. I'm sorry, 12? 12 points. Okay. And then the flat check 15 or more. Oh, hey, there we go. Yeah, so you can take off the persistent. Yeah, we're Bleed and fire on him until right. <laughs> my next turn. <laughs> you put it back on him. Oh, thank God that's over. <laughs> so saying you have to twice. And then... Oh, Philly, I got to do that. I never want to turn it out again. So if you're saying thing, you got to do the one more one. Okay, so I'm still saying I'm shooting at the brain thing again twice. Aim for the crack. Aim for the crack. Holy crap, dude. Oh, you, 36? Um, you don't even have to shoot twice. You're, that last arrow sinks in. Okay, so, I only, so I only have two. I so still have two actions left. Actually, can he see? No, you want to kill him, do you? He can do whatever he wants. No, he doesn't have a shot to that guy. Really? To the elf guy? Yeah. yeah. He's going to have He's going to have complete cover. He'll, he'll be at a minus four. <laughs> Stop touching me. Go ahead, shoot. What the hell? You can shoot at that guy at a minus four. Or you can try and move, use a move action to get closer. Or you can shoot at this guy here. <laughs> <laughs> He's easier. There's no minus four. He's not expecting it. Oh, I'm still His hard. goddamn shield will come. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so hard. To yeah. Um, or you can come up and try and intimidate one of those two. I could come up to here mm -hmm. and then just be like, you make fun of one of them's mom or something. <laughs> <laughs> We're back. Come up there and say, he's got quick reverse. <laughs> and then I do intimidation. Just you guys know. Which one are you intimidating the elf or the orc? Actually, the elf. The orc's still scared. All right. The elf. So intimidation, submit. 36. That will 36. succeed. Two. So apparently he's scared also. <laughs> he should be. <laughs> That's what he wanted. He did. Yeah. He, just, he just came up. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Ty, you're up. <laughs> he really, he really does. <laughs> you're going to be on fire and leave me again. <laughs> I'm going to make a prediction. Ty, you're you're up. Up. on trouble again. Okay. Um, so does it take an action to just kind of glance at those two to see you're taking some damage? Which one looks in more shape? No, 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 no. You block any damage I, I don't got. think so. I mean, because I'm, I'm moving less. here, moving yeah. through his space. Did you take any damage? And then I'm moving, I'm, oh, yeah, yeah, I did 20 yeah. points. Yeah, yeah I, thought, I thought Ty blocked it. So I blocked some okay. of it. I blocked it. He blocked some of it, not all of it. You took 20? Well, you blocked 20, all yeah. I blocked but I'm but I'm fine. I you know, uh save right. yourself. Right, right. It's huge. Yeah, but but still. Right. Yeah. But yeah, he still took probably 20. He took I, I think Ink is passive aggressive guilting you guys. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you guys don't worry about me. You have fun. No, you guys go ahead with your fancy fighting and hurting <laughs> each other. This great sword wound isn't that bad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right then. You, you guys having fun, that's more important. Yeah, it's the friends we made along the way. That's the important part. Which guy will look the worst shape, the elf or the orc? Which one's bleeding and on fire the, the most? Orc, orc looks to be in the worst shape. But he's no. not bleeding or on fire anymore. No. Okay. He so, has a little look of relief on his face. <laughs> so if either one of those two have attack opportunity, they can take it because I move run behind yeah. the elf. Oh, so yeah. Nobody. I do. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> so that's one action to get there. An action to intimidate the elf. No, he's already scared. He's already scared too. I'm going to say, 
a couple of weeks ago on last cannon when uh excuse me just being completely passive aggressive about about the rules is um baron is shooting at your baron gets an attack or a giant gets an attack of opportunity on baron for shooting mm -hmm. he's shooting his gun and and it was like well, of course, if I'm going to shoot them with a firearm, they get a free punch in my face. <laughs> That's why the gun is such an ineffective weapon. <laughs> they hardly ever go off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Before the gunman is knocking unconscious. <laughs> so, taking a swing at the elf. The elf may have sudden reverse. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, quick reversal. Quick reversal. <laughs> so with the flanking, that becomes a 44 with the singles of 45 to hit. That will, well, that will definitely break. Yeah. So 34 plus five, so 39 points. And then I need to do an attack. You don't need to. At my second so one. Needs to. <laughs> so what, do I need to do a 20 to eight here? Oh, you're trying to aid me? Yeah, you have to get a 20. <laughs> but you're at your highest attack bonus. Oh, well, this is at my medium one. This I got a 32, so. Yeah. So, so you crit succeeded, you get. Uh, at his level, it should be plus three. So you get a plus three. Okay. I think you're going to need it, but. Okay. Right, I'm done. Build here. Okay. Can I get past the. Can I get into this room? Can I get past Damon? Damien? Are you going to flank the other guy? <laughs> you can go through a square. Okay. This, an occupied square of friendly. So yeah. you can go through me and uh, Castile. Right, you're right. You, you, can go, you can go through a friendly square or Damien. <laughs> <laughs> I have to get here to flank, right? You have to get all the way in there. You haven't. Uh, okay. Yeah, you have to get to there. Okay. So it's probably two move actions. Not at 40. Oh, do you? Yeah. Nice. Okay. I'm gonna swing at swing at the big guy. I'm getting a color spray ready. <laughs> shoot, shoot, <laughs> shoot him. Get down. <laughs> <laughs> You've got a shot. Shoot him. So it's 26 plus one for inspired courage, and he's flanked. It will hit. Um not great, but it will definitely hit. Uh, 45 plus uh, 13, so yeah, 15. Wow, stop helping me! <laughs> I went for the tougher one, so you dropped one. Uh, I, I know, I went, for the one, I went for the one I could see. <laughs> okay, uh, and you got a plus oh, three. I can't do it. Okay, I gave you a plus three. Yeah, I know. So, so your second thing. well. Or is it all the same? It's you doing the, the your aid's one. only one attack, only one so attack. the second spin around. Because I'm just spinning here. <laughs> <laughs> so just let him know which one the three is going for. <clears throat> okay. The second attack on the elf is when I take the plus three. Okay. Let me go back up in the garage. Be happy, Damien. You can fly a two beam. So, yeah, uh, enemy A is the northwest most. Uh, so, enemy A is this guy. Does 40 hit him? He yeah. is flanked and scared. <laughs> is it a crit? He, he, he's a buckler. Uh, yes, yeah. a buckler. <laughs> yes, it's a crit. Just his knees. So, that one there is uh, 17 plus 4, which is uh, 21, 42 points of damage against him the first time. Okay. Then I whirl and swing at this guy with a 37 <laughs> who is flanked and scared. Is that a hit? It's awful crit. Okay. <laughs> so 18 plus 4 is 22. <clears throat> 44 points of damage on him. He drops. I swing again. <laughs> this uh, time. Builder? Huh? No. <laughs> <laughs> this time with the plus three. I so hope you have a beard someday. <laughs> So it's 26 to hit, plus he's scared and flanked. Uh, okay, I hit. <laughs> <laughs> I don't no know where you're going with it. <laughs> 23 points of damage. 
Uh, yeah, but uh, he's still up, huh? He, he, he's a little stunned. <laughs> <laughs> a little stunned. Yeah. I'll actually swing at him for third I, action. I, I think he's tucking, tucking his small intestines back in right now. <laughs> just a minute. <laughs> Okay, just take the third swing on this roll here. 27 to hit. <laughs> uh, only 24 points of damage. Unless you got the plus one for me. Plus is already in there. 24 points of damage. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, he's he, he's literally holding his inside gym right That's now. That's an action. <laughs> That's an action. <laughs> so, he's looking action. at you in kind of horrified shot. Don't I'm, make him I'm, laugh. I'm hoping he's down to like 10 hit points because the persistent damage is going to kill him. <laughs> yeah, oh, he's, yeah. He's, he's way less than that. Is, is that what he's going to be taking? Uh, yeah, I'll roll it now. He's going to take eight. <laughs> I get seven. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Thank you very much for the inspired courage of the whole combat. <laughs> Helped out a lot. Okay. <laughs> like I said, every time we went in there, I was whispering. <laughs> That's why when I stepped in there, I'm like, I hope they don't flank me. <laughs> Please don't let them flank Please me. Don't let them flank me. Oh, where's the fun in that? It's such a great thing. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, that was fun. <laughs> yeah. So, so that's one. <laughs> Pretty that's dealing. Since it's, since it's my turn, I'm going to go ahead and let go of that color spray on everybody. <laughs> <laughs> He's shooting you. Yeah. <laughs> Bring him down. Yeah, hit him once um, by accident. He's all mad. Yeah, so I need 20. What do you need? Uh, 7, 60, 121, 138, so 17. What do you need? Do so, your medicine check? Just Les, how many hit points do you need? 20. Okay, so this first one is on less. Okay. A lot of things are. <laughs> so, 27, uh, 28. So I get, I get my 20 back? Get 20, 25 back. 25 you get your full. Okay, so I got one back. Thank you. Oh, you're you get 21 back. Yep. All right. Who else needs? I'm good. Damien, how much are you down? I just inflicted 20. damage. I didn't take that. Okay. Actually, 19 is what I need. Inflicted friendly damage. <laughs> Emotional damage. Right. Stupid thing. I'm quick doing that. Ink is going to have trust issues from now on. Oh, my God. I got exactly what I need to do that. <laughs> back. Yeah. And then I get near me, so I do a perception check. <laughs> okay. And then ink, you're full now, right? Yeah, I'm good. You're good. Nice. I just healed you. You healed yourself. So I think we're all good. All right. You down any? Mm -hmm. Did you get hit at all? <laughs> <laughs> I almost did that one time. Yeah, <laughs> almost. <laughs> almost. I was going to have this thing here. Almost, like, I almost hey. did it. That was frightening. That was really, that was really frightening. <laughs> Be careful, man. Does it need repairing? Yes. I can repair it. It's down 10 points. Oh no. <clears throat> See, I want wild healing you and so when you back up, say here, work on this. Yeah, it's repaired. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. Okay, bend it out a little bit. I have a little anvil and stuff in a bag, like shorter yeah. stuff. <laughs> Here's a little anvil for stuff. This time he's looking at it. Yeah, yeah because you know what? Down, down in the south end where the big bad guys are, they're all going, Is somebody hammering? <laughs> <laughs> you guys hear that or am I crazy? It's that that is definitely a craft check. <laughs> Yeah, you have to make a craft check against their perception DC. <laughs> <laughs> where where okay. are my minions? Go go find out who's doing that hammering. It's disturbing me. We are investigating the hell out of this room as well as all of the bodies. <clears throat> I guess I can walk in here now. Yeah. Sorry, I should probably get my butt in there. Then the rest of your team. After after the last one falls. <laughs> 
before the hammering starts? No, before, before the hammering before, starts. Yeah, the, the, the hammering um, disrupts the deathly quiet. Then, uh, <laughs> of all places. It what? Is, <laughs> it, these two rooms are ju are just horrifyingly <laughs> gory. Yeah, after this battle. Not it. Uh, <laughs> I'm not cleaning this you mess are, up. You are most of it. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not cleaning this mess up. I mean, not, not just from the damage of the battle, but then, you know, as, as you kill your foes, the uh, exploding yeah, brain right. system. Uh, except, except the one completely disintegrated into yeah. non existence. <laughs> yeah, see? You know, ink, was, it, ink does it right. Yeah. <laughs> ink is considerate. <laughs> Nothing to clean up. <laughs> um, it's a little not. gray powder. Yeah. No body to hide. That up yeah. she, was the she was, but but I'm sure Steve said, "Well, that was the treasure bearer." So sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> it's an easy way to get out of it. Um, the treasure. Yeah, you, as it as things quiet down and the, and the, the sounds of demons hammering, <laughs> 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 yeah. it's probably echo throughout the entire monastery. <laughs> Well, look at he's like, what? and fade off into the distance. Um, yes, yeah, check out this room. It's filled with uh, beds, but they don't appear to really be used. Have been used. You, you don't know if these things sleep. They're there for sure. <laughs> um, there's a stat and in a very old statue on the north wall of a huge, wing. very happy looking dwarf. Really can check. Um, holding up like a, uh, yeah, it looks a like a, a very happy dwarf in um, simple robes, kind of holding his stomach and um, like, like holding up a, a stein. Um, the 28 religion. <laughs> ha ha, ink. <laughs> oh, suck it. Not a competition, guys. Weird. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not a competition, <laughs> guy. Um, I, you're probably not all that well versed in the dwarves and pantheon, but you're pretty sure that that is um, Grundenar. Okay. One of the sons of Torag. Um, the drunk one. The, the, the ne'er do well. The drunk one, yeah. Yeah, the, the fun one. God, uh, yeah, the fun one. Kind of, uh, the dwarven god of fun. Um, <laughs> the only one. <laughs> the only one. <laughs> yeah, really. Um, that is, at least that's why fun. he's the outcast. What do you mean <laughs> fun? It's a so, fun um, thing you speak of. He's the dwarven god of families, friends, family, friends, drink. Um, he probably be the closest uh, dwarven pantheon. <laughs> Uh, Dorman got a family night game night. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's it. Uh, probably the closest thing to Dorman equivalent to like Hayden Kale. Yeah. Um, right, so you, you kind of get the impression perhaps this building originally was to him. Here, there was, was a monastery to him. Drunken monastery. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's a fun kind of monastery. That's a best kind. And these beds look like they're from that era. <laughs> <laughs> they look like they've been funned on a couple of times. Yeah. <laughs> this, is, this is the inebriation ward. <laughs> yeah, just, just lay down. You're going to be fine. Right. You'll be fine. The room will stop spinning at some point. The, the direct pressure. That's the room. Yeah. Mm -hmm. is um, being recognized as Grundenar, the I believe the youngest son of Thorag. He the, He'll always be the dwarven god of fun to me. He's the dwarven god of fun. He's the dwarven god of uh, family, friendship, alcohol. Um, he's also known as the peacemaker. Uh, a drunken peacemaker. Yep. Yeah. That I, wait, no, wait a second. How are you spelling peace? <laughs> it's important. P I E C E. <laughs> <laughs> I -S -S. <laughs> That's why Damien knew who he was. <laughs> he was on. Uh, but see, he would probably be the um, the, the dwarven pantheon equivalent to the alien. Okay. So if I knew anything about religion, I know that. Yeah. <laughs> um, hey, this is the short version of the game, Gary. 
And so the only thing you guys find either in the room or on the bodies, the giant thing that was wearing a like an animal cloak um, that mm -hmm. that does radiate magic. Um, it, is a, it is a uh, finger up. Kind of an animal wine cloth. <laughs> hey, you didn't forget that Aeon stone of like 90 hit points. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, you mean 100 ones? Yeah, 100. <laughs> <laughs> it has been two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> it has been two weeks. <laughs> hey, Les, can you tell us what this quote does? <clears throat> uh, yeah, absolutely, I can. I will uh, do that thing that I do. Uh, so well. Ooh, 43. Crap, dude. Um, he can tell you who made it. <laughs> this was Bill's. <laughs> this was Bill's. This is a cloak made from, from a bear. Yeah, like, wow. Oh. And kind of, you know, you wear it like that. I feel like um, wearing a bear. It's called, rug. it's called a berserker cloak. Um, oh, that's me. We don't know what to do with that. <laughs> 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 so I'll have to, you have to look it all up to see if. if it really helps a barbarian with the animal totem, but um, do we have the animal totem? You no. Know, if um, if you don't have the animal totem, if you want, we rage you to grow claws. Mm. But um, I, I th this might be a smell item for you guys. Yeah, I don't I know. know. I don't need anything. <clears throat> well, I'll want to look it up to see if you, if you get any other benefits from it. I think. Sure. Something I get like that's the animal shape by yourself too. Um, okay, that's the only item. Yeah, no plus two uh, weapons or anything like that. Not yet. Well, we'll keep looking. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what we came here for is well, we're not leaving without it. A bunch of barrels of the milk stuff in the other room. You guys can start drinking that stuff. No, we're not drinking it. <laughs> they don't know which ones I feed in. Maybe a dab. I'm not drinking any of them. You are Hey guys, time to go south. Um, perception check in the room. Anything else in that room? Um, top room or bottom room? The top room. Uh, no. Bottom room? This room now. We you guys go back into the bottom room. We think about it. Um, like I said there's there's barrels. Um we're still trash. Chairs up the room. Oh, yeah. um, this, this door down here appears to be like uh, boarded shut. I know. I'm trying to. But... Oh, that must be the south door. Yeah, it'd be the south door if they don't go in. Because mm -hmm. it's boarded. Let's not go in there right now. Yeah, that's not necessarily where the boss is. The boss right. is on the southwest area. Okay. Because there is a door over here. Mm -hmm. So hopefully. That goes to the boss, and we don't deal with the other stuff yet. Let's deal with the boss. Okay. <clears throat> I am going to look for traps and then listen at the door. I'm going to listen at this door. No, that one's uh, barred, and you know they're worried about what's behind that one. Okay. All right, so then I won't listen. Oh, you can listen in. Okay. Yeah, that's all you want. You I got the ink listen at the south yeah. door? You uh I got an F20 in the other one. Boss is this way. Ink ink listens at that south door. Here's nothing. You can break. <laughs> You 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 press your ear against that door. You hear the you, you hear the beating of your own heart, and that's that's literally it. All right, I right, step back, and get away from that door, just in case. I'm sure I got a nap, very long nap twenty of the other door. Listening at it and looking for traps. One second here to see if there's any. Yeah. Cool flavor text. If it's cool, we don't want it. Right. <laughs> We're looking for the mundane. Just mm -hmm. kind of... I reject your flavor text and all it works. And all its empty promises.
Okay, uh, I'm sorry, you, you, you were listening to this store back? Mm -hmm. um, and checking the traps. Oh, you're checking the you, traps? You, you do not see any. Okay, I don't hear anything. I'm open it up and going in. Me again. Let's do it. Yeah. Funny how that's been working. Don't offer to help. Yeah. He's read the modules. I mean, it would be helpful if he did just give him the end. He hasn't read this module. <laughs> <laughs> this one I have this. <laughs> <laughs> um, you open here? the door, um, you see an ancient, ancient hallway. Mm -hmm. um, Although now, it has mean? obviously been used, um, there are you know, there's cobwebs, but they're, they're, they're tattered. You know, things have walked through here. Cool. Um, um, yeah, so so plan. There's a a shelf on the wall mm -hmm. um, with with some. <laughs> Agendas on it? No, uh, like, uh, I'm not going to tie it, but step in more. Let us in. What's in the shelf? Looks like very old dwarven artwork. Uh, <laughs> yeah. graphic artwork. <laughs> Commissioned by the god of fun. What would that look like? Axes, swords. <laughs> I'll uh, I'll send you some. Okay. I'll send you some JPEGs. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Like uh, one thing is one, one thing you can see. You know, it's covered in dust and webs. So it's finely crafted. Mm -hmm. um, the items on the shelf you would estimate are probably worth okay. a good two hundred gold. Back in back in cold war. I'm taking them. Fingers. I'm marking it dwarven shelf items. <laughs> dwarven <laughs> shelf items. Dwarven <laughs> shelf items. What? Input that. I don't even know what that is. Uh, it's something that came up earlier and it kind of stuck on me. I don't know. Sometimes you just have to refresh or get out and back in before those things go away. So I just refresh or refresh. Try F5. Well, I was going to say it's not doing anything. Yeah, there's a few people that use Roll20 on Friday nights, or maybe a lot. Or, and so the Roll20 servers get slow on Friday nights. Oh, yeah. Friday and Saturday nights. Mm -hmm. um, I am going to try to do a separate perception check. I'm going to listen at every door and check for traps. So um, you tell me you want me to do two rolls every time I go to the door or just one? Just do one. Okay, 28 for this door. What are we, oh, that door. Uh, so basically, I'm I'm going to listen first, and then I'll scan the door, see if I see any trap or anything on it. Hey, Ink, come with us. You hear us? No, I'm sick, of the, I'm sick of this dungeon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so done with this. A soft bubbling sound. Yeah. Save one of those disintegrates for the boss. I still got one more. Okay. Plus a few other surprises in my can of tricks. You've actually been pretty yeah, awesome. Comes in, comes in. I think everyone's been awesome today. Of course we have. Not good. Like I said, it's Friday night. The servers are kind of over. Okay. 
Um, I hear some bubbling behind this door. The brewing more, more uh, that that uh, there was that spout in this nice. other room, so they're probably brewing it and dumping so, it in there. So my urine's down here. Your urine's <laughs> in there right now. <laughs> There's more, there's more friggin' pee in this dungeon. I'll tell you what. <laughs> they got barrels of it here. Got barrels. <laughs> How much do you pee? <laughs> Barrel, just put, it, just, just put it in the river like everybody else does. Just go up, just go upstream of the camp and put it in the river. <laughs> This last time you were drinking out of that mug you've got. Yeah, <laughs> I got a drinking time I want, so you might as well. He's trying to stay hydrated. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> I keep. I stick with that story. Yeah. <laughs> but it just as you hear in Orange Bar, we can't tell this midnight milk has been tainted. <laughs> <laughs> it's ruined all of it. Switch. Your type. <laughs> <laughs> Starts laughing. <laughs> okay, I'm going to open this door then. Well, and step in. You open the door and um, you see two. This, this room looks like it's been fairly cleaned out. You know, there's still some webs mm -hmm. around shop. But the debris and rubble off the floor looks like it's been um, swept out. Um, on the far wall are two large, possibly brass tanks um, with fire underneath them. And you can see. Well, it's not a discovery because they'd be copper up there. <laughs> <laughs> you can see there's a, a a metal pipe is coming out of the wall and then branching out and going into the top of where your pee place. was. <laughs> <laughs> They're boiling the pee. <laughs> oh my <laughs> god! They're distilling it. There's the bone smell in here. Um, making COVID cleanser. <laughs> COVID cleanser. <laughs> hey, did you guys for uh, you all you Illinoisans who haven't got the shot yet? Did you hear the news they announced tonight? That they're uh, that every county is going to have the ability to open up for everybody uh, whenever they feel comfortable doing so. You know, in earlier the state the state will still go April twelfth, but uh, any 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 health county health department can can open it up to everybody earlier than that if they can. Like I, I got my email yesterday that I'm I did sign up, so I I got shot one on Tuesday. Really nice Walgreens. I got shot one on Monday. Mine opens up on yeah, the ninth. I'm, I'm going. I go tomorrow morning for shot one. Because then yesterday I got the email from St. Clair County telling me that I could come to the fairgrounds and get a shot. So <laughs> too late, guys. My fairgrounds. Get, get another one. <laughs> <laughs> no, how about two first? Does that make us first and second? Yeah, they're delicious. <laughs> yeah, I was through the fairgrounds in thirty minutes. Yeah, and I, that's with I was the, at, that's with the twenty minute wait you're supposed to be at the yeah, end. I was, I was, yeah, I'm yeah. hoping they got that little four hour wait thing fixed before I go tomorrow. I I schedule I, I go at 10 and it's only been open for two hours. So I'm like, oh how many people could possibly squeeze in you know for their five o'clock appointment before me? I'm gonna show up at eight and block the thing for four You know put your car over sideways in the entryway. The only thing that bothers me is my arm was really sore. Yeah my arm was sore for a day. It was yeah I mean it's it it showed up. Shelly complained about that, and then the second shot, uh, she like like the the day night of, she said, God, it almost feels like I'm getting it again. And then the next day, uh, our first first night, first night thought she was getting in, really tired. Next day, stomach kind of bothered. Then she was fine. But I've got knocked out after the first one, and then got nothing. Nothing. Out of nothing. Out of nothing. Out of no, Shelly maybe don't have any of the long term stuff, right? Not well, Shelly's still trying to uh, smell and taste. No, taste back. Back. Oh, wow, okay. She can taste some things. Um, she cannot taste chocolate, which is really ticking her off. Oh, I bet. It, it, she said it's like biting into a block of wax, <laughs> it, 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 which it, is it, actually what chocolate is. Yeah. <laughs> it, you know, it's got the she can tell the texture and everything, but no taste. Um, what's the point? <laughs> exactly. The weird thing is, she can taste salads, she can taste. That's just cruel. Yeah, yeah. Cruel. Um, like if I if, if I make hamburgers, 
We can taste the lettuce, onion, lettuce and on, onion, all that, not the ham. Wow. Wow. Yeah. That's so weird. Yeah. It's the healthy virus. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Don't make it for you. Don't want to eat all the crap because it all tastes better. Yeah. And, uh, search. Well, sometimes it is. Search this room real quick and uh, we'll go. I think I'm going to search this room for, for B. I don't know. <laughs> We can definitely find that. <laughs> yeah, put out their pea fire. Hey, are we good to be on the fire? Everybody got to go. There's you be on the fire. We can stop this process. Hey, you're pretty sure this is, you know, those pipes lead into the wall. It's all part of whatever, whatever process we can build stuff. Right? You know, foundry thing they got going here. 24 looking through the rooms, looking for anything. Exit, you know, you. Oh, the little we see. Yeah. Okay. All right. Come back out. Nothing to see here. Moving down the hall. He's on down. He's on down there. Damon loots the uh, the shelf stuff. Yep. And then I'm gonna listen and check the traps in the store. Thank you actually by better perception than I am by be doing this. You, mm -hmm. this, this, What's your perception? You don't, you don't believe there's any traps, and you, you hear nothing behind this door. Thank you. Yeah, your perception's three better than mine. Okay, mm -hmm. I am going to open it and step in. Walk into what was probably another alchemical workshop. Um, this one does not appear to have been in use, though. Okay. Um, there's empty work tables, and one of those uh, metal, well, you're convinced metal urinal. <laughs> hey, there's another urinal, there, guys. <laughs> Your mask gotta go. <laughs> this place is lousy with those urinals. They're everywhere, right? Right, right yeah. <laughs> That's what they're doing out here. They're having a big pee party on this island. <laughs> You think a bunch of brains on legs wouldn't, wouldn't use such low humor. I know. They probably don't have to pee. <laughs> okay. Okay, back out and see you in the hall. Okay. Going to uh, listen and you want me to do that? Yes, why don't you listen? I'll check for traps. You listen. Uh, you're, you're better at listening than I am. Oh, he's doing it just to point out. This is how we roll. This is how we roll. Like right there. Kind of thing. We support each other in every way possible. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yeah. So, yeah. So, do a skills perception. Skills perception. So, I did a 20 looking for traps. I'm quite convinced there's no traps on here. <laughs> <laughs> and I know I'm right. Around the corner, you hear some of these He's going to touch this door now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he got a 38. He got a 38 perception. Wow. Um, so he hears them telling me, he's like, there's a bunch of hours in there making fun of you. <laughs> making fun of you. Making fun of you. <laughs> like, wait, wait, wait. You're trash yet. You hear, you, once again, you hear, you hear bubbling. You hear. Close the door, I'm peeing. <laughs> you're <laughs> you're, you're urinating. Uh, <laughs> <you're laughs> <you're laughs> <you're laughs> you're noise. Occu Occupado. Occupado. Into, into something. We yell in there, shake it off. <laughs> we yell, <laughs> housekeeping. <laughs> or is it twice you're playing with it? <laughs> <laughs> you, Open you, it up. You hear, you hear definite liquid sounds like bubbling and maybe water. Okay. You know, like dripping and pouring into something. Now I gotta go to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I know a, I know a barrel you can I fill up. <laughs> I'm opening the door and stepping in. Okay, you open the door. Can I step in? Oh, I don't step in. Actually, <laughs> <laughs> what I meant by stepping in was I'm gonna stay out here. <laughs> oh, there's a big old. <laughs> there's a big old pee party going on in there. Yeah. I already said I was stepping oh. in, so I open the door and step in. Like, Whoa. Um, you step in and you startle the you know um housekeeping in midstream. You startle this creature <laughs> in midstream. <laughs> um you can't stop. Who turns nope. you can't just stop. And pees on itself. Like that one 
uh, it 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 was at this like tub in front of it. Um, you got the and, and above the tub are pipes pouring liquid into one it. Of, one of them pouring be in there. Um, one one must be in it, <laughs> and it looked like it. Check this watch. <laughs> it says I've got a thing. Mm -hmm. I'm out of here. Wait, wait a minute, I just got a text from someone complaining about. It wasn't me. This the urine me. taste of the milk. <laughs> 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 Don't we be too loud. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Last Christmas. Whoops. Megan got. I give you my heart. <laughs> Ray right never actually it. gets us anything, but she had bought these uh, chocolate snowmen for us. Okay. And um, so he kept them for three years and gave them to me. <laughs> <laughs> so they've been in the cabinet. Been in the next few years yeah. and they've been in the cabinet since Christmas. And Megan's like, "Oh, don't forget the chocolate snowmen." I got you. Like, oh, well, they, you know, we'll, we'll get you money, but. It's kind of a, a sentimental gift, too. Oh no, Shelly opened up the cabinet and the head's bitten off her. Um, <laughs> Megan, she Megan, bowed it that Megan, way. Megan is eating these yes. snowmen that she got us. Yes, yes. Yeah. Uh, That's because they're not it. I mean, this this <laughs> big uh, kind of spider looking thing is. Um, was that that stuff? It looked like it was filling its mouth with the saying, contents like of the tub. Yeah, yeah. Get this yeah spun around. Uh huh. Um, Green or liquid dripping. I say, you've got, you've got you got, you got a little. Um, <laughs> if you look at these, and when this thing spins around, that's gross. It's got, wow. it's got, wow. it's got the whiskers on it, and in, in each whisker, so it's like in kind of a, a viscous, yellow looking fluid, you can see what looks like. Human brains. Oh man. Oh my God. No, they can't be this. <laughs> We're safe. <laughs> They're not like the village of our brains. These look like actual human brains. No, we bought something like this in last year's plane. You know what? How'd you guys make that? Uh, it wasn't good. Okay. So Initiative? We, yep. Uh, wait a minute. Let me clear the. Should we even do that? <laughs> they're they're looking for brains. We're safe. <laughs> we don't have any. There's guys around the corner. Up yeah, there. The, I'm pretty sure. Okay, wait a minute. You... If you guys are looking for pee, I know where you can get a whole bunch. <laughs> you know, do your initiative. Oh. God damn it! Look at that bad boy. Yeah. I'm gonna be top of the order where I'm going to delay. I like your character. I like your character. I mean, yeah. There you go. Yes. And you're in there. That's 23. That's in, are we? And you can't run it without clicking on a character. <laughs> I'll figure out a way. <laughs> I know. I know. I'll mess he'll, it up. He'll bypass yeah. the safety for now. Now you turn the gauntlet down. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get quite as good of a roll as I got last time. Me neither. Yeah, keep doing those ones. Don't miss your thing. <laughs> you guys, so quick question. Do you guys all have missile weapons? I, I do. I have magic missile. Yes. I would all right. Uh, hey, Steve, I'm going to cast one of your favorite hey, spells. Mm -hmm. Black ah. tentacles. Oh, I'm, ca okay. I'm casting black. <laughs> I'm casting black testicles. It's one of Steve's favorite. That's a different spell. That's I have no graphic. That's, that's no good. Thank God. Thank God. God. I saw it on the internet. You would. It's a little. It's a legitimate spell. I saw it on the internet. 
Yeah. That's true. what the Roll20 Premier membership is. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So I need a uh, a 20 foot um, burst. I need a 20 foot radius uh, thing that I can throw on it. I got you, Black. Who says it's your turn? <laughs> I'm top. I can roll a 42 initiative. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> what do you think? A 42 gets you to go first? It's not only, not only is it my turn, it's going to be my turn again before you go. You guys keep your black tentacle. Oh, that is awesome looking. <laughs> wow. That is cool. Hey, Steve, where did, I wanted to ask you, where did you get these? He stole them. Stole them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow, just every, hey, Les? Yeah. Every time you sign up for a PFS game. Yeah. Um. You can go through their library and take anything. <laughs> Ooh, really? Uh, go go into your character vault and bring in everything from there from, that they have, and then export it to somebody to, to your own. Right. Um, I use that uh, that campaign that we never did anything with. I got tons of stuff. That, that's like Ooh, a, cool. a repository. All right. Cool. So yeah, so I want to get everybody. So I and could you put it like to the back so I can see the creatures too? You can move it, Les. No, no. I can't. I can't move it backwards. I can move it to the back, so it it stays behind the okay. creatures. There, there we go. Yeah. So I want to do like, hold on, uh, like that. That's where I want it. So DC thirty one. Uh, they attempt to grapple each each spell attack. Uh, fortitude. Okay, it says make spell attack rolls against the fortitude DC of each creature. What? Each creature gets a save. You know what I mean? Right. Okay. Uh, then my sp and that's against my my. Uh, so it's a thirty one <laughs> essentially. Uh, not the word black. Okay, uh, oily black tentacles rise up and attempt to grapple, make spell attack rules against the four DC of each creature. Any creature you succeed against is grabbed and take three D six bludgeoning. Um, that doesn't make that doesn't make any sense. They have to save against my. They have a. They do. They have to do a four DC against my no, spell save, no, right? No, their four DC is. Well, here I'll just tell you. You kind of roll an attack. And then you attack them. You attack their fort. Okay, their fort okay. save is they, they add if they roll a fortitude save they add plus fifteen. So, so I got to beat it fifth twenty five. So you I got to beat it twenty five. All right, uh, all right. Here we go. Front. I'll, I'll move from front to back away from me. <clears throat> There's first guy, second guy, third guy. They're all. Okay. They're all nabbed. So they each they each are grabbed and they take three d six bludge, which I will. Is roll. there a crit to the black tentacles? Like a crit? Uh, like no, it doesn't have any any crit okay. to it. I'm not seeing anything. They would say okay. That. So uh, that forty was. <laughs> yeah. Any creature you succeed against is grabbed and takes three d six bludgeoning. Eleven points of bludge. The and then. All yeah, just uh, yeah, it's all of them, and then uh, and then um, they're yeah, they're grabbed. So uh, the only thing you do is try to break free, right? Okay, let me, let me it's yeah, and it also makes you flat-footed and immobilized. So flat -footed, the tentacles escape DC yeah, is equal to my spell DC, which is thirty-one. If they're flat-footed. Check it and see. <laughs> they've, got, they've got a penalty to their AC. <laughs> uh, and that's my three actions. You sure? Yep, that's it. <laughs> and he's going to take a potion out and use it. And I cast disintegrate on all of them. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> okay, so uh, that one back there. Let's see what else they can do. Absolutely nothing. Well, you could try to escape. Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's really the only thing that you can do. Okay. The one close to tie doesn't have to move this pack. So it can swing at tie. As futile as that is. <laughs> basic action. Um, depends on these martial creatures. They've got a good shot if they're not. I don't know if they have an unarmed attack modifier. Uh, 
I'll try it. Acrobatics or athletics. Yeah. And what what am I going up against? 30. DC DC thirty one. Okay. Uh, he's going to try an athletics check to get out. Thirty four. Damn. Uh, so he is going to bust his way out of the tentacles. Uh, and, and then okay, I guess to avoid ending his turn there, right? Right. Um, he's going to scurry through here. He has two actions. Uh, the only thing he can do now is bite. We'll bite a tie and Ooh, a 23. He's kind of shaken up. <laughs> Damien. Um I'm gonna cast uh three of frost. You're not singing yet. No, it's not. Twenty-five to hit. That will miss. Okay. Um, I'm going to do flat-footed. Oh, that's right. Even flat-footed. Uh, that would only be two lower, though. Is it okay? <clears throat> so twenty-seven wouldn't hit. Okay. <laughs> uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, I'm done. Die. Since I'm on defense duty, I'm going to use two actions. I'm going to try and intimidate both of them. Amber alert. Oh, we got an alert. Oh, an amber alert. Amber's missing. So keep an eye out for it. Yeah. yeah that's all. That's a long way away. Yeah. yeah. That's like. 30 minutes away, 30, 40 minutes away. Okay. I'm sorry, what's going on? He is intimidating both of them. I'm okay. going to try and intimidate both of them. So the first one's going to be for the top guy, the next one's going to be for the left guy. So 29 for the top one. That will not succeed. And 33 for the left one. That will succeed. It kind of, you know, this isn't scuttled back a little bit. Just two actions. And then I'm going to attack the guy. The scared guy. No one's been. No one's hurt. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to attack the left guy. They've all taken 11 points of damage from the tentacles. Right. So 29. Well, plus two. Could and he's scared. Oh, wait a minute. Three. You did. Know, he's, not, he's not flat footed. With, with that ray of frost. Or, uh, yeah. Ray of frost. Yeah. Okay. About 22 one. points of damage then, and it's cold damage in case that matters. And then I would have. And I have a cold iron kukri. <laughs> not that you hit it with it. No, but. And then I would have actually attacked the guy to the north then, uh, since he was already damaged. That one? Yeah. Okay. So he takes 13, or no, it's 12 points of damage. So 12 plus 22 plus 11. And I'm done. Castillo. Sing. Or sing a song. Make a six pass. Make the whole day. Yeah, pass the whole day. Yeah. Thank you, Karen Carpenter. Um, <laughs> and actually, where you're at, you okay. can probably shoot the guy to my left. I was just saying, I can see the guy to the northwest. Um, so, same with my first. I'm going to shoot it at somebody. Shoot twice? Shoot twice at him. I'm go first. Which probably so missed. 26, that probably misses. Um, he's scared twice. That will hit. Oh, okay. And so, 12. 13, 13, 13 points of damage. On which one? Uh, the, the one the left the guy. The scared guy, the left guy. The scared guy. Oh, the guy in the corner? Yeah. yeah. All right. I'm, 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 I'm 
uh, 12, 13. 13. This guy here. And then do your second. Whoops. Oh. And my second one misses. Okay. Bailfer. Bailfer. Okay. Um, okay. So there is one spare up here. If you, I'm gonna do this one. I'm gonna do a move in here, and that only one of them can get to you. Then I'm gonna do my dragon. Um, one second. Breath. Yep. Wow. Thirty foot cones. I should get two of them. Yeah. Oh yeah. <clears throat> I hand uh, I hand Belfair a mint. <laughs> <laughs> Indigestion. <laughs> well, thumbs. Okay, they are grabbed, so I'm not sure what that does to their reflex. They're immobile. Is it minus? Oh, they minus two. Two yellow. Is that 43 damage per level? No. <laughs> I can't be right. 20 total damage. Right. It's like place, the flat footed, and mobile. 1 right. Six right. It, well, yeah. Well, I thought, but yeah. it's the way it reads. It's yeah, a, I know. Yeah. It's a 30 foot line or 15 cone. foot cone. 15 foot cone. It's only if I've, it's only if I've done it in the last hour. So 30 foot cone. Well, it's a 30 foot cone, but yeah. if you've done it last hour, it's a 15, 15 foot, foot cone. cone. Yeah. Okay. So and one d six every two levels. Okay. Yeah. Um. What type of energy is it? Just it's done by dragon. It's, it's not fire, dragon. Fire acid. Yeah. Um. I think it's fire. I think it's fire. Yeah. Red dragon. Or yeah. Red I think gold. it is. Yeah. <coughs> like, yeah hopefully gold. <laughs> so it's good as dragon right people. Thing. Okay. So. Uh, One right next to you will go first. Now, the fire seemed to do good damage to him. Ooh, we got one. That's not uh, great. What, what, what's the DC? For the tentacles? No, no for the, uh, uh, the fire. They missed that. It's, it's gonna be uh, each your, creature gets a basic reflex save. Yeah, it's it's going to be your class DC on the front DC. page. Okay. Yeah. Pardon? It'll be your class DC on my front page. Yeah. Right above your melee tricks. Hopefully, it's about 24. They're flat footed and immobilized if that has an effect on reflex saves. 32. 32. Oh, okay, so he crit failed, uh, crit failed that. The second one <coughs> failed. Just normal failed. Just normal, okay. normal failed. Okay, Sweet so crit failed. the uh, top one takes 86, 86 points of damage. Ow. <laughs> and that's got to hurt just a tiny, <laughs> tiny bit. Yeah. And then the other one takes. I jump. <laughs> I'm sitting here bracing to be attacked, and all of a sudden. <laughs> Bill here comes running into the room, room. <laughs> pushing his well, crap, and just uh, throws his arms back and blows out a cone of, of fire. <laughs> now, um, the black tentacles do burn up, although new ones regrow. Oh. <laughs> uh, since this one took uh, crit damage, and I gotta see, I gotta see what happens here. <coughs> Something bad because that might He's happen. discouraged. Yeah, it is. He's sad. Um, He's sad one. Sad one. <laughs> he explodes to implode. Also imploding. Yep. Okay. If if it takes, it must succeed at DC twenty six uh, for it save. Um, or it, or one of the, its um, brain Brains. blisters it explodes. If that happens, I believe it's stupefied. <laughs> well, being brainless, it should oh, be. Yeah. <laughs> Even yeah, that was it's fair. So, so roll your save. What was it? A 40, 26, 42. 42. Oh, 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 crit okay. failed. <laughs> I think two brains should blow up. I think two brains should blow up. too. Uh, <laughs> okay, let's see. Let me look up what stupefied does again. 
Disturbed has a song about it. Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's it's negative two to spell casting, will saves, uh, spell attack rolls, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so minus two on mental stuff. Yeah. It has to make a, a five flat check to cast the spell. Okay. Um, Which way you've been rolling. <laughs> Especially feel, that guy. Feel free to keep it up. We will have our PH turn. It's okay. It's going to make a, uh, a flat check. <laughs> you made it. Um, all of a sudden, the room is filled with image, other images of it as it casts your image. Yeah, that'll protect the against a breath weapon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, then it'll try to escape. Why? I don't think it should. We've got nowhere to go but yeah. north. Yeah, back into the tentacles. Well, there's a little bit of a clear area we go all the way north. Yeah. It does not escape the tentacles. It oh, um. Ha <laughs> ha, dick bag. It, it doesn't it take, don't, doesn't it take bludgeoning damage then? Uh, yeah. Each yeah, round. Is, yeah, hold on a second. If it ends its turn there, it takes bludgeoning damage. 3d6. It's yep. Pretty, pretty I hope so. Please, Wait, no. Uh, whenever a creature ends its turn in the area, the tentacles attempt to grab that creature. And say, oh, never mind. Uh, they deal 1d6 bludgeoning to any creature already grabbed. Oh. So not another 3d6, just another d6. Three points. Well, that won't cut it. Why? <laughs> <clears throat> so one of you is ranged. to try to shoot towards the back. Okay, this guy's gonna try to escape. Oh, come on up. That's not a good Ha ha. Try again. Whoa. Wait, you can't just try again. So I tried once, less laughed at it, which encouraged it, yeah. Don't well, now the, from now on, when I miss saves, I'm going to try again, too. It's, it's another action. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. <laughs> um, it's going to scuttle up the wall and try to get back here. Um, get out of the tentacles. Yeah. Okay, that's, 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 that's everything. Ink. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing anymore. I had a plan, but if you uh, can hit him in the back, he's almost dead. Yeah, that's what I'm going to try to do. Uh, Actually, I'm looking. I'm looking for the right the thing. Touched yet? I don't think. Or, or barely. Which one? On the back. The one. In, what about the fire damage to my? Um, oh, the one in the back is the one that got yeah. credit and everything. Oh, this is the one that got credit. We can't get credit. The one the uh, regular layer in pink. Yeah. Well, I, I, I marked the damage, I think, for, for this one and this one. Well, it would have been my cone would have gone down. It would have been would have gone out towards yeah, hell. Yeah, I'm not sure. Because it would have got tied. Yeah, the cone would have got, yeah, would have got this one and, that and one. this one. Right. Okay. And the one on the back is the one that got critted. He got critted and lost a brain. And yeah. The one in the back. Okay, so and what I'm like going to... What I'm going to do to him... And I'm definitely doing it to him. Uh, is uh, I'm gonna try. So if I do a hydraulic push, it comes from my direction, right? That's the only direction yeah. it goes. All right. I wanted to try and push him back into the tentacles, <laughs> but um, so but said, I don't... Well, you could dimension door here. <laughs> well, no, I, would, I did it. All, I dimension door off the wand, so I can't do that. So. Uh, I'm just going to, um, I don't want to hurt anybody uh, of my guys. Oh, well, I mean, could I, could I, could I, let, uh, no, I'm just going to do the hydraulic push. On one of the close guys? Oh, no, on the farthest one. I'm going to shoot all the way through. So let me double check that to make sure I got the range. It does some damage? Yeah, it does. Okay. Uh, but that way I don't necessarily want to light him up with a, a light right. bolt. Fuck's sake, what's going on? I'm gonna line with the lighting. Oh, wait, no. I try to send more fire. Remember, your sword does five, one d six fire. 
because Angel's like, I'm right here. Dude. Range is 60. So it's within 60. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Be very sporty. <laughs> All right. My attack is 38. Uh, is that a crit? Oh, uh, yes. Our, yeah, it is, it is, a, that is a crit. It is a crit? Awesome. So that means uh, critical success. The target takes 59 bludgeoning damage and is knocked backwards 10 feet. Obviously, he can't go backwards 10 feet. So he bounces off the wall and comes back into the tentacles. Actually, actually, actually he's flat against, against the wall. <laughs> and then doesn't do much after that. Yeah. Sploosh. You stepped on him. Got him. All right. Uh, I'm, I'm going to stay right where I'm at. So that's it for me. He's so just so you know, he's the one intimidating is much more damage than the one that you can't get there. Right. Yeah, yeah. Just kill the one you're exactly. Working. That's what I'm going for. Go away, you. So who's acting right now? The left one or the top one? Uh, the left one right now. This one. Okay. He is going to cast a disbelief. A sickly gray ray shoots out at the tail here and tries to sap his strength. He's at 2842. Yep, save. I should make that a 26 for Right. Oh, it doesn't matter. Huh. I think you need it. <laughs> <laughs> you got a quick success. Yeah. Doesn't matter him, so does what success does. I don't make him when I'm fighting my own people. Actually, you didn't quite make the crit success. Well, with this plus one. Ah, yes. He did. Okay. Yep. Yeah. So nothing happens. Uh it's only stays versus fear. Oh, is it? The inspired courage. Oh, okay. So never mind. It is it's plus one attack, success. plus one damage, plus one save versus fear. So he just had a regular success. Okay. Uh, you are enfeebled one. Um, meaning you'll be at a minus one. Um, this round. For me? Yeah. Okay. When you kill this guy. Right, kill this guy. <laughs> That's kind of what I'm going for. Okay. Uh, Then he, then it still gets one at bite at Kai. <clears throat> okay. Damien. 26 to hit this guy who's stuck in the webs or whatever, or in the yeah, that will. 19 uh, he, points of. He had uh, mirror image up, though. Dun, dun. Uh, okay. Uh, how many of them are there? Total, including him. Yeah, we're gonna cast it again. Oh, sure. I want to cast it. I want to cast it again too. <laughs> Oops, there we go. Okay, there's three images. We give a one and four shot. Um, okay, which one is he? He's always the highest one. Roll D4, he's four. and he's always, even as you're switching, as you're using, I just sort of say the highest one. Because okay, I can make it whatever diagram. Right. Oh, one, one and a one D4 is, hit, is hitting him. Oh, okay. Okay, one. Mm -hmm. Let's see what he says. Two. So one of them gone. Okay. And now there's three. The three left. One and two images. The one to two and a one and a one D6. If you, next time you hit them, I, I can do a one d three, oh, and I go first. So my little windy hits can still take these things out. Mm -hmm. I got a macro that prompts for whatever side it is. You saw the jacks? Uh, no, that's two uh, actions, and my third one, I'm just gonna sit there. I'm not doing resting on your walls. Resting on my logs. 
Okay. Right. I'm going to try and intimidate the guy to the north. <clears throat> and then, which one? <laughs> so, 40. Is that a crit? Intimidation? Um, yes, it is. Okay, so he's scared too, or also. <laughs> um, again, yet. Again, yet, still. <laughs> um, and then with, so that's that, and then I'm attacking the north guy twice. I'm really just trying to do this a little bit. So, yeah, well, 38. Is it 38 hit? Yes, uh, you got a. Is he, still, is he still stuck? Yes. So it's a 40 then. You have to roll 1d3 though, because he's. Mm -hmm. And a one hits him. So a d1d3. Does that show up in the advanced battle? Or, or a one to two or a d6? You can say how many numbers. Okay, I'm going to do a d6. And one to two hits him. And a one to two, one to two hits him. There you go. Dang, I get some. Uh, so Dang it. Oh, I crit, I really <laughs> I'm really trying to use my wimpy attacks to get rid of the copy so that he can kill him. Oh, 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 oh okay. yeah, I'm always looking for that. So yeah, well, I'm really just trying to get rid of the yeah. copies. Yep. But if I got a crit, then yeah. it's yeah. worth yeah. actually yeah. Damn it. It's worth actually landing them. Get a connection. <laughs> so much you do. Okay. Um, so that would be 13, so 26 plus 5, so 31. That will get will by. It, 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 it falls over in the black tail. Just kind of, kind of pull it down. down. I literally would say, sorry, Fez, I didn't mean to jog you so hard. Dead. Just say, that's all we care about. <laughs> I didn't mean that's to jog you so hard. You got No, I got one more. Since the first swing killed him, then I, my last swing, I'm swinging. You're going to put reversal. <laughs> I'm, 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 my, got it. I'm going to whisper and tell him I've got crits. It's a free feat. <laughs> this didn't be bad. And then I'm going to use my last swing on left guy who is still scared one actually for me that is my free feet <laughs> at eighth level i get to choose a feat at mm -hmm. eighth level or lower and it's a fourth level feat like damn this is awesome <laughs> so does a 28 hit him that's with all the bonuses and everything yes him. so he takes 14 points of damage hang on 14 plus hang on 14 plus two fire and that works, uh, that's, what, that's the angel yeah. Oh, you remembered. <laughs> <laughs> the angel keeps trying. He's like, what? 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 No, okay. No, no, no. I was sleeping. <laughs> like, no, yeah. no, I got tired of waiting. Oh. I wanted to read the book. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, feel. All right. Um, He's still there. You can still hit him with an arrow. I'll keep singing and try sing twice. And then and two attacks. And then two attacks. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, let's see. I'll do 36 plus 37. 37 plus he's scared, so 38. <laughs> you just printed that one. So and then, uh, 18, 19, uh, 38 plus one, 39 points. So 39 for that first arrow. And a, and the brain popped out. <laughs> you need double. Uh, possibly get into the wall. The wall. <laughs> All right, so again. Uh, Longbow second. Yeah, why not? <laughs> oh, I think he's been affected with it. I'm not sure. That one probably misses. Yeah, is this the second attack? Yeah. I mean, was it adjusted for it? Okay. Yeah. It may have so been 24. So 20, then he's scared. So 25 total. Does that hit him? No. Okay. Our, our... 25 is everything. Okay. Then. Yeah. Just barely misses it. Okay. No, I still got one, right? Nope, you sang and uh, shot two arrows. So and we're not, you're not hasted. Yeah, we're not nice. So you only have three items. items. You only have three, so yeah, you're done. Yeah, okay. Right. Yeah, sure. So I can't get next to him because I do the tentacles. Now. Grab his hand and pull him out of the way. Ah, <laughs> I would, I'm going to do my friendly, my friendly toss and toss him out of the way. <laughs> I say, go ahead, toss me. Toss me. Toss him out of the way. <laughs> and don't tell the elf. And yeah, don't yeah. tell the elf. And I just toss him out through the doorway. Okay. And then I'll move up to where he is. You get one attack. <laughs> no, I still get two attacks. Uh, you tossed. You move. You're right. You're right. You right, get one attack. Right, right. So it can't be a power attack. No, so it can't be. You're right. You're correct. Right. 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 Right
let's be real. <laughs> Get out of the way. <laughs> Am I still raging or no? No. No. You yeah. You had the raging to use your dragon breath. Yeah. Oh, would have been, yeah. There you go. There you go. Probably like that's my way, right? Yeah. Like, I'm like, all right. Uh, uh, it's 30 yeah. something hit to the uh stupefied guy. <laughs> Caught in tentacles and missing two of its brains. Yeah. <laughs> 38. Right. Yeah. 39 because he's scared. There's, yeah. there's, there's still two brains stuck to the wall, quivering <laughs> like a horrible shit kebab above its head. So 48 plus 12, 60 points of damage. Oh, that, you. Yeah. <laughs> I thought I got to use the friendly toss. I like that. So is that a beat? Yeah. So, so what is that? It's a it's a friendly so toss. toss I can toss friend and toss him 20 feet. <laughs> no, 30 feet. I 30 feet. <laughs> we toss. You can toss your friends friend friend. around the battlefield. <laughs> Pick up an adjacent ally of your size or smaller and throw them to an unoccupied space. You can see within 30 feet. Their it's the barbarian version is. of Dimension Door. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, their movement doesn't trigger reactions. Your ally ends, ends the movement on their feet and doesn't take damage from the fall. If your ally ends this movement wow. within melee reach of at least one enemy, they can make a melee swing against an enemy within their reach at the reaction. So if, if that's well, freaking awesome. That is I awesome. like that. If the old bear wants you to blank with him, they're going <laughs> to you. Get over there. <laughs> There's a way to use that. There, go flank. Guys, I think, guys, I think he's still confused. I don't think my dispel magic worked. There we go. Oh, man. That is freaking awesome. Oh, man. That, that's, that's better than quick reverse. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, he could throw you into a flank position. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> or, 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 you know, I can yeah. have your space if I can throw you on the other side. Yeah, throw me into a blank, blank yeah. position. Yeah. So, <laughs> right. Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, you can't, it doesn't hurt you. No, no, no. Yeah. no. So, so he cuts in half a person and can, grabs you and throws you between two other people. <laughs> Les, can you get rid of the tentacles? Yeah, okay. or I will. I will. I will do that as a free action. Dismiss them. There, hey, there's, there's the urine tubs. Let's go look at the goo. <laughs> Let's go in and look at the goo. Yeah, you get the impression. I guess some of these tubes are dumping chemicals, chemical sludge from those other rooms, and the center tub has a tube going down into it. So it's probably pumping to the oh, barrel room. The other room. Okay. Okay. Anyone see in this one? All right, Pete. Oh, Pete. I don't have to know. <laughs> you, you got the impression like that one was scooping the contents of the one tub in his mouth and just going over to spit it into the. That's your no, I'm getting all three of them. <laughs> <laughs> they, they don't have hands. <laughs> no, gross. No, gross no. is that coffee that. People drink when the cat poops out. I mean, we don't, we don't know where those mouths have <laughs> been. The world's greatest coffee is this. Oh, yeah. These oh, Kobe, Kobe Luwak. They poop and then they turn that into the coffee. Yeah. coffee. Yeah. It's, it's, they, they get the cats. And that's how I feel about normal coffee. So that's just like yeah. something about. I don't feel that way about normal coffee. Place. I just don't drink it at all. <laughs> something about the cat's digestive acids is supposed to make. Like interact with the coffee beans, and it's they, supposed to be. They, they do know it's poop, right? I don't know if anyone's ever actually said it that way. Um, <laughs> the, the coffee scat. <laughs> it's scat. It's coffee scat. Yeah. Coffee crap. Coffee yeah. crap. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Wow. Yeah, another reason not to be a coffee drinker. And, and yeah, the person telling you it's awesome is not drinking it. <laughs> <laughs> This is great. You should buy this should for a lot of money. Stuff. They own the cats. <laughs> yeah, they own the cats. Where do you find this room? Search it. Um, search the bodies of the crab-like yeah. things. And they had earrings on. We knew the brains. The ones that he didn't stick with the arrow or he didn't fry. Or... Yeah. You might be able to take the brains from organ banks. <laughs> <laughs> To deposit these yeah, outside of the, the dead bodies and the alchemical sludge in the tub, you guys don't find anything. Okay, we're in the treasure bundles. <laughs> yeah, right. yeah, there's double doors here. Okay, we're gonna listen to that door. Yeah, as you approach those doors, uh, you die. Uh, uh, what languages do you speak? 
I speak uh, yeah, all of them. No, I don't speak all of them. Uh, I'll be back to you momentarily on that. Oh, for I've got common infernal goblin celestial and what's J O T U N? Jotun. Giants. That's yeah, I got oh. that one there. I love it by Jotun. It's just regular common, but you see it really deep and loud. <laughs> yes, I, I speak. Uh, I sp I speak celestial, common, dwarven, elven, goblin, sign language, Sylvan, and Verizian. I speak common, draconic, abyssal, dwarven, and half. In abyssal, on that door, if someone has scratched or kind of carved the, um, going across like an arc across the door, it says visitors should be, visitors should be heard, not seen. When we enough noise, they should have heard us. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say. It is the gap. Um, so we were definitely heard. Check that out. Is that a trap or a glyph or anything like that, or is it just scratched in there and not magical? Uh, detect magic on it. Less. Uh, okay, we'll do. I detected for magic. Thirty-one looking for traps. I do not heighten it. I did. Fine. <laughs> uh, yeah, I just detecting to see whether there's magic. Oh, if it, yeah, I'm not going to heighten it until. But who's more? Who's more? Don't make us chew. Um, you don't detect any magic. Um, you do not detect any traps on the store. Okay. Mm, I do um, mention. Right, to, right, I do right, mention right. to everybody is like there's no there's no magic emanating from the door. But something that we might want to consider is that intellect of ours, those brain creatures that we've been fighting, can go invisible at will. So maybe there's something here that it's a lot only allows invisible creatures to pass, where there's some trap on the other side. Okay. I don't detect any traps, so. Okay. And with 31, did I hear anything on the other side? No. Okay. All right. I swarm up and I'm open the door and going in. Because it's what we do. That's what we do. Somebody's got to do it. So you open the door and you see a hallway beyond filled with stat with ancient dwarven statues. Hello, statue. Um, Did it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go this, place is, uh, this place is obviously dedicated to the dwarven god of fun. Yeah. So I step in. Here's that green one. What is that? Just another statue. Sure it is. Yeah, no, <laughs> that's why it's green. Slightly different than all right. the others. And <laughs> moving, <laughs> it's following you with its eyes. Mm -hmm. you, yeah, you you step in. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yes, what is it? Make a lot of noise so you're heard. But they can see me and that's what you're seeing. Oh, okay. Okay, the, the second you step in. Dark over your head. Dark yeah. can't see them, they can't see me. That won't work out well. Dark comes flying out at you. You said a dark. Wink. Um, I don't think you even dodged this one. Not for that, I don't. There's a 45 hit? Yeah, I'm thinking the 45 does it's hit. Close. Now, now get this. It's not a critical hit against him. <laughs> yeah, it's not a crit, but it's free. Damn, dude. It would crit anyone else, but... <laughs> and 
I need it would be a, like a hyper mega crit to me. Four, uh, this dart hits you, and then I'll need a fourth save. Good boy. That's trouble. That'll make it. Yeah. Oh, 37. That will, that will, that will make it. I won. <laughs> <laughs> so actually, you know what? I only did 11 points of damage, so I'm raising my shield. That does nothing. Doesn't even really hit. Boom. Okay. Because uh, the first 15 the goes away. Yep. <clears throat> okay. Let me. Just like that. He will stay in the mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. hallway. Let's see. Where'd that dart come from? One of the statues. But the green one. Um, another another statue shoots a dart at you. Shit. That hits. What are they rolling? Can I use the last one? <laughs> it was so good. He just rolled a 19 and an 18. Those are all hits. Those were the the natties. Yeah, you did. You made the point save again. Um, what was that the whole goal of that? So eleven damage. Eleven damage because I used your reaction. My reaction. Um, you can be fresh as long as you're in the hallway. You're going to get these. Things are going to be, you're going to be hit from every direction. And it's the statues doing it. Yes. Okay. I'm back in. I'm noping out of there. Um, I got an idea. I got an. I got an idea too. Let's hear yours first. I have no idea. I might um, have an idea, depending on what your ideas are. Okay. I was going to dimension door to here behind this statue. And then knock this one over, come to this one, knock it over, come to this one, knock it over. Just kind of like stay behind them. Okay. And push them down, knock them, knock them over so they're face down. Well, it said something about you can't need to be heard, not seen. Mm -hmm. You can't so open how, stealth. How you can do you, stealth. I can do stealth, but I can not everyone can do stealth. stealth I can do invisibility sphere. You can do invisibility sphere? You have that? Yeah. All targets are invisible except to each other as long as they remain within the spell's area. I can also heighten it so that the spell's area is as a 15 foot diameter uh, radius around me. You need the 10 foot. That yeah. would be fine. You don't have to heighten it. You think 10 foot would be enough? Yep. Yeah. We're all, gonna, the center. we're all going to stick within five feet of you. Let's have a look, see, shall so we? Right there. So what? What are we going to do once we get in there? They can find statues. Well, we're going to look to see if there's some other way. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The 10 foot will work fine. All right. Stick close, boys. We're going in. Is it 10 foot radius? Yeah. Can you guys see the. No. No. Oh, hold on a second. I can see it. Steve, can you make it so it's visible to everybody? Make it visible. Show us your radius. I want to go in first. What like to do? Um, his aura is visible. Oh, yeah, we see it up there. That'll work. The yellow. Should I do any to change the color for you guys? No, uh, no, no. Leave it, leave it like that. I'm already Let's changing. Get on the zoom thing. Here, move to where I was. Move right there. Okay. So I'm going to step in here before anybody else does. So I'm still in in the invisibility right. sphere, but I'm in the room. Do these things shoot at me? No. Okay. <laughs> so, all right. Now the rest of us stay. We're gonna all stay within. Yeah. So why don't you let me move first, and then you guys just stay with me? Okay, move somewhere. There's some spaces down at the bottom. Wait. Well, Zach, move up with him real quick. I can move his. So I'm gonna keep moving his. Okay. Okay. Keep moving. Uh, feel here. Come up here. There we go. Actually, I want to be towards the front. Okay, move, everyone move five feet. Okay. 
you guys enter the you know enter this corridor and you're walking between rows of friendly smiling looking wards but you can see where they were fun size they weren't fun yeah, at all yeah. you, know, <laughs> you, you can see where like, holes have been put in mm -hmm. you know Hey, hey, we're moving five feet. Five feet. Okay, it looks like it goes around the corner. There's a everyone, door to the left. There's a, it looks like there's a corridor down to the far south. There's another door. Right, everyone move the, five feet. Yeah. Everyone move five feet. Keep up, Zach. <laughs> Same. Okay, five feet. And then I'm gonna go check this door out. Everybody stay there. Five feet one more time and then and then yeah, yeah, check it out. Okay. I'm gonna come down a little more. Zach, come on down one more. Yeah, check out that door. So 23 looking for traps. I'm pretty sure there's none. I you've seen these enough. You you you're pretty sure it's one of those dick move doors and nothing. Dick <laughs> okay. okay. move. <laughs> Stick door. <laughs> Everyone move down five feet. That's what we need to get. We need to get. Yeah. Uh, Why don't we all just move down to like here? Let's let's move to here. Okay. Well, well yeah. It's <laughs> not terrifying that would be because you, you you guys really don't know how far. Uh -uh, that no, is. We're, no, 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 no. We're like shuffling. <laughs> we're only, <laughs> shuffling right next to yeah. Five feet. Okay. I'm gonna we go straight to down. Five feet down, guys. Perception. You're fine. <laughs> 21. I think that's this one's. Another dig door. The, the oh south door. Yeah, it is. Okay. <laughs> All right. I think okay. my visor's one on the map. Five feet to the uh, right. Five feet right. Okay. Looking at those doors. Double doors. Why don't you do a perception and listen? Last five foot more. Or no, the last stay there. You do a, you do a Let's come back to this where the answer go to here. Max, he's going to step up first and just listen. Oh, okay. I'm going to check the traps just because um, he's better at perception. The answer come back for a second. Or yeah. unless you don't. Just, want, yeah, you're going to move up and you're going to move back. So just do yeah, a perception. So, there's a, so, then, yeah. so I'm looking for traps. You got a 38. Mm. I think it's fudge. And he listens. I only got 23. 23 for listening. Okay, go ahead and move up there and I'll be up there. You put your ear up against the doors. Um, mm. You can hear. You think you maybe hear, hear movement inside. You can hear a low hum. Um, there's a fight behind this door. <laughs> okay. If you, uh, and the doors probably don't go, you know, like completely flush to the floor. Uh, you think there might be a little bit of flickering light coming underneath. from underneath the doors? Can he start thinking now? Or ready in action this thing? So that you're ready in action so that if he sees someone, he starts singing. He can spend, you spend two actions for ready in action. So ready in action. So that would be. So you know, his, his action is two actions to get ready to sing as soon as the doors open and then as soon as the doors open, he's singing. Yeah, I guess that would work that way. It's okay. the way we'd like it to work. That's what we're hoping. Yeah. So he's going to do that. Right. I mean, I know normally you can't start singing unless you're in initiative, but yeah, we. It doesn't would, make physical sense if you know there's going to be a combat in this next room. Why he couldn't start singing beforehand? To I, mean, I would say you guys could time it so that he starts singing the second you push those doors. Right. Away. Right. Right. Yeah. Um, this time maybe we're not going to take it from Twisted Sister. Okay. When when the door is open, everyone charge into the door so we're not out in this hallway. 
because of the yeah we would be because we want to stay invisible, invisible for as long as possible right well when the door is open less you want to move uh five ten fifteen feet in you got it and we're all going to kind of stay with we're you all going to move 15 well, feet we're, 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 as ever in there won't be able to see it right so as soon as he opens the doors he's going to start singing and we're going to move 15 feet in actually hang on 15 feet past the door or 15 feet from where we are now? 15 feet from where you are now. Okay, got it. So everybody gets out That'll of the get me in the other room from where I'm at. Got it. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. the way the I mean technically, you're all kind of readying actions to move when he moves. Right. You know. Actually, I haven't taken stuff yet. So. And I think if you're all around me, Mm -hmm. As long as everyone's around me, I'm casting blessings mm -hmm. as we go in, which affects everyone within five feet. So that way, get all of us. Okay. I think with lessons and visibility here, you guys can actually see each other. We can see yeah, we each can, other. As long as we stay inside, yeah. We just don't know how far we, you know, how far 10 feet is from and We don't know if something else in there can see us. The, the, the term invisibility hamster ball. Just, it, it, yeah. <laughs> so, am I still raging? No. no. Okay. You don't so have to rage. I ready that? You're just a little irked. I, I, I think yeah, I think that that you have to do your first round. Your first round, yeah, because you're going to be, so be moving yeah. 15 right. feet. Right. You're ready, right. Right. right? So open those doors. <clears throat> and everyone move 15 feet. Okay, uh, you guys start moving in. Um, I mean, the doors are going to charge in. Yeah. The doors open, and there's a creature at the far end of the room. Okay, there's a creature at the far end of the room. Um, two, three, four, five. That's all this, yeah. <clears throat> oh, well. Wow. You. Okay. Um, it, it's, it's, it's human size, maybe a little larger. Um, it's. Uh, its body appears to be covered in kind of like in insectile plates. Okay. Um, it its legs do like the backward uh, bending, backward, bend, backward bend, 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 bend. A, a, seg, a segmented tail arcs up over its back. Scorpion. Yeah. You, you get a definite scorpion vibe off this thing. Okay. Um, in front of it is um. Your first impression is almost like a big, big mirror, um, but it, it some of the components <clears throat> of the frame appear kind of fleshy, and there's there's tubes running into it that you can see pumping full of white fluid. Okay. Um, this must be another. In the in the mirror, the and, and like as the, as the fluid pulses, <clears throat> almost like a like a heart is pumping it. The image in the mirror kind of pulses with it too. I go over your shoulder. You see this mirror. It almost looks like you're seeing through somebody else's eyes. Um, <clears throat> in this mirror, you, you see what well, looks like the inside of a tavern. It, it's kind of going back and forth. And then, you looking at one? Um, do what? Familiar looking tavern? Yeah. No. Not the one we were in. Okay. Yeah, that. Yeah, about that. The, yeah. You can see daylight through windows. Okay. This is on the surface. Yeah, this is. Uh, whichever point of view you're looking through, every once in a while it swivels over and you see somebody's face up close if you're talking to them, then they swivel back. Um, is it the cabin from town? The, Not the from midnight the milk allowed them to. They, they can call people from the surface. They can see through their eyes, start influencing their dreams. Mm -hmm. um, uh, this this mirror thing appears to be a a horrible combination like of right, al right. Al alchemical devices, living tissue. You know, like this thing was grown and constructed. Um, also, as you come into the room, you see a dwar a dwarven body, kind of like this. This apparently at one time was like a a, a chapel. Mm -hmm. A long time ago, yeah. In yeah. one of the ancient stone pews, you see the. Uh, Is that the guy from the wall? He's that's the um, 
the I'm councilman saying, or whatever yeah. from that was in charge of the uh, wall, the builders. Uh, yeah, Colorus, I think his name was. Mm -hmm. um, he's he's like slumped. He's got a big hole in the back of his head. No, but his mouth is hanging open. Okay. And his big hammer is sitting right next to him. Okay. Um, the body is unoccupied. Okay. He's got that hammer. Um, or something occupies that body and starts using it. It, okay, so so Scorpion guy, it, it, he's in front of this mirror, the door's fly open, he looks. He's not seeing you guys right now. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's just it's just uh yeah. open. Okay. Um <clears throat> so you guys want to Les, what do you want to do? I don't know. Uh does this guy I mean this guy knows something's going on, right? Because all of a sudden the door opens the up and it's, open, right? it's standing yeah. open. So I'm assuming he's looking over at us. Do we want to, I mean, the, mo the, mo the, the moment I do something right. violent. Right, we're all visible. It's go, it's go time. So. Right. We want to get close to that hammer. Yeah, you know what? Uh, we're already invisible. And if you grab that hammer, it goes invisible because it's been carried by you. Right, but we've got it then. Yeah. We don't yet. But if we do that. So if he grabs it. Yeah. I would suggest you grab that. Right. I, I want to cast less. Can I can grab all, that. I want to do that before anybody moves. Okay. Right now, I'm right in the middle of everyone. I just want to get the hammer away from the door. Let's, let's roll initiative. And then we'll just start acting. And then we'll start doing it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And his action will be consistent with him not being able to see us at this time. Damn. 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 See, I always get horrible perception for the initials. That first one tonight, I just bored me like a 40 or something, like 42 or something like that. But yeah, this is usually where I'm at. I usually roll about <laughs> anywhere from a three to a five on my initiative. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. Did he roll the 22? I'm going to go minus. Um, but it looks like he's going to be behind you guys anyway. Anyway, yeah, that'll be perfect, actually. So sort us and we'll go. So do not move away from me until I cast a spell. Nobody. Don't worry. Okay. I move up to here. Well, <laughs> I run away. So where is this, where is this dwarf? What do we get dwarf? The dwarf's right here. Right. Next. Oh, I see it. I see him. Okay. So I can it's like move, move over and grab from right where you are. You can just reach okay. over and grab. Okay. Oh, I see it now. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. I on um, that should have happened for any armor on you. Um let's move away from me on your sheet because it's or or on the highlight you because yeah. So you see where he's in, right? What dwarf, yeah. The door. Yeah, so I got to grab his hammer. I can grab it while I'm sitting. Here. Right. <clears throat> okay, so it's a uh, bill first turn first. Okay, so I'm gonna grab the, the dwarf's hammer. You you you, you reach down. Reach down. down. Run a, um, yeah. will, will, will you grab that hammer? A voice, a deep. Dwarven voice in your head says, "Throw me, throw me a kiss as you're leaving." <laughs> when a deep dwarven voice says, "Throw me, toss me, <laughs> toss me, <laughs> <you> toss me," <laughs> and um, <laughs> the mirror thing. Okay. Do you rage? Might as well use this round, this right. surprise round, to get a rage too. Yeah. Rage. Okay. And then he picks it up, rages, and then tosses it at the mirror. Okay. Um, you break the mirror. I so then know. we need to so destroy it. You become visible. Right. Oh, at the mirror. Yeah. You throw it at the mirror. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. You've done defensive action. Right. That throw. You throw this hammer, it flies head first and hits that mirror. Kabam. A ring of glowing blue dwarven runes spread out on impact, and then a second later, it's back in your hands. <laughs> <laughs> nice. 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 
That's one action. <laughs> well, he's, on, he's on all three. three. He, he picked it, it up, okay. it rage, and then threw it. Okay, okay. You, um, you're, you, you suddenly pop into yes. his view. Yes. Yes. Okay. So do people pop in one at a time less, or does that ruin the spell? For I think it exposes everybody. Okay. okay. That's okay. We're all going to be exposed today. Right, right, right. <laughs> um, so what, the mirror? Ink, you're next. No, what happened to the mirror? Yeah. Oh, it shattered. Okay. So that it, it did what I wanted it to do. Mm -hmm. It was evil anyway. We're going to use yeah. that mirror to like control people and yeah, tell them oh, to okay. uh, so destroy that. Somebody, somebody yeah. in a tavern's like, what the? Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was wondering if people have some control anymore. Right. And tell them, what is this down here? It's paradise down here. And then they come down here and he's like, me. <laughs> 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 So that's Paladin P, huh? Yes, because they, that's they the you, you, move, you move there and do all that. And they eat the brain away, and then they sh they shrink down and become the brain. But as soon as you kill the body, it's like they what do you do, Les? Uh, I'm throwing. I, I move over behind the stone pillar, and I'm throwing a heightened lightning bolt at this guy. So he needs to make a DC 31 reflex. Hey, why uh, are you moving? Huh? I haven't cast my spell yet. Why are you moving? Because he listens. I, I don't know what you're doing. Yeah, I was getting out of the way. Invisibility's <laughs> over. Don't worry about you're, it. You're, don't, don't worry. You're, you're casting an air reflex spell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm I'm blasting him with a uh, a 5D uh, lightning bolt. So I need a reflex save from you. Uh, I was just thinking, this guy is humanoid, right? You would say he's humanoid. Mm, I don't know. That's a that's a Steve question. 38. So that's success. Half damage. So 38 plus six is 44. That's 22 lightning bolt damage that he takes. Looking guy. Uh, I think humanoid actually means like human, elf, dwarf, orc. I, a, a human, a humanoid is a okay. so probably type. probably not then. No. Okay, never, okay. I dominate. So what we do this round? You're probably going to spend a lot of your action just getting seen one because you need to do your. Okay, I'm sorry. Let's. Um, what's what's going on with? Twenty two points of electrical damage. You're doing all the 22? basic stuff. Just mm -hmm. So we're going to be you're going to be using focus points. Probably your first action just to get. They're singing going. instead of giving us one. It, based on your roll, it can give us either two or three or maybe even four. I don't know. Bless does not yeah. stack with courage. Does not. They are both status points. Okay, then he's going to be doing this. So right. I'm not gonna, so Les did fine. <laughs> yes. Damn right I did. What'd you do, Les? <laughs> I lightning bolt. I lit him up with a lightning bolt. A heightened oh, lightning bolt. Action, Les, go. That's all my actions. Yeah, I'm done. Okay. Ty, I am going to delay for one whole point. I want to wait. I want guys still to go, and then I'm going to go. So I'm going to make my 23 points too. Okay, so you, you are delaying until after Castiel? Yeah. Okay. You're up, Jack. Uh, so this is where we need your help. So uh, he wants to do all the super singing. So whatever focus points we need to use to get okay, so to doing the multiple thing and the one that allows it to go for several rounds. Okay, so uh, you're going you're going to spend two focus points. Mm -hmm. um, uh, need to make a performance check to see how good you do. Okay, I did not need to put a two on here because of the feet that you've got. And that was what? What did we say the DC was thirty? I think you said 30. And then uh so you're you're doing inspire. Are you are you are you combining the inspire defense too? Yes. Okay. So we're harmonizing that and then and then using the one focus point to make it go multiple rounds, the one focus point to actually get what he's doing this check for to make it a better bonus. Okay, so the I think the inspire defense, you just you're giving everybody plus one to their AC. Yep. Um uh, Inspire heroics. Heroics. Okay, you you make your performance check. Okay. Uh, so succeed. You give everybody plus two. Crit succeed. You give plus three. What, what now? You're doing performance. 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 Real high. Thirty. It's pretty high. 
38. That's a success. Yeah. If you want to use one of your token thing, one of your token things, you can reroll that, which means it's got to be at least an 11 or better, which means we got a really good chance of getting you a crit, crit succeed. We probably got two sure. points already. <clears throat> I don't know how many he's uh, got. I think I just got one. Oh. This will be a good time to use it. Though. This will be a good time. <laughs> inspire so, inspire like defense is at six level. I don't have any. So Should basically, either. no, actually, but can you remove that token from him? So basically, we do the check again. Um, so <laughs> the performance I don't check. Know if I can. Uh, oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I can. <clears throat> so just do another for, uh, performance. performance. Yep. Yeah. Okay, I'm crossing my fingers and since I'm named home train. <laughs> I'm praying. I, Please I make pray me and, like I'm begging. Okay. I'm giving Dalphira uh, 43. Nice You're fighting for the pool. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. so he 43 is that. Okay, so, so you crit succeeded? Yep. Um, okay, so so everybody. This is the best version of we're not going to take it. Anyone has <laughs> ever <laughs> exactly instead of rock. Now it's like metal. <laughs> It's like you piece now you're like that is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that was <laughs> awesome, dude. How about you? Okay, so uh, Castillo starts give, giving out this heroic ballad that um, just fires up your blood. Everybody gets a plus three to everything. Uh, <laughs> sailing <laughs> away. You also get a plus one to your armor class. Awesome. And then. Uh, so it was a crit success to, to be for four rounds. For four rounds, yes. Yeah. And you get those bonuses. Yeah, you get all those bonuses for the first four rounds. Perfect. Nicely done, dude. Very nice. Yeah. And, that, and that was it's that was all with one action. Did, did a oh, good job. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay. You did all that with one action, dude. <laughs> so nice. use all those penalty, all those bonuses, and start shooting the crap out of them. Yeah. If it's the uh, inspire heroics and the lingering. Performance are all free actions, mm -hmm. and so, one action for the uh, so, courage. Mm -hmm. So wow, so okay. two more for me. So you got two actions. So you can either intimidate and then attack once, or attack him twice. Oh, I'm not that um, I guess I'll no, I guess try and intimidate. Did you guys ever realize this is a major boss fight? So. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Which is why he's doing you, all you, this. You want to throw everything you got at him. So he's giving us plus three to every attack, damage, and save, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And so plus one save. I got a 31. Yeah, I yeah. got. Uh, for intimidation? Intimidation. Oh, the inspired defense. Mm -hmm. At sixth level, we should also have resistance three. That would be a good advantage. No, it didn't. It didn't. Nice. No, it, yeah. failed. <clears throat> it failed, unfortunately. My intimidation. Okay, so Just shoot once. The longbow first. Yep. Uh, that's not quite like a nine. So 31. It's 31. Yeah, just. Mm -hmm. Just a 31 hit. That will not hit. Okay. Fudge. No. You give us three to everything. Yeah, I'm and, and, nice, but I, and the I'm resistance three and one as I yeah. 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 missed him. You can do nothing else this combat, and you'd still probably measure them. Him, one of the most valuable for MVP. Yeah, that was a rough. Okay, so now I'm going. Oh, I'm sorry. I put my number right, so it should. If you do the sort thing again, it should put me back, like right underneath Castillo. Okay, if I okay, so do the seven again. Sort it again, and then just skip through down to. It did not take mine. Okay, just leave it there. I'll do mine, and then we'll go to him. Um, I am going to try and intimidate. Oh, and also remember, you have that Brandian penitence. What's that thing? That's the celestial that's occupying you. Uh huh. Um, it gives me a D six of fire. What else does it do? That I mean, it goes up. Rambian pendant.
You brand the target with an imperial copy of your deity's religious symbol. Uh, blah, blah, blah. That is not what she does. Okay, you mark an evil creature. Uh, you have to you 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 can only do so after a failed attempt to convince the creature to repent. The touched creature takes a negative one status penalty to AC. Um, so we got a diplomacy check to try and convince him to repent. <laughs> Inspire yeah. heroics. Also affects inspired defense. Does it? So it's plus three to AC. <laughs> You're awesome, Dave. Oh, no. <laughs> it's my inspired defense does go up. Inspired defense and inspired courage both go up with inspired heroics. Oh, I didn't see that. Good catch. Um, that's why we keep you around. That's <laughs> why. <laughs> Good job. So sir. he gave us three to everything and three to our AC. And three, three to attack, three to uh, damage. Three to AC and three to save versus fear. And three resistance against physical And damage. three resistance to physical damage. <laughs> Dude, you want to just fight this fight for us? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Yeah, you basically uh, so do a diplomacy check to try and convince it to repent. It's not going to work. <laughs> I'm going to try them. Okay. Hey. Make it lucky. You need to you, you need to knock off all that evil. You need to repent with a 26. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even try that hard. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty much it. That's pretty obvious. Knock yeah. off all that evil. Yeah. <laughs> you don't really care. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> You're not even trying. <laughs> so, okay, so I failed that. So then I have to attack it or? You, uh, you. <sighs> Everyone around you sees the form of that angel kind of come out of you somewhat. Uh -huh. um, it makes a hand gesture and a symbol of Katie Killian burns onto its forehead. It just it screams. Mm -hmm. um, it is negative one to its AC and saves. Might remind me of this. Mm -hmm. um, reduces the resistances by two. I don't know if it has any. It gains weakness two to good damage. So it's going to take an extra two points of damage from everything you do. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, wait. It's four. Inspire courage or inspire defense. So it can affect either of them, but not both of them at the same time. Okay. We'll take the high, the bonuses to attack, to hit, the, to hit and stuff. That's so it's only one to AC. One to AC. Um, yeah, that was actually two actions. If you, if, if that's one thing you wanted to do, okay. So there's two actions to do that. Then the diplomacy. Then I'm done. Okay, this thing. And actually, know, you it, skip. It, I think you skip. You uh, skip Damien. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Because you're afraid of him. We all are afraid of Damien. <sighs> I was hoping to get two things to flank you. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, let me throw some people. Because that usually pays off really well, yeah. Barney. Yeah, let me throw some people. So, so just read where it's at and Damien's up. And... Okay, yeah. Well. Charge and slice. Let me see if this thing has a... I can intimidate next round. No, no, we'll attack Rocky. Hey, does 43 hit it? Yes, it does. Does it crit? It's all my, that's all my pluses. 
even with the negative one inch data. Um, it doesn't count his negative one. Um, I, I'm sorry, what was your total? 43. He does not credit. And his negative one. Okay. So it's only 27 points of damage, 21 physical, six fire. And the second attack was a 42 to hit. That will hit. Uh, for 26 points of damage. I so say not. 26 and 27, the oh. total of uh, 53. 53. But he is not bleeding yet. Or on fire. Or on fire. And it is all three of my engines. Okay, it, like I said, it, it was kind of, you know, staggering back from having the symbol burned onto his, his like almost like shield shaped face. Um, well, okay, so so far, um, some guy just broke his mirror, another guy lightning bolted him, <laughs> and then he did uh, physical damage. He doesn't know what you've done, but you've been awesome. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he will here shortly, though. <laughs> And then I came up and double sliced him. <laughs> okay. Well, um, uh, it, it looks around. It, 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 um, as you kind of step back after double slicing, um, it looks at you and you know, shield face kind of tilts. And um, he, he says, I, I will look good wearing your body. <laughs> you should yeah. see what Bale's really going to do to you. <laughs> <laughs> and he goes like this. And Shards of bone slide out of his wrist, kind of flat, basically making, making, blades. making like making like short sword blades. Okay. Um, oh, the cookeries are cold iron, by the way, just in case. And you can buy that. Oh, does it help? No. Uh, it's good to do a combo. Oh, oh well, this is what I was looking up because I think I gave him a feat that makes all of his damage good damage because he's an Asimar. Oh, okay. These blades come out of its wrist, slices, and then stabs. He attempts to slice and stab. Yeah, see that? Celestial Sprites. Everything you attack with has good damage. There you go. 37 hits. And the second attack. Another thing. Uh, <laughs> that is a crit. Wow. Yeah, with the green? Yeah. 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 <laughs> Fight her down! Fight her down! <laughs> it's not easy to be green, and I'm not that close. No. Okay. Yeah. Did it not do damage? Neither one of them did any damage. I'll give her that. Sweet. <laughs> All right, we went. Dr. Bolt there. All right. Uh, let me make sure I've got this thing set up right. I think so. Uh, yeah, looks sure. good. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's set up right. <laughs> it's set up right to me. Looks good. Yeah. You, you wouldn't have used it if it wasn't set up right. Wait, wait, wait. It says stabbing beast, but you said one of them was slashing. <laughs> <laughs> Just effective advertising. Yeah, what's that about, dude? Oh, there we go. Uh, six, 16 damage on the first one. Yep. And then, ah. 32 on the second? Yep. Okay, so uh, 40. 48. Okay. That minus six. Mm -hmm. Okay, fail here. Okay. Can I throw the hammer at this guy? Mm -hmm. I'll throw the hammer at him. Okay, just to let you know, as of right now, this thing is a plus two striking returning war hammer. Okay. Um, so it's like striking or greater striking? It's, it's not going to do as much damage. Greater strike. Okay, so yeah, greater. It's, it actually does not do as much damage as your great, great sword. sword. Okay. But you can do it from 30 feet away. Yeah. Um, it's up, It's entirely up to you. I do more damage with my great sword. Though. Yep. Mm -hmm. But you're but you're at greater risk. Because you've got to move up and close. Right, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You, you get the impression this thing is going to grow in power yeah. over time. But right now, that's what this thing is. Move to here and swing at it. You can run behind him and do that. I'll get there next round. <laughs> or I'll throw when you. When he throws you. you. When he throws me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm going to move here. We can throw a tie. I thought, no. Yeah, you can throw me over there behind you. Can I throw a tie first before I move? Yeah. 
right? Let me throw time. And if you throw me over next to him, don't I get a swing? Yeah. Yes, you do. Get over there and attack him. You're like coming through the landing with your weapon out. Look, George, you know, throw tie behind him because then he'd be flanking with Damien. No, he wouldn't. Throw him here. Yeah, let's say throw him right here. You could. Uh, you you could throw him here. This the artwork. Well, if he throws him here and then and then moves in yeah. here, he'll be playing right. With right. Okay. Right. One. This is so two. I you take your attack. Swing. He literally like grabs you in front of you. Just get over there and attack him. <laughs> As you're flying, <laughs> you <laughs> just go. You stab down. I've got my rapier yeah. out. I just jab. Try to do that. Gonna miss. Even with all the pluses. Like, you know, cool. Yes. So then that was my first action. I swung um, and he got his blade up and blocked second it. Second action is to move there. Uh -huh. And I get a swing at him. And uh, especially if you don't think you're hitting aid. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, 41 hits. But it doesn't crit. <laughs> <laughs> 18 plus uh, 13, um, 31. Yeah, 31. Damage could have been better. Damage could have been better. Yeah, a one and a two on a 10 sided. Yeah. Ink. That was not hitting at all, I guess. One action to move. Oh, they're 12 sided. Yeah. Three 12 sided. You rolled a one and a yeah. two on the one. I know. Damn. I know. And, and use up zero points. <laughs> yeah. Oh, um, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> definitely. Um, and then I'm casting disintegrate. Got a clear shot. Yeah. Uh, I got a clear shot, despite the best efforts of my colleagues. Hey. Twenty six. Is that your is that the part you say? That is the spell attack. That will miss. Uh, even point. touch. Even touch AC. There is no touch AC. Oh, all right. Uh, hero, point. Uh, hero point that shit. Because you roll a five. Why can't? Oh, there it is. There's my hero point. Here, Here we go. Can I do two hero points at once? No. No, no, <laughs> no but the second one it's actually 11. adds two. It's 32. You add 10 to it with the new yeah. hero point rule. Yeah. 32 adds six. What? Six. Wow. Never mind, you still miss. And that's without the did you add the plus three that you're getting from Zach? No. Uh 32 30. 35. He's adding three from, from him, and then I get the negative one that I gave him with that. 36. Is okay, that... use your tattoo. <laughs> use the tattoo. Uh what I'm gonna do. You're gonna use the tattoo, dude. <laughs> yeah, use your tattoo. Okay, so do... all right, what does that do? It gives just, you more, one more. It gives you one more. This is what uh, you need. So the point. damage is 62 points? Yes. Well, if, it, if it makes the saving throw, it's 62 points, isn't it? No. It's 62 if it doesn't make the saving throw. Correct. Oh, okay. It's 31, 31. If, it, if it was a crit success, or if, if the guy right. crit fails, then okay. he takes the 132. So four right. save 31. He's, he's, making a, he's making a fourth. Yes. <laughs> 62 oh, points. Well, they won. Good. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. 60, 62 points of damage. 62. Wow. The creature. Yeah, the creature did. Wow. Yep. 62 points. I'll take that. That's that's worth a 10. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> worth a 10. A hero point. All right. That's that's me. Ties up. Okay. Ty, you were up. Okay. Flanking. 43 natural 20 <laughs> intimidate tag. Jesus. So the natural 20 means it's up. One higher, one higher. So I'm sure 43 was just a regular success, which means it's a critical success. Mm -hmm. Right, me too. Also. <laughs> As well. So I've given him a total of negative three now. 
because the headband is one. <laughs> the headband, I like that. Um, <laughs> so the headband I gave him is one, and then scared two. <laughs> <laughs> so he's a negative three to his AC. No, the, you know, the, the flat face is just like swelling back and forth. Right? <laughs> I, I'm, and I'm proud every time because it's got Kate and Kaylee on it. Yeah. So I'm like, yeah. hey, yeah. nice job, dude. Um, so that was so. What was your first? Intimidation was his first. Swing. Oh. So he's at negative three to AC and I'm at plus three to hit. I'm at plus five to hit because I'm flanking. Okay, so what? Uh, so I rolled a 32 and he's got his armor class reduced by three. I got adjusted here for that thing you did, so I'm just. Well, not let me. I guess because it's tied to the character sheet. I'll just have to remember it. So, um, okay. So, what was your total? My total was 32. His armor class is dropped by three, whatever it normally was. So, if his original armor class was more than 35, then I missed. Okay. That will hit. Okay, so I've got good damage here. What do I roll for that? You uh, just told him he has a bonus. Oh, okay. Okay, he has weakness 15 to good. So that means you do an additional- Whatever your damage is, plus 15. Plus 17, actually, because you increased it by two with the oh. grand. So whatever you do, and don't forget your 1d6 fire. So, didn't add this. so, so I get- 14 plus 6, so 20 points is what I do, plus whatever the weakness thing is to good. What was it, 17? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, oh, so you do 20 plus 17? 37? What's the 17? Or what's the 17 is the um, weakness it has to good damage. Oh, okay. So plus yeah, 15 plus 2 damage. damage. If you can hit with multiple arrows, yeah. every arrow you fire is good. Yeah. Oh, just good damage. I'm amazing. 17 extra damage. Yeah. So make sure you hit. Yes. Yeah. Whatever damage you do, plus 17. That's a good thing. That was so that was my second action. Yeah. Um you know what? That was only a four to get that. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna go ahead and attack again. Okay, this one's three points higher. So so it hits. So one, two, bring an extra D6 in there. So six, so 19 plus three from you is 22 plus 17, 39 for my second swing. And I am done. The good thing makes a huge difference. Yeah, so the good thing makes a huge this bonus. Is yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, Castile, you're up. So I guess oh, yeah, I'm sorry. Still, the singing is still in action. Mm -hmm. Whatever I'm doing. Now, you don't have to sing for the ah. next. Four rounds. Oh, four rounds. Three right. rounds. Right. Because we, just, we should be dead by then. We need some extra stuff. So you basically started off singing, and we just started picking those, up and just those notes are still so kind of hanging in, yeah. in the air. Right. Yeah. So you have three full actions. So you got three actions. I would use two of them, at least as a uh, for the arrow. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'll do that. Your then. third arrow probably isn't going to hit. Um. So, uh, longbow first. You could use the third arrow as an A. As an A. There you go. Okay, so 33 plus whatever, plus three, so it's 36. Was that hit? That will, that will hit right now, yep. So it's so uh, a 17 plus 17 other damage, four. so 34. Plus three that you're getting from you. So 37. 37. 37, 37 first arrow. Um, <laughs> 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 
I was really worried about this encounter, but you, you guys are going to hit me a couple times. And, uh, <laughs> he, he will hit every time. Every every time. He, yeah. And then longbow second. Yes. 20, 20. 23, not going to be close enough. No. With all the pluses and everything, it's still not. So, what I would do is split back to longbow one and try and give probably Bale. Can you get aid anyone that's up there attacking? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. So I'd probably give it to probably Bale here. He's got the best potential to do damage. Or, or Damien's, Damien's up next. Or you can give it. To yeah, because okay. then he's up. So yeah. give it to me. Yeah. There's a good chance right, Damien exactly. can kill us. So you do it long go on. Oh, yeah, that'd be great. You're basically just using you're your bow to distract him so he can get a better shot. So this, you won't do damage with this even if you hit. You're just trying to get better than uh -huh. 20. Okay, whatever. 30 works. Yeah, 30, blah, blah, blah. Actually, 30, 30 doesn't make it a crit. It's plus three. Yeah. And I'm going to use it on my second attack. Okay. You're done. So I'm yeah. done. Nice. Well, nice yeah, job. Yeah. Yeah. Give me that arrow, man. Yeah. Like I said, you and I doing good damage. It's helping. That yeah. hurts. Yeah. 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 Well, that just got hurt. That like almost crack. makes us do half as much damage as he does. Right. <laughs> That's you know, like the hundred and a lot of things in here have we have weaknesses, uh -huh. like uh, demons and devils, weakness, good, yeah. or you know, something sometimes you, cold you, iron or silver. If you figure out what something's weakness is, you can double your you damage, can, right? Yeah, right. well, things that have weaknesses they tend to have a lot of hit points. You're well, yeah, to figure out the mm -hmm. weakness and okay, double slice, okay. Um, oh. Yeah, I'll go ahead and add the uh, the plus three now because I'm using two actions. You can add double threes. Yeah, because he's also until my turn he's negative three to his armor class. But but Steve's um, doing that part. Mm -hmm. Well, I gotta do this. So it's gonna include the bonus from him. Forty-eight. Oh crap, dude! Well, Chris. Chris. Okay, so uh, eighteen <laughs> plus six, twenty-four, double, um, forty-eight points. That <laughs> you have just defeated. Oh, oh right! Oh. <laughs> good job. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. <laughs> that that disintegrate was was major. Yeah, <clears throat> that took a big chunk of the hit points away. All the all the buffs and debuffs were what really did it, but um, only one of us took damage, and that was uh, Damien. Yeah, I, mean, <laughs> so I can come get over and heal. Okay, <laughs> he'll let you. Uh, this what, thing. Just do a medicine skill and medicine skill and medicine. Oh, we did have an attack for Um, that's an attack. Don't hit me. Oh, that's but I mean Steve. Okay, yeah, like you said, it's it um. 38 plus 20 yeah, plus, then heals 19 points. If 19 is 30, 30 plus, plus 30 then points. it gives 38. So you plus? No, I'm going to drink a potion. <laughs> <laughs> Put one of yours on there. One of mine, yeah. <laughs> you can have one of mine. I mean, we only we get them every day. Yeah. I just go bad. Okay. I got uh, 21 points. I only need four, so I'm at full. <laughs> <laughs> what are you whining about? You were careful with your hit points. You don't have to worry about that. Why do you take the bad guy? Yeah. Is it the, he was plus 30 with each of his swords. So he was going to, except, oh, except for me, man, dang. every swing. And with me, he was going to hit on 75%. He's plus 29 with, and that. Uh, well, the singer did 40 12 plus poison. Oh, yeah. 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 He, and yeah, I was worried about staying close to him. Yeah, so you went after him like, huh? why? He gets felt. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. Okay, you guys. So, yeah, let's do one that invisibility in the game is awesome. Yeah, that worked out. Mm -hmm. well, yeah, yeah, allowed us to, to set up all this. <laughs> and like the album pops out, out wipe him out. <laughs> Yeah, we all stomp on that. Yeah. <coughs> like, uh, 
Anything in this room? Anything else on the dwarven body other than the hammer? Here's the hammer. Um, if you guys just take the dwarven body back to them. Yeah. If you guys go back to that room, you decided not to go in. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to search everything because so far all we've gotten was a dwarven shelf items of 200 gold right. pieces. <laughs> You've gotten. Okay, okay. We've gotten the berserker cloak, a plus two greater striking dagger, the yeah. plus two greater striking dwarven throwing yeah. hammer, which is awesome. Yeah. <laughs> The Aeon Stone of 115 hit points. <laughs> and the plus one striking Warhammer. <laughs> this is an amazing Aeon Stone you gave us. If you guys go back to that room you avoided, mm -hmm. um, that would be our last step. Yeah. You can pop the, uh, uh, the boards off the door. You open it. Um, it's kept an angel in there. It's the booty room. <laughs> Dibs! <laughs> Dibs. <laughs> that, that kind of booty. Not that kind of booty. Oh, there's doors in here, too. Okay. Yeah, there's doors in here. We're going to check these doors first. Yeah. <laughs> so, after we're done here. I think I'm the only one still as a primary weapon to strike me. So I want that greater striking. We'll, well, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll work things out. We'll wait we'll, we'll, we'll get the last room. Um, <laughs> wait till you get the last room. We still haven't got any plus two armor. We won't either. Whoa. You know that 11th level stuff. Yeah. What did I just do? I do. Me? Oh, we did give, we found one. We gave him mm -hmm. no. Whenever he gave us, you can all have a. Oh, a ninth level item. Or, 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 uh, that was my item, was plus two. Yeah. The, and then the, the, the room off of here, basically filled with. Uh, his, his his discarded bodies that got to to okay uh, stuff we don't want yeah <laughs> um, you guys check out mm -hmm. that sorry, right? you can forget it crafting yeah. <laughs> you need to make up some kind of mix of your barrel or something that we can drag all these. <laughs> say all the dwarven body bodies that are here, especially this guy that we know. This, like, this guy, <clears throat> this guy was the only dwarf. one. The other one was a Dorgar, a dark dwarf that we fought where the right. things were. He said he's got a bunch of bodies back in here. Oh, so okay. Behind more dwarf, just regular dwarf. Regular, dwarf then we'll, okay. Then we'll take them back. Yeah, the yeah. Time. And just say, look, these are the people he's already killed. <laughs> well, he brought it next to boat, so we can, uh, yeah, no. yeah. Boat, what? Bring out your dead. Yep. You got a body, <laughs> body. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I don't want dead by that. So next time I have a couple of magic items I didn't know about. Yeah. Fine. Mm. Uh, basically, if you guys. Go back he goes out. Room, um, try, try open the, the boards uh -huh. and um, large room extended in front of you. The air is much colder in there. Uh -huh. um, I, you, even though you're underground, you feel the temperature. You feel cold. Air coming out. Um, who would be the first one to go in? Probably me. Uh, let's shield up. <laughs> oh, let's do this. Let's check for traps. We can put more. Yeah. We'll save all those. We've done the same thing. John, right. listen, check for traps, and then I'd go in with shield up, ready to. You, you start walking in, and um, 
In the center of the room is what appears to be a stone sarcophagus of a, you know, kind of carved in those angular dwarven, you know, motifs. Okay. Um, behind the sarcophagus is a statue of a dwarf sitting uh, in a, sitting on a not really a throne, but a very ornate chair. Okay. Across his lap mm -hmm. is a gleaming rapier. Okay. Um, as you as you step <laughs> into the room, <laughs> although I think I might have uh, put some opposition in here. <laughs> as, as you step into as room. you step into the room, you were your brain is immediately filled with. All of a sudden, you see this room like it was ten thousand years ago, cleaner, uh, you know, lit with torches on wall sconces. Less infested with non dwarves. Uh, <laughs> yes. There's that. You look around, and you are surrounded by dwarves that don't seem to see you, and they are skeletally thin. Oh, okay. this is them starving, right? And, initial. Um, they're they're drawing straws. Uh -huh. And um, one dwarf is telling them, no, no, um, Ren and R would not approve of this. We cannot sell the matter this way. And they all kind of look at him and say, if you won't play, you are first. Well, oh, and, cannibalism. Yeah. Huh. And you, you are consumed with intense hunger. And your only thought is running outside, eating your friends. Yes. <laughs> is it um, friends or is it? I got food on me. I got rations on me. Um, There's other bodies in here we killed. <laughs> with uh, religion and occultism checks, they, mm -hmm. you guys will remove the haunt from this room. Right. Like I said, it is now it obviously perhaps the founder of this monastery was buried here. Mm -hmm. um, and during the siege, they yeah just happened to be in this room where they did this horrible, horrible act. Mm -hmm. Wow. The uh, in honor of the founder of the, of the monastery, we're going to take all this loot. <laughs> <laughs> in honor. <laughs> um, we all honor in our own way. <laughs> It's the only item you, you know. So I'm very interested in the rapier. Yeah, like. that, that's really all that's in this room, but it seems out of place. It's not. The rapier is not as poor of a weapon. Uh, and so, it, it, it's gleaming as opposed to, you know. I'm going to go up. I'm going to wave everybody in mm -hmm. and say, after we were the haunt. After we were the haunt. Yeah, good call. And then. Um, um, I don't have my dancing light. And then, yeah, I'm going to come up and inspect the area. Mm -hmm. Do I think it might be traps set in there? No. Okay, then I'm going to, if I step back, I'm just going to reach out and go pick it up. Pick it up. You pick up the rapier, and for a second, you're back in that tavern. You thought you were in years ago when you thought you were dying. Mm -hmm. And the man that was sitting across the table from you drinking mm -hmm. looks over at the rapier in your hand and goes, Stormfront. I wonder wonder what happened to that. Takes a drink and you're back in this room. <laughs> the rapier in your hand. Okay. Once again, it's going to grow in power, but right now it is a plus two greater striking rapier. Is <laughs> <laughs> once per day you can cast a six level lightning bolt. Only if you're a paladin of Caden Cage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I got it. Then it's a <laughs> six <laughs> level <laughs> beer <laughs> bolt. And um Every 10 minutes, if you are anyone around you is targeted by an electrical effect, mm -hmm. 
you can make a spell attack roll against that effects DC mm -hmm. and absorb it into the sword so that nice. they take no damage. Wow. And the lightning bolt is recharged. That's completely unlike you. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Periodically, just so you're to keep it, keep the sword happy. I'll throw lightning bolts at you. <laughs> he all of a sudden yell, "Incoming!" <laughs> throw him a bail fear, and then he can absorb it. Right. There you go. You're trying to get back the bail fear, but hit you. Oh my fault! Holy crap! But doesn't look like it was. <coughs> but like I said, this is sort of the. Dwarven so analog to Caden Killing. Caden right. Killing came along much later. Yeah. But he would certainly relate to. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they're, they're drinking buddies. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love it. They they're out. definitely drinking buddies. They hang out. Um, so we think they barred the door because of the haunt. My intellect of Oliver's would be very so sensitive to occult. Phenomena. Okay. okay. All right. So this they, is just... they want no part of haunts. Yeah. Okay. Because they can't occupy the bodies and mm -hmm. yeah. Well, that they are just they, they are so attuned just... to psychic psychic phenomena right. okay. that they probably it's probably far more intense to them. So we've taken care of the intellect of our problem in town mm -hmm. or in the underdark, as far as we're concerned. Well, we haven't found the slavery. When the celestial, so the, the, the celestial you guys rescued mm -hmm. couldn't speak because of the pain she was in, mm -hmm. occupied um, By Ty's body, Ty's body. And you know, basically to say she had been summoned by a cleric of Serenray. Okay. That was actually being possessed by these things because it. So she still remains all of her mm -hmm. knowledge and abilities mm -hmm. um, because they thought, let's try, you know. It's cool, we'll try this. Yeah. 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 Um, she imprinted in you um, the slave, where the, where the Duergar slaver, and, and where the slavers were. Okay. The slavers were dealing with the mind, intellectual powers. Intellect of ours. Um, you kind of get the impression mm -hmm. that okay, the Scarlet Triad has come into the area. There, they are working deals with both the undead dragon, dragon. Mm -hmm. which is surrounding yep. Kevlar and all Still one side, dealt with. Uh, but they can't get in. The intellect devourers could get in, lower the defenses. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of like a three way uh, alliance. Mm -hmm. So we've taken care of one part mm -hmm. of the three way. Now we got to take care of the undead dragon. Well, you see, you, uh, in, in your mind, you know where the slavers okay. are. Okay. So we might be able to take care of them without messing with the dragon. Um, the I can't remember her name. Uh, Aloysius exits. A -U. Is that, is that sort of called Storm Bolt? Storm Front. Storm Front. Just to reach back. The Celestial thanks you. Mm -hmm. And, um, Oh, I thank the Celestial for being super helpful and putting Caden Kaylee on that guy's forehead. Okay, um, quick complaint Afel about your weapon. Afel Afel yeah, <laughs> really. Aphelio, she thanks you. Mm -hmm. um, she, she can now return to her own plane. Um, okay. When you guys leave, uh -huh. one thing you do notice, though, as we're team. destroying all this equipment and all the barrels, mm -hmm. and we're there's nothing oh, right, right. right when we leave here. When you leave, though, as you go back, right, right your step, the jail cell that you guys locked the uh, spider chicken mm -hmm. empty. 
She noped out of there? That line. Well, if, if I was her, I would have. It's empty, but it's still locked. Hmm. Can you teleport? Uh, maybe. Or phase, or invisible, or... Well, after, after you guys wrap up everything and climb back into your boat, you uh, row your way back to Old <clears throat> Bar. Mm -hmm. And um, like I said, we're taking any dwarven bodies we find mm -hmm. with us mm -hmm. um, for proper burial, right? Whatever. And that's what that's what we got the uh, extra boat for. We got the body boat. <laughs> the body <laughs> boat. <laughs> we got our boat and the body boat. Um, you guys make it back to Kovlar. Um Dock district is empty at this time of night. Um, you, you managed to. Flag down some people maybe to help you unload the body. Bring out your dead. <laughs> Bring out your dead. Out your dead. Well, no, we, we, we brought your dead. They're like, you, you want me to watch <laughs> A body boat? A body boat? Sure. Told it. you we need one. It's a boat. It's got bodies in it. It's a body um, boat. Uh, you, you guys unload the body boat and um, <laughs> head back into town. You hopefully. That needs to be the name of this video. <laughs> the body boat, body boat. <laughs> somebody, somebody empty the body boat. <laughs> somebody empty the body boat. <laughs> Whose turn is it to empty the body boat? <laughs> uh, you, you guys, you know, uh, tie up your your boat and, and the body boat, and, uh, head, head back into town. Uh, Pargol Long Raid. Uh, Actually, uh, or Kelda, Kelda, Elder. Kelda. As, yeah. as you guys you know, um, walk down the dock back towards the, the, the lights of the city, first thing she said, she's like, I heard there's someone down with the body boat. Did you see that? Did you see that? Did you see that? We have laws here. <laughs> um, uh, you, We're you, guys, done. you guys walk uh, down the dock, yeah. um, congratulating each other, glad to get on the back. Any, any of the town, you disappear in, into the warm lights of Kovlar. Your two boats sit there empty, bumping against the dock um, for a few minutes. A spider. For his boat, through, he called dibs on. No, a no. spider comes <laughs> crawling up from underneath the sea, climbs the rope onto the dock. <laughs> Well, um, pretty soon, uh, a, a beautiful woman stands there, uh -huh. looking to make sure no one's around. And spider no. legs spring up out of her back, <laughs> and she scuttles up a wall and disappears. <laughs> Congratulations, everyone has made 13 levels. Woo! Woo yes. Okay, real quick, storm front, plus your rate of striking. What's two greater striking? Is it a 66? So I'll take that. No, 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 no. So, oh, yeah, lightning bolt. No, no, yeah. Um, no more than that. It's a sixth level lightning bolt. Um, that's going to be a number of D12s. That's even better. 37. 37 <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's 37. <laughs> uh, okay. A first level, or a third level lightning bolt does 4 D12. Um, heightened. It goes up by 1d12 for every level. So it's four, 67. It starts out with four, right? Mm -hmm. Interesting. So third, 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 level, third level is four. Fourth level is five. Six, seven. Or no, oh, it's only four, six, five, six. So it's seven. Seven, 12 seven. And what's the DC on it? That's yours. It's uh, whatever my DC it's, is. It'll be your class DC. My class DC. Since you're not really a spellcaster. Right. I, I really like that part of characters. Mm -hmm. Anytime you need a DC for something you do, it, it's, it's your, class, your DC. class DC. Okay. And then, uh, okay, it does that once per day. Right. And then unless, every. Unless. Unless uh, ink recharges it. <laughs> yeah. Every I throw a lightning bolt at him right now. So right now. Once every 10 minutes or once per combat, basically. Mm -hmm. if, if 
you or somebody else in the party is targeted or, um, with an electrical spell. with electrical uh, and, uh, you'd have to be electrical within, effect you have to be within 30 feet of them um you can make basically make a you're making a, a an attack roll against the spells dc and if you succeed you divert the electricity in, in, into your sword keeping them from harm and recharging your lightning bolt. Okay. Now, when you say recharging the lightning bolt, can he cast that more than once a day then if it's recharged? You, you, you'd be able to cast it again. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, if I use it, yep. and then the next combat, someone hits the lightning bolt and I absorb it, right. and I get to go around and send that. Less recharges it for you. You know, like I said, you can eat around it. Like I said, this. Okay. Uh, Okay, the lightning bolt is a two-action okay. thing. Uh, the other thing is a reaction. So if you've already used oh, up your reaction, reaction yeah. it, it wouldn't work. Okay. So the guy that told me that mm -hmm. was Caden Carey. Yeah. <laughs> That's who I've always assumed I was talking to at the bar at the last time. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> What's the age? Why's their it's, middle name always H? <laughs> <laughs> What's the H stand for? I want to know. It's a heck of a guy. Mm -hmm. yeah, I mean. Okay, and we're done for the night. Yep. I'm trying to work. Items in that grow with every everybody. Mm -hmm. they, they have a really, they have a really cool system of doing it. <laughs> so I talked to, oh, that less isn't even here. Less is a wee. <laughs> big wee. A big, oh. major wee. Oh, sh he's here. Like she's she's back. Back. <laughs> that was close. We certainly did not order anything off your Alexa. <laughs> <laughs> like nothing at all. No. You dicks. What did you order? You'll find out. Dicks. <laughs> yeah. oh. Wow. I've already got. Out. Hey, speaking of cool things, <laughs> I got. I got. Uh, one of my players sent me a gift. I got to show you guys. Right there. Oh, cool. Wow. Wow. It's a so, like, skull it's with Mind Flayer tentacles yeah. goblet for drinking. <laughs> it's awesome. Who sent you that? Matt Meadow. Wow. Cool. Wow. Isn't that cool? That is cool. And it comes out. You can wash the little cup. I'm drinking out of it tomorrow night. There you go. I'm drinking whiskey out of this thing. Uh, but yeah, uh, super it's awesome. Cool. I don't know if it's on the uh, last fan page or fan page mm -hmm. or. Pathfinder fan page. Somebody posted an ad. So they've, they've come out with the hand of Vecna, the hand and eye of Vecna, life size replicas. Yeah. And I and I I posted I was holding out for the head of Vecna, and nobody yeah. even <laughs> not not to respond. They didn't get it. No. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, well, we get it, and we appreciate it, Steve. <laughs> so just so you know, I talked to Bob today, and he is. We are doing BDC next week, so. Okay. He's already confirming that right now. So, barring any, you know, change catastrophe, then we will be doing BDC next Friday. Okay. And then we'll know by next Friday what we're doing the week after. So, all right. Sounds good. And just so you guys know, uh, I'm going to, uh, you know, with the new news, hopefully St. Clair County will be uh, will be cranking it. So I'm going to get in and get uh, vaccinated just as quick as I can. Okay. And then you said your house is legal once the three of you have got both shots, right? Yep. And actually at that point, then you also start coming here or wherever else we're going. Yep. Okay. Free at last. Free at last. <laughs> Tell me. Okay. Well, if you're, if you're getting, I feel like I've been grounded for a year. Yeah, yeah. If you're, you're getting, getting yourself bad. earlier, 
um, conversation me, you and Steve was having about, you know, mm -hmm. yep. doing that, we might, then I might just do one more Jade. Okay. We might actually role play that last level that I kind of was going to just kind of jump you guys through. Mm -hmm. and then that might be the last Jade for a while and then we'll switch over to your campaign. And if there's, okay. if, if there's a couple week lag or whatever, then we'll probably just send them all Age of Ashes late. Okay. So I can do that. That gives me uh, uh, some opportunity to sort of like dig everything out and, and make sure it's all ready to go. You do that. I will do it. I okay. will do it. I won't even ask. Oh, I'm not asking. I'm telling you. But I got, I got, uh, I got some stuff, man. I got props. I got big maps. I got Ooh. miniatures. I got everything. You know how to party. I know how to party. When it comes, to, I spent uh, when I was unemployed. I spent a, a fair amount of my time uh, building Prepping stuff. <laughs> so, so yeah, no, I'm looking forward to it. Steve, this was acceptable. No, that was a good night. Yeah, was. Yeah, thanks, Steve. This was awesome. Yeah, your very first night. Yeah, you did a quick okay too. <laughs> <laughs> You were as acceptable as Steve the <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, We have very low standards. High standards. We, we don't have standards. standards. You don't have standards? No. Gotcha. You were something. So it's uh it's C team this Sunday, right? Yeah, traveler this weekend. Okay. So that'll be fun. But yeah, that's what we're doing. All right. We all good? Yep. All right. Thanks. Thanks, Les. All right. Thank you, guys. I will right. see some of you tomorrow. Well, no, I won't. I'll see. Well, maybe I will. Maybe I won't. I don't know. I'll talk to you later. Yeah. Yeah. All right. See you guys. Yeah. See you. Yeah,